threading, materials and findings. There are step-by-step -step instructions on how to make bracelets, earrings and necklaces, and the DVD includes easy-to-follow video tutorials. So what are you waiting for? Start your jewellery making journey today. Sarah Elvin brings you her DVD, Friendship Bracelets. This fantastic DVD is filled with excellent techniques to create the perfect friendship bracelet. This includes the chevron style bracelet, the knitted style bracelet, and the crisscross bracelet. Friendships are forever, and so are bracelets. To get your hands on a copy of this fantastic DVD, contact our call center on 0800 644 655. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call center on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Welcome, bienvenue, welcome. Jewelry maker, jewelry maker. Jewelry maker? This is where we help you make, make jewelry. That's the idea of the show. And it's Friday, we're having a lovely day. Um, I'm gonna show you my two star buys in this ad because I've not even shown you the one. I've kept it a proper surprise. Because, and Natalie, I guess, is on, has just walked over and asked about this, haven't you? I'm gonna show you on a black background. I have got an amazing, look at this, it is brilliant, 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 oh, do you know what I'm going to say, best grade aquamarine strand ever, I am, I'm going to say it, this is stunning, I mean it is high grade, it is a bit special, it is pretty full on glamour, and imagine that with the rose quartz, faceted rose quartz we had in the kit with Natalie. Imagine this with the carnelian that we've just done, which is absolutely gorgeous. And imagine it with the tanzanite. Can I show you the tanzanite? That's my last star by the day. Now, I launched this very, very recently, and, and nearly 100 went instantly. I've managed to get the last few for you, and it's tanzanite like you've never seen before. Look at the size of this. That, look at the size from there, without even a close-up. That is tanzanite in the biggest sizes and most beautiful saturated blue. Look at that. Is it, aren't they lovely, Natalie? 70 really carats. Different. Really different. Yeah. Now we are talking an exceptional carat weight. Mm. Except, I mean, you'd only need one in each design. You, as you can see on the strand there, we've got two, four, six, eight, nine on this particular strand. So you could easily make nine very substantial pieces of jewelry there. That is my deal of the day, but it's limited. Okay, got the last few for you. Right then, should we get... Oh, come here, you, you little monster. Don't be throwing yourself off. That's not what we're supposed to be doing, is it? There you go. Deal of the day. Coming up 15 minutes on those Tanzanites. Deal of the day guaranteed. Okay, shall we get going? Oh, now, oh, Sean. I don't know if Sean's still watching, but a little bit earlier on when we started the show, we were talking about male jewellery makers, and Sean was on, and um, we had Sean, Brian... Who's somebody else texting? Sean, Brian... Somebody else. Um, anyway, and um, was it Nick? Was it? Um, I was talking about a very unusual um, toggle clasp. I've never seen it before. Now look at this. Oh. Oh, he keeps getting me to pick up the wrong thing today. <laughs> He's going to get a right little. <laughs> I will be doing it, won't we, Phil? Do you know, you can't get the stuff, can you? <laughs> Oh, I've got, do you know, I'm not going to tell him off because look at this. I've got a lovely, lovely, I'm just move that out of the way. Lovely charm. Now, there are two different types of charm, aren't there, if you think about it? There's the charm where you clip on. Uh, there's two big, uh, sort of very, very big, um, very well-known charm um, high street stores 
One is where you clip on, this is the one where you thread through. So I've just popped it on a piece of wire there for you. And I wanted to, the reason I put it on a piece of wire so you can, oh, sorry, is so that you can see the size of the drill hole. So you could be able to get, get I love, I mean, that, imagine that for a, for a gent. You can't even really call it a drill hole, can you? It's a cord hole, isn't it? Let's face it, it's a porthole. Um, <laughs> now, what we got there, look, you could fit some of our lovely leatherette cords. I mean, that for a gent. Yeah, it's a lovely, lovely. Yeah, you could do like just a leather kumahimo. Leather kumahimo, sort of, and then yeah. Just thread that on. Just thread that it. on. Yeah. That would look really cool, wouldn't it? Mm. With all hearts. It doesn't have to be for gents, but I always like to think of my gents. But I tell you what, those heart detail look as well. With all that beautiful silver goes all. The, it's a it's a nine two five sterling silver, oxidized, which gives it that very unusual look. Slightly darker look, uh, you know, sort of more sort of like is it like a, a patina type effect route without having to do all the work and then you've got all those hearts that go all the way around the actual charm itself there look 12 by 10 mil really in fact that in fact i'll tell you what um natalie could you just pass me that silver chain can i just show it you on a chain on mm. just one half your kit because we have four meters of chain in a uh, silver plated in I'd, I'd use a silver chain thank you sweet pit it's very kind of you very glamorous assistant i've got there <laughs> um so yeah just imagine because this is the big look at the moment it's just one sort of jump ring or one charm on, on a chain, and it looks really cool. That's the trend at the minute. And look how simple that is. Oh, see, look. Oh, that looks lovely. Isn't that lovely? Mm. Now, for me personally, I'd use a finer chain. That's the sort of extender overlink yeah. chain that we had. But we do bring you the, the, the finer sort of um, Forzantina chains mm. and the, yeah, the cable, the Rolo, but it's a bit, bit bigger, that one, for me. Now... Now, Tanya, you're absolutely right. Tanya just said, my mother-in-law paid £60 for a charm. That's about, that's about on average for a charm with a heart on for my sister-in-law. I told her I could get better ones and cheaper. Now, that's the absolute, that's the thing. But you know what? People don't know any better, do they? You know, a lot of people see these advertised prices and that's what they expect to pay. And in some of these high street stores, that is what you'd expect to pay. You know, um, that, that... That is, you know, realistically go into, the, you know the stores I'm talking about, don't you? You know, and I'd be interested, in fact, I'll have a look on their, on their website tonight, the ones that have the, the charms that go through like this. And I'm going to see what the, what the naughtiest price is. But you're quite right, Tanya, £60, you would expect on the high street to pay for this. Are we going for a sixth of the price? <laughs> That's unbelievable. Ah! And they're so solid as well, isn't they it? They are, they're because beautifully made. Do you really know what? Weighty. Yeah. You hold them I like, mean, yeah. use our, do me a favour. If you've never bought one of our charms from Jewelry Maker, do me a favour. Because this has nothing to do with the quality. This is about us sourcing direct. This is about us, uh, and, and sometimes obviously making ourselves as well. This is about us, um, because we source direct, because we cut and facet where, we, you know, where possible, we, we hand drill ourselves and we bring it to you ourselves. There's no middlemen. There's no, we don't have high street store rates. We don't have to pay for people's flights and, and, and um, you know, um, their, their, their expenses and all, hot car hire, which is what all the other jewellery manufacturers have to do. And we don't have to do that. We've got under 10. So, poor, don't tell your, mo your mother-in-law, though, Tanya. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, she's going to think, oh, I could have had six of them. Don't tell her, for goodness sake. Uh, 9.95, well done, I've got to move on. I do move on. I'll keep that chain for there. Now, I've got some Labradorite. These are... Now, if you've got the Labradorite, which are triple A grade in the kit that our lovely Natalie had earlier, these would go great, because brilliant quality again, but they're little flat coins. Again, if you've got the Labradorite coins in the first kit, put... put uh, sorry, the lapis lazuli flat coins, the big ones in the kit earlier, they'd go fab as well, wouldn't they? 55 carats. Faceted. Let's do it. Let's ramp it up. It's the weekend. Oh, oh my God. Gosh. Oh, clearance. They're lovely. Clearance. We've just gone clearance. We've just cleared Labradorite. I mean, why would you do that? Because we can. Ridiculous. <laughs> Brilliant, <laughs> isn't it? They're lovely shape. What we class those as? Little faceted buttons look. Aren't they lovely? Four ninety five. Well, these are going across the pond to Michigan to our lovely Deborah. They're going to Virginia. They're going to Lynn in East Riding. They go to Janet in Essex, Isabel in Angus, Tracy in Somerset, if you all check mm. out. But again, you can look at, I mean, They're look beautiful. at these violet blues almost. Imagine those with the little um, faceted rose quartz, one in oh, between. Oh, yeah. That would just be so gorgeous. Oh, yeah. 
But again, those are like the centre of your flowers that you yeah. made earlier in that yeah. lovely rose quartz ring yeah. that you did earlier as well. Have like a flat button as yeah. the starman in the middle. That'd look really a new, really mm. different actually. Really different. Yeah, really different. Mm. They are lovely. And again, even in that beautiful four to six mil size, so even in that size, you can still see all that wonderful look, Labrador essence. Isn't that beautiful? 100% genuine. Absolutely natural. Oh, Ron and Sue Weldon. My mum in Tennessee is in the lovely Maxine. Now I've got Tracy, Janet, Diane, Ali, Anne-Marie, Kathleen, Angela, Karen, Kathleen, Ron and Sue, you just got to. Do you know what? Ron and Sue have just got 110 carats. Faceted button shape. Brilliant Labradorites for less than £10. Isn't that brilliant? They're lovely, aren't they? I've got to move on. You can. I will tell you if and when they sell out. Just because we take the graphics off, it's because we're trying to get as many lovely treats in front of you as we possibly can. Oh, ho, 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 ho. First, now we put these in because earlier on, if you weren't if you weren't watching earlier on, we had these big rounds of lapis lazuli in the first kit. Oh gosh, they were go they were gorgeous. Now again, great for gents. I know I keep saying it, but we've got so many. And as soon as I mentioned that today, lots of our lovely gents, lots of our lovely male jewellery makers messaged in. And it was lovely to hear from you. It really was. Now I've got these really funky, really funky. And if you've got any of the agates in the blue or the purple or those um, sardonyx tubes that we had earlier today as well. They're fat sardonyx. In fact, oh yeah, sar oh I haven't got them anymore. Sardonyx in the orange with lapis lazuli look wicked, wouldn't it? If you have that, if you, we're going to go clearance again. Get ready. 150 carats with all your beautiful, beautiful golden inclusions there. All that history. And don't forget, if you've got any of those lovely silver, silver, really cool four-foot um, Marrakesh or can't think of the other names of them. Um, of, all from, uh, the other two are from, uh, where was it? Was it Bak Bagora? Bakora? Bakora. Um, they were basically um, shaped, uh, this, this shape of this beautiful sort of um, wire uh, uh, ribbon that we had earlier. And it was from Afghanistan. And I was saying, this is from Afghanistan. So I was saying, there was a, a, Be a, a Bekistan, wasn't there? And I was saying, um, lapis lazuli, because it's all from Afghanistan. So you can make a really location themed piece. It'd be really cool. These are fa great, dare I say. I'm going to say, you know what I'm going to say? Stretchy bracelet. <laughs> I do love a stretchy. Oh, they're lovely, aren't they? Maxine, you said, I can make a stretchy with Labradorite buttons now. Love them. Oh, yeah. I mean, imagine these with those Labradorite. Shall I show you they, these, Maxine? Maxine, I've just learned how to make stretchy bags. I'm obsessed with them. I say just learn, but just learn to do them properly on my own with no, no tutorage. <laughs> Yeah, they'd be lovely as well with those. Yeah, you could do a stretchy just on their own. Yeah, stretchy bracelet and Labradorite buttons. How cool. But then, because you've got all those lovely golden inclusions, those would go lovely with it, wouldn't they? Oh, she said, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't read that message properly. Sorry. Maxine said, I am making a stretchy bracelet with Labradorite buttons now. How cool is that? So there's Maxine all the way across <laughs> the pond in Tennessee. And she's working with those buttons as we speak. How That's so. cool, isn't it? Yeah. Honestly, Maxine, we haven't got a camera in your house. We didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> well, Maxine's thinking, how did you know I was, I was working with those right then? We didn't, lovely. <laughs> how cool is that, though? Now, I've had a bit of a tube-tastic show today, haven't we? Shall I give you some tubes in garnet? Shall I? Some Gurt Lush garnet? Oh, oh, hang on. Do you know I'll show you these on the back of my hand, then I've got to hold them out, because I want to see the light coming through these. They're so lovely. Oh, look at these. Oh, how fabulous they are. Oh, they're nice. They're look nice. at the way, because you've got that mm. long facet across those tubes. Look at the way it shimmers in the light. And the light sh literally ricochets up the hand there, look. up the. Uh, look at those. Now, let me just show you what I wanted to talk about. Look, I need you to get Garnet home and have a look at natural diet. Literally, go home and do that. Because the second you do... <coughs> That ready purple tone will literally, you know, like when, um, like when you have like a fizzy bottle of something like uh, Prosecco or champagne or, mm. you know, a fizzy bottle like that, and it pops, it really pops. That's what's going to happen with this. And you've got those lovely red tassels you can just see in the corner there as well. These are absolutely natural, beautiful mm. tubes of garnet. Can you see that? Ah, it goes with your top. Look, it does doesn't it? Yeah. Oh. They are beautiful. I think I'll just cascade. I'd put one on there. Uh, yeah. I have three, like a head pin, one on each head pin, and just Ooh. dangle them down. Have it like a tassel head pin. Yeah. And oh, just that'd have be them nice. Sort of at different lengths. Yeah. 
That's a lovely or idea. Or you could make a tassel. You could do tassels to have well, loads of Well, you've shown us how to make a tassel yeah. today, haven't you? Or you could have, you know, like on head pins and just yeah. have them all dangling down. They are lovely. Beautiful. They are absolutely mm. lovely. I love oh, them. I like those. Phil's got a satellite delay. He just went, oh, they go really well with your top. We've just chatted all about that, Phil. I'm so <laughs> glad you're listening. <laughs> Boys, they don't listen, do they? No, Bless them. attention. Hey. <laughs> Can I tell you something, everybody? It's like I drove to work the other day. I was on hands free. Said to my fella, whatever programme it was, it was irrelevant. And I said to him, right, I said, don't, don't worry about whatever the programme was. I'll put it on record. Not literally one second later, he said, what do you want me to do about such and such a programme? I said, I've just told you. Oh. I've just said. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, sorry. Um, 7.95, totally natural, totally natural. Well done, well done. Oh, can I just show you the colour of them tassels? They're lovely. Look at that red. Oh. Oh, oh that's nice. They're lush, aren't they? Mm, really sumptuous colour. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Sorry, I just wanted to show. Oh, hang on, we're nearly at deal of the daytime. Can we do one more? Let's do one more. Let's do one more. Oh, well, I was... I could do what? Or can I do my clasp? My clasp, my clasp, my clasp. I love this clasp. I've never seen anything like this. This is really chic. Um, and it's really, really contemporary. Look at this. Oh, oh. Natalie's going to like this. Natalie's a bit stylish, I guess. Look at oh, that. It's unusual, isn't it? Isn't it unusual? Oh, I like that. Oh, now look at that. Now this is, we talk about ribbon end cords, but now this is actually for one of our six mil flat cords. So the idea being that that flat cord look will thread perfectly through. So can you see, look, it goes right through the, uh, at both ends. So if you have got one of our 6mm flat cords, that just exclusively for the 6mm flat cord, but that's the idea. That's what it was originally made for. A little bit of glue in there. 925 sterling silver. Now if I turn this around, have I got the bit? There you go. Look at that. Very clear 925 marking there for you. And then if I turn this around, look. Oh, it's just coming done. Now, it's li effectively, look, a two-part toggle. Okay? It's, um, but as I said, completely hallmark, solid, and I do mean solid 925. It's an end clasp for your 6mm flat cord. And you just literally, I just pop that onto, have I got, I think, you, I think it does need to go that way around, doesn't it? Yeah. So if I pop that on there, no, I've got, it's got to be the other way around, I'm having a moment. I'm having a moment, hang on. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> you are. <laughs> hang on, I had this perfect, hang on, I had this, what am I doing wrong there? You just had it, didn't you? Well, he said I was upside down. No, that is the there way it works. Go. He took, behave you. I had it right. I don't know why we listen to these. I, honestly, <laughs> we're having a, we're, I'll tell you what, we're having a moment. It is, yeah. Now, look at that. Look at that. That is absolute. Oh, I think that is beautiful. Is Imagine some flat kumahima. You know, oh, you get the flat square yeah. disc. Do something really nice with that. Put some because silver beads you, in yeah, it. Yeah, because your ribbon endings tend to have your chain on. If mm. you want a piece without a chain on, you're mm. kind of a bit restricted, yeah, aren't you? Yeah. yeah but lovely. that is. Lo so it's got my finger marks all over it. Let's do your fab deal. Let's go twelve ninety-five. Because bearing in mind, just look at that. When I say solid silver, what is the gram weight of silver? I've got to ask. Is it six, is it six point eight? Six point eight three grams That's of solid. silver there. That is a lot of silver, isn't it? What a really cool. I'm just going to show you again. So that obviously, if you did a nice um, uh, sort of six mil gauge Kumahimo or macrame through there. Wow, all yeah, macrame or even as well. Like three or four st thick strands of leather, you know, yeah. all together. You the leather record. Them in. Yeah, or yeah. you know, plaited leather. That's what I'm saying. You're yeah. not restricted yeah. just to the flat cord so six mil. Yeah. yeah, but I just I love the fact that you could do like a ribbon ending without the chain. I yeah. like. I was talking to Mark Smith about that today, yeah. so I'd like to. Funnily enough, this is weird because I said to Mark Smith this morning, I'd love to find a, a, a ribbon ending without the chain on it, mm. and there you have it. Brilliant. Yeah. 12.95, well done, well done. Right then, it's deal of the day. We cannot wait any longer, my gorgeous, gorgeous lot. And it is a superb, extra special, huge 
Tanzanite. Um, deal of the day, I've only seen this once before. I launched it recently on a morning show, nearly 100 sold out really quickly. I've got the last few chances for you today, so get ready. My excitement level, you know when you go to the fair, you know when you go to the fair and you have that thing where you whack it and it goes shooting up and if you hit it hard enough it hits the bell and you get a cuddly toy or a goldfish, oh, I don't think they allow that anymore do they, uh, yeah or you get a toy, do you know what I mean, you know don't you and you go and it goes and your excitement goes ding, like that, this is what I'm talking about now, I'm talking about the, I'm assuming, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty confident the, probably the biggest tanzanite that most of us will ever see on one single strand. Now, I've spoken to most of my team um, when, I, when, when I first launched this on the morning show, and I said, now, be honest, have you ever seen in your time in the industry a tanzanite of that size? And every single person's answer, without exception, was, no, I haven't. So we're in the industry, and we haven't seen tanzanite this big. And yet in one strand, I'm giving you 70 carats. Now I'm talking about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now we don't guarantee the number, but we guarantee that they are, will all be considerably sized. They will all be graduated and they will be from eight by six to 14 by 10. Okay, that is the graduation of size. Might, might differ by a, a possibly, a, a, I would imagine even be the same or, or possibly one different, but they are superb. Now again, look at that. That is about as as I said, you know, the most spot-on saturation of colour that you could wish for for Tanzanite, isn't it? And that is incredible. When you think this could be a, gen a gemstone that, might, that, that may be, you know, gone it, within the next... We don't know how long. We literally do not... I mean, this will have been mined about five to ten years ago. And this is about the same sort of time that we're actually... This is the, this is the sort of time now. It takes us about five to ten years to start to facet what we've got. Nowadays, there is so little coming out of the ground, and certainly the, the, those that, it, that, that, that that is coming out of the ground ain't nowhere near this size. So this could be a real once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and I do not say that lightly. In fact, I think in all the time I've been um, presenting on Duramax, the first time I've ever said that, that this really could be, because of that size, a truly once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and I really don't say that lightly. This is what dreams are made of. If you can get one of the rarest gemstones on the planet, a thousand times rarer than a diamond in that size of carat weight. Don't forget as well, the, if you think about it, when you have a solitaire gemstone, obviously if you have lots of little gemstones that make up 70 carats, then yes, they fetch a decent price, but the bigger you go up in size of solitaire and carat weight, that usually drives the cost of the gemstone up. Okay? However, give me the price we're going to, would you feel? Because I've got it. Are we? Now, Let's just, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I've got nine on that strand. I've counted nine. Now, if we, desire, if, we, if we divide the cost of the strand we're going to, that's what the price should be, but I'm going to take a massive saving off there. And I'll be honest with you, 69.95 for 70 carats of tanzanite, that big is an exceptional price point, but we're going to do something incredibly special. Okay, in fact... In fact, I'm going to take 20, but let's just do it, Phil. I'm not hanging around on this. This I do not want to waste my time on because this I want to be absolutely in people's homes. This is one of those things I will not, I refuse to put back in the vault. 40, <laughs> do you know, when we launched this, and I know exactly who the producer do, um, that did it, and they agreed, they had to get management approval. This is not a price that we could set of our own volition. We had to get management authority and we were blessed to be given it. This is exceptional. It is... I mean, Natalie, have you ever seen Tanzanite this big, my darling? No, I haven't at all. Genuinely, yeah, is that... Because no, I don't want to put you I on really the spot, haven't. because if you I have, you're welcome that to shape, to be honest. I've Isn't not it seen unusual? That shape. Yeah, I really like it. Everyone is it's unique. Deep. Yeah. Shall I show you on the neckline? I mean, we would have given one to Natalie for a challenge, but we don't have enough. We, we, do, we, we can't, I don't mean this rudely, no, but no. we can't waste a single strand. We don't. Mm -hmm. It's too magical. It's too wonderful an opportunity. It really, really is. 70 carats. Now, a massive well done to the following people. We've got a lot of our original, wonderful, loyal jewellery maker audience here buying today. Janet, 
Susan, Pauline, Jeanette, Carola. I've then got collectors in Shropshire already checked out. There's a collector in the town and we're thinking about it in the West Midlands, in London. There's Angela, there's Margaret, there's Jennifer. Now, how many have I got left, Phil? Okay, so, well, already with the original launch, over way, way over half the stock has already gone. Okay, so this is a really, really good opportunity. I mean, just look at this. Just look at this. I've got to show you just, I mean, in, in fact, let me show, shall I show you that as a ring? Oh, that'd be lovely. It's a nice Wouldn't big it? statement ring. Big mm. statement. Oh, look have at a whole that. suite of jewellery, really, couldn't you? Earrings, yeah. ring, you know, you could just have one in a pen, as a pendant. Well, I, I tell you what I would, yeah. I, I tell you what I would do on that. What I would do on that is I would buy, if I had got, let me, don't get me wrong, I mean, if you just won the Wall of Fame, and you've got a £100 credit on your account. Do you know what I would do, honestly? I would buy two of these. I'd keep one for myself. And I'd make the other one mm. make me the cost of my strand. Yeah. Because easily, wouldn't you? Yeah, definitely. Easy. I mean, look, imagine. Now, the average carat weight of each of these gemstones, if you sort of... If they were all the same size, obviously they do differ. So we're, just, we're talking loosely here. Some are bigger, some are smaller. But the average carat weight is over seven carats. Okay, now Lee and Card, if I had a feeling you would come in on this, if you possibly could, I really did. And Maxine in Tennessee, now Maxine in Tennessee, Maxine has got from Gemporia, um, obviously we used to be part of the Gemporia group, um, she has got some quad A Tanzanite Larique pieces, mm -hmm. so I'm talking mm -hmm. minimum of 18 karat gold, beautiful SI 1 to 2 grade diamonds I'm imagining, and quad A tanzanite. So Maxine knows a tanzanite, does our Maxine. And um, now Deborah's just texted and said, Hi team, I've got mine today. Wow. <laughs> in capital, I've got pinks in mine. Look, colours and shapes. Oh, when we launched this on the morning show the other day, you just had yours arrive, have you, Deborah? Yeah, that is something to mention, actually. Obviously, tanzanite, and I hope you have a... Deborah, would you do me a favour and let us know? Would you message in and let us know what you make with it? I'd be fascinated to know what... Or let us know what you're thinking of doing with it. But yeah, the pink's in there because this is the thing. When you get tanzanite, I hope it's a fascinating gem. When you wear it um, indoors, it goes like a much more violet. When it goes outdoors, it's like it's colour change. It isn't colour change, but it'll do its best to make you think it's a colour change because it'll go more blue. Then as well, you get... Because it's a trichroic. Pleochroic means different colours, different angles. Trichroic means the same thing, but you're going to get three, hence the tri. And that's why you've got lovely, lovely pinks. It's like a burgundy pink in there as well, but you need to get them into natural daylight. But they are fascinating, absolutely fascinating. 70 carats. I'm going to show you. Oh, I'll tell you what you must do. Well, I say you must. You don't must. <laughs> I would. I would, definitely. Get your 20... <laughs> for 25... Now, imagine, right, let's say there are nine stones on here. I would, I would order nine authenticity gift cards yeah. if I was going to make nine pieces of jewelry. I'm just looking at Natalie C. She's going, yeah, I would. Yeah, I would. <laughs> but yeah, work that into the cost of your jewellery. Yeah. Give the authenticity gift with your jewellery that you've made. And that will tell the customer that it is genuine, genuine Tanzanite. It will tell you the carrot weights are, you know, the whole thing about the gem 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 Get those if you can and work that price in. Now, can I have a little look how many people are, are wait? Because this isn't a wait to check out. This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Now, Maxine in Tennessee, I'm that confident, because I know you know your tans tonight, lovely girl. I am that confident. I mean, just you're going to love that, Maxine. Look at that for a bracelet. Just one. Just one. Look at that. I mean, do you know what, though? Imagine. I mean, can I ask, what would you think to do with this? Because I, my mind's I would, running yeah, wild. I would definitely um, break it up and get a whole yeah. suite of... I would use it sparingly. I'd have a set Especially of ear that earrings. Big. Yeah, earrings. Yeah. One, I'd probably use the biggest one as the pendant. Yeah. On a really super fine chain. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. a nice idea. And... Um, I would have a bracelet, even just even one just as a charm. Just like one as a charm, yeah, yeah, lovely idea. Ring, you could, you know, you could have a full suite. Yeah, full suite. I mean, yeah. look at the size of those. Now, Deborah just said, smaller stone sets into earrings in silver. Yeah, so if I move those across, look, those are the ear So if I show you those, look. Because I mean, look at the size of them. We're saying that's the smaller one. I know. Oh, they're huge. Look at them. Eight by six mil. So yeah, so Deborah's saying, I'd use the smaller stones in silver and earrings. The rest I'm going to save. Earrings, do you know, that's an absolute point, Deborah. She just went, the earrings will pay for the strand. Yeah. So I've got nine stones there. So if, if, if Deborah uses two, 
She's got seven left to make, make them pay. Because I tell you what, Tanzanite earrings of that size in sterling silver, you'd easily 49.95, wouldn't you? Easily. I mean, that is huge. Incredible. Well done, Deborah. Can I just say as well, thank you for messaging in and telling us what you're going to do. I'm really, really grateful that you've just done that. Thank you. Um, tell you what, though, my last star buy, there's only a few of these left, these Tanzanites, my darling, so please be quick. My last amazing star buy of Aquamarine is coming up for you within the next 20 minutes. Okay, I can tell you that now. The next 20 minutes, Aquamarine and Tanzanite. Good luck, good luck, good luck. Lovely combination as well, Tanzanite with Aquamarine. Mm. Ooh, ooh, ooh. In fact, I'm not putting that anywhere. That's staying there. <laughs> the, it's one of those, sometimes you get a strand that you don't want it anywhere out your eye line. You just want it there. Right then, I've got a right tree for you now. Now, I've only see, seen these for the first time the other day. And if you love your working with wire, these are genius. They've only been on, the, on, the, on their own on the show once before. Let me just unpackage them. There are, I know a lot of us guest designers will say these lovely blue handled mm. um, tools are a bit of our favourite. Now, these are really unusual. I don't know if you've seen these. No, don't, looking by Natalie's no. face, she hasn't seen these no, before. I haven't. These look, now you look at them straight away and you think, ooh, flat nose pliers. No. They're round nose pliers. Okay, so if you actually look, ooh. you've got that round nose there, but then have you seen this look? Turn it around, it's hollow. So these are ideal for your wire working. Basically, the pliers have got one round jaw and one hollow jaw. Absolutely ideal for wire wrapping um, or creating loops or again, um, you know, actually bending. So if you've got any of our like sheet, copper sheets and, and, and stuff like uh, and pieces like that, you actually can put that in there and it creates a lovely curvature. It's fascinating. Yeah, and it's really consistent as well. Yeah, exactly, isn't it? completely yeah, consistent. It's so hard to do. When I first launched these, these, everybody everybody that clearly because I tell you what, if you work with wire, you'll know that the tools make the job so much easier, don't they? They really, really do. And these pliers have got your box joint. They've got the beautiful non-slip handles, which are so essential. They're lightweight. They've got the spring joint here as well for ease of use. And absolutely, as I said, you've got that curvature. So again, you can either bend or have the hollow curve in there as well. And they're just, I tell you what, I think I launched these with, I think it was guest designer Helen, and uh, she couldn't believe them. How brilliant. Everybody just fell in love with them. They're fabulous. You, and we're giving them away, to be oh honest. Giving them away. Do you know, I mean, I'm a member of staff. You know, we might get a little bit of a, you know, never know. We might get a little bit of a bonus, little cheeky saving. I can't get those for four ninety five. <laughs> I can't, and I work here. I can't get them for four ninety five. I wouldn't mind. I'm just saying. So you know, I have to race off and have been on the show and try and get them at this price. So you're getting a right cheeky deal there. These hollow pliers, hollow round pliers. So as I said, if I hope it's shown through on the, yeah, you can see it there. Look, the domed lovely curve there then you've got the hollow so you can see that lovely curve and bend it's going to give you there as well look if i just put those into position aren't they brilliant absolutely brilliant and i tell you what they're very um very gentle on your wire they're wonderful uh so many of you coming in for these my goodness gracious me now you like working with your wire don't you mm. would you get those at 4.95 i would definitely get those I thought at you were you've been looking yeah. longingly at these I natalie have. i mean there's so much i just think of all the patterns you could do that's what i'm thinking you yeah. know with, uh, I'd probably make a sort of a necklace with, you know, that it would give that you that lovely effect, so it yeah. sort of alternates, yeah. so that it goes Ooh. like a wavy shape. Like when you have that, do you remember when you when your mum used to make your crinkle cut chips with yeah, that special that's, thing? Yeah. That's what you could do. <laughs> you could do These like could be crinkle, your crinkle cut wire yeah. tools, couldn't they? And you could have like two and then wire wrap in between oh, and it would yeah. just be all wavy, it would be lovely. And then it's so, it's the consistency that's, yeah, that's the thing. impossible that's to do. Exactly, because you're doing it freehand, it's, yeah. it's very, very difficult yeah. to get that consistency. Now, they've nearly all gone, half the stock's gone. Well, I say nearly all, half the stock's gone, so they've been so popular. I think it's whenever we see something new, we're like magpies as jewellery makers, aren't we? We're like, ooh, you too. <laughs> <laughs> well done, everybody. I'll write the code down, Natalie. <laughs> write the code down, you know. <laughs> oh, I've got a treat. Oh, this is lovely. Oh, I'll tell you what. Now, I, what I did realise when I was stop, I know I keep talking about. Can you tell I'm excited about being this guest designer tomorrow? But it's the first time I've really sat for two days solid and made jewellery, and I really, really fell in love. But what I did realise very quickly is when you're making your jewellery and you want to make it look different, your your your, your findings, 
and your different clasps to do up your jewelry is so important. Really I didn't realise. Yeah. Re it really is essential. Really is. You're trying to find something different. And the higher the grade of the gemstone, like that aquamarine and the tanzanite, the higher the grade of the clasp you want. Okay? Because that is important. You don't have fantastic gemstones and then have a cheap looking clasp, do you? You don't. So I've got something very, very special. Now, this is also very chunky. So imagine those lovely big boulders of tanzanite I've just bought you. How cool mm. and funky is that? Now, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you the, the, the toggle bar as well. So you can see them both together. Okay, so really substantial ripple effect. It's two and a half grams of sterling silver in that very fancy toggle bar, uh, toggle class with a T bar. Now, let me just, just, uh, just take the T bar away because I can't hold them both. I'm just going to show you what I'm talking about. So say you've got that as a bracelet. You'd need a substantial clasp, A, to make it nice and secure, but B, to match the size of the tanzanite, otherwise the, the clasp may look wrong. Now, wouldn't that look lovely? Because it's that beautiful effect, full-on sterling silver, which I think is a minimum for tanzanite of that grade, of that size, and then a very substantial, funky, contemporary clasp. What do you think, Natalie? Oh, that's just, it's, they just marry up so they well do, together, don't they? they? Yeah, yeah, lovely. Really but, different. Yeah, really different. Mm. And again, Lovely. don't forget what we were talking about, you know, we were saying just that look, actually, I'm not going to thread it through the jump ring because I haven't got time, but, you know, just that look of just using a toggle clasp on a silver chain, it's really, really fashionable at the moment. So again, just, just that. Yeah. You can you know. just hang a gemstone from even the, the yeah. loop, just yeah. one little stone. Or exactly. If you look, something a bit yeah, different. Beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Really beautiful. Now, toggle clasp, again, get a couple, make a lovely pair of cufflinks if you wanted to. Um, I'll just show you them again, because I've never seen this particular clasp that, before, and I think it's absolutely gorgeous, I really do. And again, really substantial. So again, sometimes when we bring you the big cabochons, um, some of our bigger chunky gemstones, you've seen with the big chunks of, um, you know, some of the, 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 the rough sort of nuggets as well, you need a substantial clasp, because some of the gemstones, the bigger they are, the heavier the weight, of course. And that is incredible. I, I anticipated a twelve ninety five on that, so I'm very pleased that we've got it to six ninety five. I really, yeah, that's a big silver weight as well. That's a really good deal. I'm very, very proud that we just managed to do that. Really good. Well done. That is six ninety five. Uh, one of the most beautiful toggle clasps I've seen. I love that ripple effect. I love the way it's going to catch the light. That sterling silver. It's incredible, isn't it? Beautiful nine two five sterling silver clasp. Wow. For a giveaway, six ninety five. It's a shocker. I know. Uh, we are limited on that one, though, so keep checking them out, and they're all yours. Okay, well done. Well done, my lovelies. Okay, now I'm going to stick with the sterling silver, because, again, I've got something really... Now, these are high-polished. They're beautiful. It's got the jump ring. Very, very fancy connector, this is. Very, very fancy indeed. And let me show you this. Comes with a jump ring, which I will show you in a moment, so please don't think the jump ring isn't attached. Look at this. Nice. Solid 925 sterling silver, isn't that? Like, mm. It looks like a swan yeah. wing, doesn't it? That's lovely. It's like a swan neck and then a beautiful swan mm. wing, beautifully folded into the body of a swan. It's a lovely J hook. I'm, I tell you what, that's about the fanciest J hook you could ever wish for, isn't it? So these are beautiful connectors. I love these on the long lariat necklace. I think they look lovely. Yeah, yeah. Do you? I think. Um, is it? Um, Remember who it was? It was a design the other day. I did have that, yeah. and then had a, a cascade of beads hanging oh, off wow. it. So it was lovely. Oh, lovely! Mm. Um, just to let you know as well, just so I can. In fact, I hold that in one hand. I don't have many of these left. It does come with a jump ring. Okay, so don't think where's the jump ring? Why is it not there? No, it does come with the sterling silver four mil jump ring as well. Ah. Well, we've gone. We've gone to a naughty, naughty, naughty price on that. Five I hope all the management have gone home. <laughs> I do. It's a Friday. Let's all hope they've all gone home. Sneaked off. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely. Now let me just turn that around. Let's have a, li let's have a little look. I just want to make sure. Let's have a little turn around. Just to show you all the way around. I'll tell you what. Even on the back, it, it's practically reversible. Look at that. I mean, that is just superb, isn't it? Five ninety-five. Now, I've got seven in baskets. So a lot of you with it in your basket. Oh, most people have bought two. I don't... I'm, do you know what? 
every time you add sterling silver into a design that could be the feature with your little jump ring as well so please don't forget you got your jump ring your jump ring oh hang on let me just not hide it with my finger and thumb come here you if i had another pair of tweezers that'd be great yep there's you oh come here hang on let's do it the other way around <laughs> Let's do, there you go just to prove i've got the jump ring um so yeah so as soon as you add sterling silver into a design you're talking some people say it doubles the cost of their jewelry but five ten fifteen pounds you've made the money back in one piece haven't you yeah, natalie definitely yeah and that's so different again so unusual. different yeah i mean how could you get that much detail into an yeah. s hook into a j hook rather incredible a lot of most you know nearly apart from two people there every single one of you i've had a cheeky multi buy I'm not surprised, 5 .95. If you want sterling silver, I mean, actually, do you know what? I'm just thinking, with the jump ring, I'm just thinking, would you think that'd be too thick as a shepherd hook? Yeah. Okay. Would a bit, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah, would a bit, yeah. I bet boys could do it, because sometimes boys have those earrings, mm. don't they? And girls, where, they, where it makes it a bit bigger. Yeah, mm. depending on the hole in your earring, but yeah, no, Phil, we're going to ignore your suggestion on that. Sorry, <laughs> yeah, we'll blame Phil. Uh, right, I've got to move on because I've got lots to get through, but well done. Lee and Cardiff, good luck, and, and um, our lovely Isabella and Angus, all our lovely regulars. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Right then, I've got a right treat now. Oh, look at these. Oh, I'm not going to miss that, are you? Oh. Look at that. Look at that. Christ of praise. Ooh. Big, big, big Christ of Do you know what? Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna read you three reviews that we've got currently on the Jewelry Maker website from yourselves. Okay? First one, and dare uh, may I quote. So very rare to find Christ. This is written by you, by the way, about this one. So very rare to find Christ appraised, I'm reading my piece of paper, to find Christ appraised gems of this quality and size, fab you lust. Second one, there are two one word uh, reviews on our website. First one just says, wow, in capitals with one, two, three, four exclamation marks. One in capitals says, excellent. And the last one says, totally stunning, really, really beautiful. So that's, you wrote that, that's not me. Now very durable very easy to care for it's surprisingly very hard as well seven on the most hardness scale um and basically it's um it is a variety of chalcedony that's why it's got that lovely 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 sort of waxy silky luster and it contains small quantities of nickel would you believe and it gives it this lovely sort of very rich bright apple green like the poshest apple ever um, often seen um, in, in gemstones, in cabochons, in carvings, and if you've ever been to, um, to Prague, a lot of the buildings have got this colour on the outside, and it is actually quite a surprise. Even the, um, the chapel of uh, uh, St Wenceslas is actually encased in um, quite a surprise. Mm -hmm. Did you know that, I Natalie? I did not know that. Every day's a school day on it Jewelry is. Maker. It certainly is. Every day. <laughs> no, I'm just thinking that with the lapis lazuli. Yeah. Had. That with that big tanzanite we've just had, with the mm. rose quartz, with the carnelian. Look lovely oh. with, yeah, smoky quartz. With oh, nice oh bit, yeah, it? smoky quartz. Mm. All those lovely shaded uh, brown agates we had earlier, they'd oh, be yeah. lovely as well. Yeah. yeah. 14, hang on, that can't be right. But that, man, that size of price appraise, you monkey. He's a, he's a, he's a, he's a, I mean, <laughs> dare I, dare I. Oh. Oh, yeah, and I tell you what, doesn't that sharp apple green highlight the quality and the saturation of that tanzanite? Wow. I'll tell you what's going to look really fab with that as well that I've got coming up. Look at these. Black. Oh, yeah. Piano black with Chrysoprase. Pretty spectacular. Oh, and I'll tell you what I've got coming up as well. How about some malachite with that? What do you think? Oh, everybody's like, oh, yes. Oh, oh look at nice. that. Mm. Oh, Natalie's smart face is just lit. Isn't that lovely? That is really lovely. Oh, you oh. don't see malachite a lot. You don't see, not in yeah, rounds no. like that as well. I know, right, Trey? Yeah. Okay, let's get the pricing. We've done it 14 95 There's missing getting the pricing. We've already done it. Oh, I'll tell you what as well. I'll tell you one last thing to show you, look. Golden obsidian mm. with price appraise. Can we do that next, Phil? 
Right, let's do that then. I'm going to just take your cry surprise away. Excuse me. Actually, I'm not going to give you one. I'm going to give you... Have I got two? Ooh. Okay. Sorry. Oh, right. Now, when Fleur f first saw these, I'm going to give you two strands, but when Fleur first had these in a kit, I love the guest designer Fleur, she flew out the door and she went and bought, she went and bought them straight away because she said um, she's got two different sizes, isn't it, actually? But look, can you see? Now, in the shade, let me see if I can take it away from the light look a little bit. There we go. They go sort of in, in, in shade, they go jet black. Okay, now when it hits the light look and it goes into natural daylight, it's got like an internal lantern inside and it goes that golden hue. Can you see, like, it's got like somebody's got, somebody's got like a torch in there, look. Or like an old fashioned lantern. Aren't they incredible? Doesn't matter which one you pick up, look. You get jet black out. Of, see, look, as soon as I take it away from the light and then the light hits, and you get those golden tones. Now, they, these are 16 mil rounds. They're totally natural. I'm going to show you the size. But look at them. They're lovely. Well, these, are, these would look nice on you with your, mm. lovely, with your lovely dark hair, Natalie. The size oh, of them. Lovely. How often do we do? Do you know what? I reckon I can count on one hand the amount of times I've seen a 16 mil gym. You, don't, you just don't see it, do you, often? I mean, that's a Hannah Osborne. Yeah. Guest designer has Hannah Osborne. She'd have, she'd have them with pearls. But I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you some chance to make spaces of the same gem. Because gold obsi golden obsidian, and I've never seen that, I don't believe, if I, unless, I can, unless I'm forgetting, two mil rounds. Mm -hmm. How are you in gold yeah. and obsidian? And you're still going to get that effect of the jet black. So again, if, you, if you're like me, and sometimes jet black is a little bit too strong for you, a little bit harsh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to open up with those golds. And then you've got those lovely little little tiny seed beads as well in two mil. Isn't that brilliant? Now, for those of you who might be thinking, I've never heard of golden obsidian. Actually, you probably have. You just don't know. So you know Tutankhamun, the very famous face mask of Tutankhamun. You know what I'm talking about? The eyes, those jet black, they're golden obsidians. Did you, mm, see? Yeah, I didn't know that. I'm either. proper giving you a school you lesson are. today, aren't I? I've taught you to school. You have. We're regressing back to childhood. <laughs> but yeah, no, but I just think sometimes people think, God, I've never heard of that. Actually, some, you, sometimes you've heard of a gem, so you just don't know you have. So yeah, have a search, have a look at Tutankhamun's death mask. You, I, it's one of the most recognisable. We all learnt about it at yeah. school, I think, didn't we? Um, but let's give you both strands. Are you ready? Both strands, the two mils and the 16 mil for less than £10, which is a brilliant, brilliant, brilliant deal. Deal. Now, we buy ours direct from Mexico by very expe experienced artisan miners. And you get that, as I said, the jet black in the shade and the glistening gold in the daylight. It is a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful gem. And I'll tell you what, because of that glistening gold, you put that with labradorite and it looks superb. It really, really does. It's the most magical pairing of gemstone. It really is phenomenal love to love you to make a piece if you managed to get the the incredible deal that we did on this star buy earlier on the labradorite are there any left by the way phil there are there are it would we'll just pop them on the screen for you at the bottom of the screen i think we went to 12.95 didn't we uh, but they would go great with the golden obsidians and you get both those those strands with the with the got for the, with the golden obsidian the two mil and um, tell you what, we'll just pop them on the bottom there, look, yeah, 180 carats, and we did get, yeah, 12.95, brilliant. Uh, so well done on these, and as I said, anybody wants to ask Fleur Hastings, our guest designer, what she thinks of Garden Obsidian, she absolutely loves them. Okay, right then, we are, can't believe we've got to that time already, we've got the last star buy of the day, my lovelies, and what a star buy to end on, you thought the Tanzanite was something else, you're waiting, you wait wait until you see the Aquamarine, and it's coming right now. Oh, wait till you see. This. I'm getting a black background because I want to show you the sharpness. Because of aquamarine, let me just tell you something before I, before I put this in front of you, okay? There are different aquamarines from different locations. You might have heard of Sokoto, Santa Maria. And aquamarine can have sometimes, sometimes if it's not really, really, really good quality, it can be quite pale, almost white, okay? But then when you get a Tanzanite, uh, uh, aquamarine that has got a, a really, it sounds the oddest thing, but a warm, rich, pastel blue 
flooding throughout the Strand, you've got something special. And that's exactly... I'm holding a black background up so you can really, really highlight the blue. And it sparkles, like when the sunshine... You know when you've got a very, very calm sea or a very, very still lake and then the sun beams hit the surface and it literally glitters like it does when it hits freshly laid snow. This is completely, I mean, to get aquamarine of that colour, I mean, again, aquamarine blues never come through on the camera well. It, again, I would definitely, definitely get that into natural daylight uh, to have a look at the blue. Add your authenticity gift card to your order for just 25 pence and you've got an exceptional high, high, high grade of, and this is the, bear in mind as well, did you know that aquamarine, way before the big marketing campaign took place on diamonds, aquamarine would have been your original um, engagement ring. Did you know that, Natalie? No. See? <laughs> did you go to school, Natalie? No. no. <laughs> I'm only joking. I did I go to Gemstone School. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, to be fair, I am throwing a lot of information. I'm only teasing. Well, I'm only teasing. Teasing. Very clever, like, I'm only teasing. <laughs> now, Deb's just said, this is my birthstone. That's one of the best strands I've seen. I'm, Deb, I'm glad you agree with me because I totally, I totally, I, I, I don't say that. When I say it's one of the best strands I've seen, I don't say it lightly. I only say it if I believe it. Now, look at that. Oh, and it's a blooming long strand as well. 30 centimetres. Look at that blue, Deb. I mean, March is birth. Well, we're in March now, aren't we? This is March's birthstone this month. Now, I'll tell you what, shall I show it you with the tanzanite? Shall I? Everybody's going, yeah, go on then. Because a lot of you just got this tanzanite. And I want to show you those two incredible complementary blues. You've got the aquamarine and you've got the tanzanite. Big, 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 big tanzanite. And then look at that. I mean, what I love about that is showing just how different blue can be. Isn't that incredible? Both the same colour, but totally different emotional connection with each of those gemstones. Each one gives you a totally different feeling, doesn't it? You know, the tanzanite's kind of high impact, and then the aquamarine is all tranquil and soothing and calming and dreamlike. Just incredible. I'd love you to get both of those together. I really, really would. But that is... It. And again, if I hold that out for you... Just to show, I mean, I've got the white of the reflection of the desk there, but I just want to show you it glisten. Look, look at that. Incredible. I mean, you don't expect to get clarity that good on aquamarine. Okay, let's get the price in. Do you know, I thought that would go for about this. I thought that, I thought, I was almost thinking about the same sort of price as the Tanzanite. I was thinking that was going to be a 50, 60 pound strand of aquamarine. I've got to be absolutely honest, hand on heart. I did not expect less than 20 pounds, not in a million years. That is incredible. Really, really incredible. I tell you what, Deb Briggs, your birthstone, <laughs> sweet pea. Have a look at that. That's 30 day money back guarantee. Uh, I know you've come in for it already and no doubt you'll be uh, checking those out. But my goodness gracious, let me check that, that length as well. It looks really long. Oh, typical jewellery maker. We're over 32 centimetres. We give you a couple of centimetres for your charge. <laughs> oh, here we go. Every single hang on. I did not expect 19.95. You're all coming in on those, aren't you? What would you do with those, um, Natalie? Oh, I think I would. I would make a bracelet, a stretchy. Would you? Yeah. And I would have uh, some earrings as well. Just oh, lovely. Just put like about three or five sort yeah. of numbers. And just have something like that. Yeah, yeah. I tell you what would look. Or just um, a necklace. I'll just restrand yeah, it with a, maybe a sterling silver charm. Yeah, lovely. Something. I'll tell you what as well though. If you got, um, I'm just thinking, if you got the first, was it the first kit? Second kit. Second kit with you today with those little tiny faceted rose, rose quartz. Oh, yeah. oh my goodness me, rose quartz with pinks and blues. Oh, wow. Now, Cara in um, New Jersey has just said, when you turn these into necklaces, do you use beading thread or thin wire? Thanks, guys. Well, choice is yours, really, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Um, I would say normally it will go through both. Yeah. So, yeah. And it, why? It would have to be a point four. Yeah. Um, yeah. <gasps> I'm just so. thinking, hang on. The first kit you had today with that royal blue, oh, that yeah. sapphire blue point, That'd be point, totally yeah. different, wouldn't it? Point yeah. four mil wire, wouldn't that look mm. amazing? The thing is, Cara, can I just very quickly say, because we do need to move on, but Cara in New Jersey, give it a try, experiment. It's like I've just done, have a look, because you've got your elastics, you've got your monofilaments, if you've got one of the essential threading packs, you've got your beading threads, got your wires. It's all just reliant on the size of your, of your drill hole. 
So again, if it goes through the, the, the drill hole, you can use it. It's that simple. So, uh, but definitely beading thread to go there, 100%. Uh, Rhonda's going to come across it. Oh, we got the lovely Rudgy. Hi, Rudgy. <laughs> Deb Rudge, gorgeous face. I've been really often seeing you for ages. She keeps hiding from me. I'm coming over. Come on. <laughs> she said I do. <laughs> now, can I ask, because you've had a traumatic drive to the jewellery maker studio today, was it worth your five and a bit hour drive? It was. Yes. I'm glad you said that. <laughs> and I'm very grateful that you turned up because whilst we could have muddled through, we wouldn't have had those beautiful demonstrations and we wouldn't have had your fantastic jewellery, would oh, we? Thank you. Thank you Are much. you going to come for a drink with me? I can't. No. Go Try to entice her for, a, for a cheeky I, drink after we're having one. Long oh, it would be. Oh, is it one of them? Ten. Oh, would, 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 would we be stopping over? <laughs> yeah, I'd have to. <laughs> don't think my husband would be pleased. <laughs> when are you back on again, sweet pea? Um, I don't know yet. Oh, okay. my date. It's very oh, cool, I've got to have a look. Yes. Oh. So um, cool. Right then, you've got Martha. Martha and the lovely Deb Rudge this evening, so please don't go anyway. Uh, go anywhere. Don't forget what they got tonight. French wire. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, c'est bon! Oh! <laughs> oh! Um, right then, can I just say, don't forget, if you want to giggle tomorrow at my expense, uh, Mark Smith and I are having a swap on the mid show. He's going to start the show and present, and I'm going to be the guest designer. So uh, tune in at one tomorrow for a pride rock. Pride rock. I can't even speak. A laugh. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> If you have a question or a query for Joy Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Ruby is an incredibly popular gemstone here at Jewelry Maker. Its beautiful red tones are instantly recognisable as an incredibly precious gemstone. Ruby itself is a member of the Corundum family whose sister stone is going to be Sapphire. Ruby is the only member of this gemstone that has its own name. Now, when we look at Ruby, we look for really beautiful, even tones, and these can run from rich reds, which are often referred to as pigeon blood ruby, right through to lighter, paler tones, almost going into the pink tones as well. Ruby is a birthstone for July, so it makes the perfect addition to your collection if you're looking for those unique presents, and it is the 40th wedding anniversary stone as well. Ruby itself is incredibly hard, being nine on the Mohs scale, making it perfect for all kinds of jewellery. And we know that Ruby itself is the everlasting symbol of love. Are you new to jewellery making? Not sure where to start? Then head over to our website and check out our Get Started page. Watch the welcome message from presenter Carol and find out all about Jewellery Maker. Watch one of our easy to follow tutorials where our guest designers will teach you the basics and give you the confidence to start making earrings, bracelets and necklaces. If you prefer to simply have a go, then check out our starter kits. They contain everything you need, including instructions, tools, gemstones and clasps, allowing you to create your very first jewellery pieces. You can either watch the video tutorial or follow the step-by-step -step instructions to give you plenty of inspiration. We also have an array of beginners workshops that you can attend here at our studios and join our experienced designers and get a taste for this fabulous hobby. We will guide you through the basics to get you started making your own beautiful jewellery. Everyone is welcome in the jewellery making family, so start your jewellery making journey today. We here at Jewellery Maker love to hear your feedback. So working in conjunction with FIFO, a global ratings and reviews provider, when you purchase a product from JM, you will receive an email asking you to rate our service and our products. This helps us to bring you excellent customer service and ensure we're bringing you value for money and high quality goods. Have your say with Jewellery Maker FIFO reviews. When you place your first order with Jewellery Maker, we'll send you a free DVD and booklet to help you get started. 
The booklet is jam-packed full of information on gemstones, tools, threading, materials and findings. There are step-by-step -step instructions on how to make bracelets, earrings and necklaces. And the DVD includes easy-to-follow video tutorials. So what are you waiting for? Start your jewellery making journey today. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call center on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Good evening, Jewelry Makers. My name is Martha Harris of GIA AJP. That means I am an accredited jewelry professional and I am your presenter for tonight. We've got four hours of amazing opportunities for you. We've got the French Wire. Uh, if you were watching the Late Show last night, I believe with lovely Hannah, uh, she had the most amazing French Wire idea. We've managed to make another one, especially for you guys. It's coming up at 10 to 8 tonight. Look at all the beautiful colours. Wow, wow, wow. Can we guarantee a price, lovely Rob? It's going to be under £20. And how many pieces have we got here in total? 120 gorgeous lengths in the gold and the silver of the French wire. It's beautiful. Sorry to introduce that amazing showstopper before I introduce the genuine showstopper of the show. Uh, Lady Deb Rudge is with us. Evening. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm all right. How are you? Good. I'm you, really well. You thanks. look well. Yeah. We've got some great kits tonight. What can you tease oh. us with? Abalone, oh. pearl, bead scoop. Oh, my word. Just th uh, those three phrases. Yes. That's more yeah. than enough, isn't it? How fabulous. So, uh, Deb's awesome. going to be with us at 5 o'clock and 8 o'clock and the hours in between, but she's going to be inspiring us with all the things that she's made. Now, I'll go through all the basics for you. If you're brand new to Jewelry Mocha, good evening. We are live, so you can give us a text message on 60777. Just make sure you mark your text message JM Studio. You can ask our guest designers any questions that you like. Um, if you want to see a particular product that we've teased you or you want to know when it's coming up, uh, do feel free to let us know. And lovely producer Rob will show them to us and we'll read them out live. So let's get interactive tonight if you've got anything to ask us on a Friday evening. Also, it's super easy to order on Jewelry Maker. On, uh, the phone number is at the bottom of the screen, 0800 644 655. That is a local... Um, it's a local call centre. I was going to say it's a local number, but it's a free phone number. And we've got lots of jewellery professionals in that call centre just over the way in Redditch. And they can also answer all of your questions. Or you can order online to jewellerymaker.com or on the app, which is on iPhone and on Android. We've got a 30-day money-back guarantee on everything, regardless of what it is. And it's £2.95 PMP per day. So even if you shop this morning with our Carol at 8 o'clock, you can go out throughout the whole day and only pay £2.95. If you do want premium delivery, which I love, two to three working days, easy peasy, £4.95. So that's all the basics for you. We um, obviously stay tuned for that French wire. We've got lots of other star buys. We've got Burmese Sapphire, completely natural. It's my presenter's pick. It's my birthstone as well. A birthstone for September, 42 carats. They are beautifully intense blue. I've been looking online. They're incredibly high end. Uh, the most affordable uh, Burmese Sapphire brace that I could find, which you could easily recreate, uh, was four figures. So that's something to look forward to. That Burmese is coming up. At around about half past six, uh, we've got a star by this hour as well, which will match perfectly with our first kit. You've only seen them once before. They are peacock biwa pearls, and they are divine. How great do they look with the sapphires? But you know what? They're going to go so beautifully with the abalone in the first kit as well. They're guaranteed under £20, and I love them because they've got that top drill through there. You can make so many beautiful designs out of them, lots of flowers, and things like that they are gorgeous look at the colors absolutely out of this world and also we have obviously the french wire but our final one a lovely very long length of ethiopian opal isn't that a stunner 
That looks like more than 35 carats to me, producer Rob. It is massive. We could have given you half of that amount. It's guaranteed going under... Under 50, five zero for gorgeous Ethiopian opal. It is beautiful. I'll put it, I'll, I'll cup it in my hands later so you can see that beautiful pin fire coming through from it. But shall we get started tonight? Excellent. Now, you all know about the French wire. Let's put that to one side for one second. We've got one of Deb's favourite, I know, because the last time I was with her, <laughs> we did this gorgeous bullion wire. Look at this. 40 grams of it, which is an awful lot. It's a really unique wire. I've only ever seen it in kits. Look at that glorious gold. That is luxury, isn't it? That's absolutely stunning. Uh, because it does have um, a lot of space there in between, so to speak, you can drop gemstones through uh, the hole there. You can stretch it. You can make it into incredible flowers. I'm going to talk straight away to Debbie because she is a jewellery making expert. Bullion wire, what, do you, what you used it to make flowers, didn't you? I stitched it onto the fascinator bases. Yes. Um, I made a flower with it when I had the charms kit. So I threaded um, one millimetre wire. Yes, and gave it some structure. Yeah. And then that supports it so it doesn't stretch and, and move. Um, obviously, you can use it between your, your gemstones on your necklace. So cut it into little sections. Um, and thread it on between your gems. Mm -hmm. So there's loads you can do with it. And I think if you um, if you stretch it out, actually that's the, the um, bullion wire, the gold bullion wire that I used to make that pearl mm. inside the fascinator. So oh you can yeah, stretch yeah, it out yeah. and do like you know crunch it back together into oh, it's shapes. Just amazing. And all sorts. So it really doesn't nice. have any memory. So once you have no. stretched it, it is um, un. Go a backable. That <laughs> isn't a phrase at all, but you know what I mean, don't you? It's got loads of stretch and loads of give in it. So even though each length, do we know how long each length? You know what? I'll measure each length for you. Bear with me, and we will get that in very quickly. You've got about. It is quite stretchy, so I'm going to say 35 centimeters without it unstretched. We've got to put the price in because it's going to sell out. 6.95 for 40 glorious grams. Look at it. It's like a treasure trove, isn't it? It is, It's absolutely yeah. beautiful. And it reminds me of, it's very Italian in its kind of design, isn't it? You know all that jewellery they do over there. Yeah, it's very got high that, end. that sort of um, brushed metal effect mm. when you look at it, hasn't it? Because of the texture. It's completely yummy, yummy, yummy. It's going to sell out, guys, so you've got to be quick as you can on that. We've got loads more for you, though. We've got some brand new pink opal. Sorry for me turning around. I know that's very rude. Gorgeous colours of opal. Now, how successful have our coloured opals been on Jewelry Maker this year? They've probably been the standout gemstones. I know you love your lavenders, your purples, your blues, but there's nothing more gorgeous than a pink opal, is there? Uh, particularly wonderful uh, for those more feminine designs. Really, really lush. So 70 carats of pink opal. Uh, they are plain rounds, which is great. So easy and versatile to use in every single medium of jewellery. Six millimetre they measure, and we've made sure that they're faceted and cut so they all match that same perfect six mil round. You're getting a 30 centimetre strand, and aren't they gorgeous? The price has gone straight on £7.95. Now, it doesn't matter if that price uh, isn't reflected on the website. That means our lovely producer, Rob, has dropped the price, and quite often we do that on The Late Show. Every single person pays the lowest price. And do you know what? A little bit of technicality, we charge you at midnight, so it doesn't matter how many things you buy during the day, you're always going to pay the lower price and that one PMP of two ninety five. Let's look at all the graduations of colour in this gorgeous pink opal. Pink opal for seven ninety five. It's completely natural. Gorgeous. The only other pink opal we can see on our website right now is three times, four times that price nearly. Just shy of thirty pounds. Isn't that gorgeous? Obviously, if you're very lucky, you're still going to get that play of colour from your opal, but that gorgeous opalescence, real soft delicate tones. Well done to Isabella Dangus. Thanks for joining us. Sharon in uh, County Durham, a collector in Greater London. Kalisha in Cambridgeshire, my hometown. Wouldn't that be lovely? Can you imagine if you... I've got a lovely cuff coming up later on. It's brand new. But can you imagine if you wire wrap just a, uh, maybe perhaps a strand through there? What wire would we oh, use nice. for that? Um, I would probably... I can't remember what size the drill hole is but I'd probably go for a 0.4 yeah and then just do a single strand and, and kind of wrap yeah. it around the back yeah 
Oh. Well, what you could do is actually, um, if you've got the Dremel, yes. you can drill holes in it, or if you've got a, an old drill, um, you can drill holes in it and then stitch up and down into the hole. Oh, that would be lovely. So you don't see any of the wires then coming over the edges. Gorgeous, gorgeous, really gorgeous. Nice. We love a pink opal. If you've got any pearls, um, certainly with the other colours of opal, like our star by coming up later on, don't they just work perfectly together? Well done to everybody going for that. Maureen in Hertfordshire. Good work, Maureen. You've gone for three. You've got an idea in mind, haven't you? Remember, you can share your ideas with us on Facebook. We're just, uh, just type in Jewelry Maker and you'll find us. We'd love your comments and feedback as well. Also, the Wall of Fame. I'll tell you about that in a little bit. So well done to everybody going for the pink opal. But we've got some more lovely things to show you. <gasps> Oh, the oldest gemstone on the planet is Zircon, guys. And we've got the blue version. Now, how rare is this to have the blue version of Zircon on Jewelry Maker? Uh, I'm sure if you went on the website now, you would not find anything comparable, would you? 50 carats of blue Zircon. They're graduated fasted rondelles. They are absolutely out of this world. And do you know what? They're completely natural. Isn't that incredible to think about that? How does Mother Nature create that beautiful soft blue colour? They are gorgeous. They've got kind of quite an icy look to them, haven't they? They measure three by one to six by two on a 17 centimetre strand. It's December's birthstone, but to have that Sri Lankan blue zircon, it's absolutely gorgeous. It kind of has an idea and a look to me of Pariba tourmaline. And if you are a gem collector, you know how much that commands. Let's have a look at it on skin tone to see what it looks like on the back of my hand. Oh, it really comes alive, doesn't it? Unique and rare. If you're a collector, this is one of the ones you're going to need. 0800 644 655. This should be priced 44.95. Yeah, that makes perfect sense to me. Now we've got to honour the last price on the screen. So we're going to take a whole 10 pounds off for you for 34.95. How unique, how amazing. And again, I've got something else to show you. Let's bring it up to the neckline because I think it would work perfectly with our brand new matching necklace bib look at that does that go together well oh wow that's kind of uber red carpet isn't it deb it's very opulent mm -hmm. yeah absolutely gorgeous Beautiful. the colors just work don't, don't they, they? the gold kind of makes the yeah. blue pop a little bit yeah it's a really long strand as well um what do you immediately do with rondelles when you get them home deb i sit and look at them for yeah, a very long time the especially if they're faceted, faceted and sparkly um, Glorious. So I usually take them into the bathroom and the kitchen and look at them <laughs> under LED lights. And oh, we've got LED lights. Yeah. And then um, out into the conservatory for a bit of daylight. Mm -hmm. um, but then I really like separating them out so the light can get to the gemstone. Um, it, it just gives so much surface area when you've got that rondelle yeah. that, you know, you need to, to expose it, if you like, to the light. It's gorgeous. I would definitely be putting sterling silver with this oh, for sure. Yeah. It's so high end, isn't it? Even on its own. Maybe just a restrand, guys, with a really big pearl in the centre there. If you pop crimp thing. tubes in between, it spaces them out yes. and it looks like you've got a gold thread going through the Ooh. centre. Like that's what they're threaded on, is a gold thread. Wow, um, wow, wow. And that lets the light around the gemstone so it will really sparkle and, and you know give a fantastic light show it's really out of this world and i would love mm. to know guys where on the high street where on the other craft channels where in that big craft store are you going to find blue zircon how unique it is have a little look now it's, it works out at 70 pence per carat of unique un, and completely natural blue zircon from wow. sri lanka kind of kind of sums up sri lanka doesn't it because it kind of looks yeah, like the sea in sri does. lanka how beautiful well under everybody going for that absolutely amazing but we've got loads more to show you we're going to go and see our lovely deb off we go uh, remember if you are a completely new customer with jewelry maker you can get started with your first order you receive a dvd which shows you lots of different things talks you through our toolkit uh, the essential findings and threading materials how to make bracelets necklaces and then all the information you need and you also get a get started booklet as well um, and remember also every time you order and once a month, if you're a regular customer, you get the hub, which is fabulous. Uh, we do this lovely little magazine once a month, so it shows you lots of ideas, lots of trends, and uh, everything that's basically coming up in that month, including our workshops, which we'll talk about 
very shortly, but we're going to go to Atlantic Abalone with the lovely Deb Rudge. Now, if you're a wire lover, this is the kit for you. In fact, it's the whole show for you. Yeah. So let's take you through what beautiful things you've got. I'm going to leave you with that for a second, so you have a little look at it. And I will go and get my details because, of course, I walked and talked <laughs> and I couldn't carry at the same time. So you just That'd have a little be look at that. Things, wouldn't it? Walking, wouldn't it just? Talking and carrying. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. It's so easy when there isn't a camera pointing at you, isn't it, Deb? What to walk, talk, and carry? Yeah, I like to think that I do yeah. that in everyday life. <laughs> so we're going to start with these beautiful gemstone strands. We have got here uh, gorgeous 200 carats of blue colour coated hematite. They are 8 by 6 and you're on a 38 centimetre strand. They are um, friends with another, another strand, which isn't on my specs, I'm afraid. So, um, ah, so this is the purple quartz just here, 7 by 11, and these are the gorgeous hematites next to, 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 to it. Now, the reason why we've called it Atlantic abalone, obviously there's some abalone in it, but there's also something else from the sea, potentially. Uh, these are cultured pearls. They're gorgeous. They are peacock in their colour and they're four by five millimetres. They're really lustrous. But we've saved the hero till last. Let's have a quick look at him because he is these gorgeous graduated abalone bars. 15 by four to 30 by five mil. Obviously no carat weight because they are a natural organic gemstone. Look at those. They're so lovely, aren't they? Just... Again, very easy to make something really impactful out of those beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So abalone, quartz, hematite, and completely natural, um, well, sorry, a peacock dyed, but a natural pearl in the respect that it's not a glass or a plastic pearl. They're your gorgeous gemstone strands. But that's not all. Oh, I've, I've got a lot of wire. Yes. We so you've got 10 metres of your silver-plated 1 mil. And when we say silver-plated... Every single piece of that copper wire has been encapsulated with silver. So that's 10 metres there. And obviously your one mil is for your structural pieces. Um, I'll show you the gauge that you can see there and Deb will be able to talk us through. But 10 metres goes a long way. We've also got some silver plated round copper wire in the 0.6. You're getting 10 metres of that. That's for all your weaving. And again, we'll talk through how easy that is to use. Then you've got your um, silver plated copper soft wire. You'll see it's slightly different. Um, it's not on a reel, but it's nice and malleable to lose, uh, use. Really forgiving as well if you're new to wire work. This is in a 0.8 mil gauge. And then we've also got, we've got one more, I believe. 50, 50 meters of 0.4. So your four favorite gauges of wire. And when I say favorite, I mean in the customer response um, uh, I'm, I've lost the word, but you know what I mean. What customers survey. want the months? Yeah. Well, I'd say the feedback was the word feedback. I was looking for. <laughs> point 0.4, point 0.6, point 0.8, and one mil. And if you're completely new to wire work, they're the four gauges that you would yeah, use definitely. very often, aren't they? Yeah. Yep, they are. Covers everything then. You've got it all there to, uh, to play with. You do indeed. And you can have it all at home to play with. So... That beautiful abalone, the gorgeous pearls, the quartz, the hematite. And how much wire have we got all together? I believe it's going to be 80 metres of wire. It should be £42.60. Now, let me explain that price to you. Tomorrow morning, uh, when we go live again, all of the components of this kit will be broken up. And if you bought them all separately, that would be £42.60. But we've got a show-only deal. And that's going to happen right now. You'll see those arrows going all the way down. And it's going to go to an amazing price. And we're not just going to save you £10. Oh, no, 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 no. It's lovely producer Rob in the chair tonight. It's Friday night, £21.95. So that's nearly half price. What an amazing, nearly £20 saving. What amazing things have you created with this amazing Deborah? I'm going to say amazing as many times as possible. Is that your challenge for tonight? That's my challenge. It's actually my challenge not to do that. So can you talk us through <laughs> what you've made? Um... I've made a whole range of pieces, so some are really complex and, and multi-layered, if you like, and then others are just really simple and rely on the, the colour um, and shape of, of the rice bead to, to sort of carry the piece. Mm. So it just, it just proves how versatile a rice bead is when you're, when you're working with them. And rice um, refers to the shape, not the, shape, the size, because yeah. you wouldn't ever get a piece of rice that big, would you? 
No. 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 It'd be quite true. <laughs> so they're these it? Were, it That's nice. um, so you can you you can work with them in lots of different ways and um, I just love the versatility of them mm -hmm. and the way you can get so many different looks out of one shape. Gorgeous, gorgeous, Brilliant. gorgeous. How are the abalones to use? Because that's obviously oh. the hero standout strand, isn't it, just here? I just think they're so gorgeous. Yeah, like I've, I've had them in um, a black, um, a mother of pearl. Mm. I don't think I've had the abalone Ooh, before. So this, this was the first time I've actually had this one, which was, and it's so distracting with the colours yeah, that I are, bet. are in there. It's amazing. And Absolutely every single beautiful. one unique and different, hey? Like yeah, a fingerprint. Yeah. And they sit so nicely together. Um, when I've used them before, I've, I've purposefully separated them out. But I wanted to keep them together so that you've got all of that play of colour and light across the surface when you're wearing it. Um, but they're absolutely gorgeous to work with. And yeah. really easy as well. So, um, you know, it's, it's a real treat to be able to work with something that's as well thought through as yeah. these are because you know you can do something really simple or you can really um, mix it up and do something totally different they're lovely them. and I notice you saved two just for these earrings yeah. down here which is yeah. really elongates because it calls them shoulder dusters doesn't it yeah yeah, yeah. fabulous so I picked those two out first um, because obviously the fan shape is symmetrical so you need to make sure that you you're picking the same two and measure them up before yeah. you you start doing anything else. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. So um, just like taking, for instance, just this um, pearl bracelet, how mm. much would you charge for that on a craft stall if you were making that today? Well, I think probably around £20. Yeah. So um, you're more or less getting your money back with one piece. Yeah. You, the pearls are absolutely gorgeous. They're the colours, the range of colours, again, they work so well with the abalone because it's got the same colour tones in both. Those kind of rainbow iridescence, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. And you've done a beautiful little ring as well, not using any of the gemstones, but just no. really showing off Jewelry Maker Wire at its best. What is it about Jewelry Maker Wire that's such good quality? Um, it's really easy to work with. So um, it doesn't fight against no. your design. It works with you to create a really strong piece. Um, some wires I've used, you know, you can bend them and they just collapse in on themselves. The, the wire that we've got seems to have the capacity to hold a curve really nicely and be strong enough, but be flexible enough to work with. And that, mm. getting that balance right is actually quite tricky. Um, and I think the, the wire that we've got here is brilliant in that respect. It's not too hard to work with, but it's not so soft that you can't make and, and keep a nice curve. I was going to say, design. and very durable to wear yeah, as well. That definitely. ring's going to last years, isn't it? Yeah, Absolutely it amazing. Will. So, and a huge amount of pieces made from this one kit. 2195 Let's go to our lovely Deb. We'll saunter over like we're on the Atlantic <laughs> Ocean. Um, I don't know what, how that works. Uh, we've got a quick text for you. Thank you very oh, much, okay. Julian Dawson. Good evening, Martha, Deb and team. I love your designs, Deb. Some unusual pieces, all very wearable. So true, isn't it? Thank, Thank you. you so much. Did you have a lot left over? I've got... Ooh, loads of wire left loads over. Loads of wire. So I've hardly touched the 0.4 in, in fairness. And um, this is... Somehow I managed to get it off to the drop spool. off the spool. Um, that's the 0.6 that I had left over. So wow. all of that is what I had left. Incredible. And this is from my second kit. So remember, guys, even though you're buying the kit, you're going to be able to make so much more yeah. with it. And what we like to do is we try and inspire you via our lovely designer. Uh, but also, it, you can add your own touch to it, can't you? And please do share those designs on the Wall of Fame. Uh, we would love that. Go to the website and have a little look. Now, I do need you to check out your baskets. A lot of people have got it in their baskets, but they haven't quite checked out. Remember, it doesn't matter how many times you check out during the day. Uh, you'll still only pay that one PMP of two ninety five or four ninety five if you like premium delivery. So best get cracking. Okay, where are we going to start? Right. And what design are we going to see? We're going to do the one on the end, which is uh, this, this one here. This one, lovely. Yeah. Um, so it's quite random and organic in the back, it is. and then it's almost got like a little cage. I don't know if you can see it. It's got like a little cage that sits over the top. Yes, yes. To, Just to bring out the shape. So um, I thought. That's just something um, that we can look at doing this evening. And did you freehand so, it or did you yeah. draw it out? Before? I was going to say, no, yeah. it just 
it was I actually started it when I was on the train hmm. so I was um, I didn't have my sketchbook with me so I, I just sort of went with started the flow. playing with the wire and and yeah went with the flow completely and, and just played for a bit Good so it's you. quite nice to do that sometimes Gorgeous. So, so we're, the structural the, work is the one mil. It's the really soft one, actually. Oh, okay. So, so the soft copper. I yeah. think it was the point eight. Just bear with me while I just yes, check that. Yes, it was. Yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. It was. The point eight. So I'm, I've pulled off probably about two meters, and I'm going to snip that there. Mm -hmm. So that's that's basically um, the first layer. That we're we're working on there. Okay, okay. So if we're we're building it, the necklace up in two layers, so once you've taken it off the reel, yep, it's a really technical piece, and all we need to do is scrunch it up and make the base shape that we're going to work with. So I've got the. Um, that one of the tails sticking out, but I'm keeping everything else wrapped up. Just fold it in on itself, twist it round, and build a base that we'll work into. Okay. So at this stage, all you want is something that um, is quite organic and freeform, and tapers from one end into a wider section at the other. Okay. So we've got that. I'm going to then take some of the uh, gorgeous blue coated beads and pop one of those on. Lovely. So they, that's, they go so over a 0.8. So that's pretty good. They, do, there. they go, um, the one millimeter actually goes through absolutely fine. So it's really uh, uh, quite a big drill hole in, in these. And I think I think the one millimetre goes through the purpley quartzite as well. I don't know why I've put an E on the end of purple. But there you go. So all I'm doing is stitching that bead into place. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to bring my wire back through. And I'm going to pop another one on. So at the moment, I mean, it, it's a complete mess. <laughs> <but> That's <laughs> not true. <laughs> Is it not? It's, crea it's a creative mess. <laughs> it's a squiggle. It's like, yeah. it's almost like when you're painting mm. or doing a drawing, the hardest thing is to start. You're absolutely right. So, yeah. And I think it's that it's fear that we're going to do it wrong. There's, no, yeah. there's nothing wrong in jewellery making. It's all your creativity, isn't it? Yeah. And how long have you been working with jewellery making wire for? Wire working? Um, a long well, time. Well, the jewellery maker wire, I think, I don't know, about... How many years now? A couple of years before I became a guest designer, so yeah. is that about four, four years? Excellent. Yeah. And it's and it's as you say, so it's very forgiving, isn't it? You can always is, yeah, go back is. to the start and try again, or just let the kind of design take you with it. Well, because I I haven't had I don't think a kit with a massive amount of wire in for quite a while, so I just yeah. thought I'm I'm just going to play and enjoy myself to start. Good for with. you. Um, Right, so taking some of the 0.6. Um, and can you quickly tell us the difference yeah. between the soft copper and the regular copper? Is that literally yeah. one softer and more malleable? One softer. Easy peasy. Yeah, one is softer, more malleable. So it feels like this, although it's a thicker gauge, it feels like it's um, a thinner gauge, Yeah, I suppose, when you're working with it. But this one, which is the, um, point the six. standard 0.6, yeah has got more spring to okay, it. Okay, sure. And that one, it it hasn't got as much spring. Okay, dokie. So you, when you when you're working with it, it's it's quite evident which is which. Okay, sure. So even if you had the same the same gauge there, it would be ob obvious which was mm -hmm. which. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to no, I'm not. I'm going to <laughs> <laughs> take um, some of the one millimeter wire. Yep. Now this is probably, I don't know, 40 inches, something like that. Centimetres. Centimetres. I was going to say that's a big old... That's <laughs> a big, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> inches of grown. <laughs> I'm going to pop the, the gemstone on there. And then with the 0.6 
wire, mm -hmm. what I'm just going to do is wrap round. Okay. So the necklace is made up of, of lots of different sections. Sure. That are joined together. So I'm just going to wrap around. There. And you're not using any tools, you're just using your no, hands. No, just use your hands. Nature's tool. And it, it's so easy to work with that, um, you know, you don't need to to use pliers or anything to, to wrap it round. What I will use the pliers for is to just pinch along to make sure everything's pushed up together and then... Nice and neat. Yeah, just make sure that tail is um, squashed flat against the wire. So it's nice and so um, uniform but also doesn't get scratchy on your clothes yeah. or on your decollete. Yeah, although quite a bit of this will disappear inside so it'll protect yeah, you anyway. for sure. So I'm going to um, I'll snip that off but leave a tail because we'll need that. And then I'm going to do another spring-like section here. And I also, in my findings pack that I had, I had some um, some little spacer beads. So I thought, I'll mix these in, which I really like doing. I like putting silver or gold spacer beads in with the, the wire because it just... It's at a point where your eye then goes, oh, look, it's Absolutely. doing something different. It's it a bit more structure, doesn't it? Yeah. Could you use our French wire in this design? You oh, know, you got could, you so know. So here's a little bit of the silver French wire that's coming up at 10 to 8 tonight. Oh, could you work. wrap that round? How would you incorporate your French wire into that design? I'd, I'd probably f I'd feed that over the top of ah, lovely. my wire. So then... I mean, that's absolutely gorgeous. The finish that you get would be really nice with that. Could you turn this French wire as well? Sorry to divulge. Divulge? No, I keep getting this word wrong. Digress? Yeah, digress. D divert? Divert. Sorry to divert away from the demo, but could you put a clasp on that and just have it as a chain? No. Ah. What you would need to do is yeah. you get beading thread. Put the thread through. Thread through. And then a crimp. Yeah, mm. and then keep it plain like that. Because it's that love. Would look, gorgeous. look how yeah. liquid it is. It's yeah, gorgeous. Yeah, it would. Ten to eight, that's coming up. I'm sorry to take you away from the demos. I know our customers love to see this inspiration, so I'll shut up. <laughs> no, but that would be nice, actually. Wouldn't it? Yeah. So I'm going to pop um, a bead on. And that's and our jewelry that's maker, Space Beads. It is, yeah. He's uh, about four mil. Got some of those coming up in the next hour. Um... Yeah, it was in a findings pack, so Ooh, I, lovely. I just kept it. Hang on, if I move it back that way, I'll stand a chance to align my wires and get the, uh, ah. the bead over the top. That's it. Well, um, I hate to interrupt you one more time, but oh. amazing Rob, our producer, has put these in. He must How have been... Awesome. Psychic. You must have been aligned psychically. Yeah. Here are the details moon? for these. <laughs> it has a bit of full moon this week. I go I a think, bit weird yeah, on the full moon. I do, yeah. yeah. <laughs> here come your details of the spacer beads. You're getting both of the tubes. They are silver plated brass rondelle seed beads. Even though they're a seed bead, I think you think to yourself, oh gosh, they're going to be tiny. They're five by four mil and you're getting 320 pieces. So that is total combined. Is it 640? Uh, for the two and they're great uh, to use wow. on any threads because you have got a massive drill hole on there so your ribbons your hemp your eslon as well as all of your wires i can imagine you'd get a one mil through there and i think you have oh you, you would yeah definitely you'd probably get one and a half actually um 1.25 definitely lovely apologies i got it wrong it's 320 combined so uh 320 of the seed beads an amazing price for everybody at home we're going straight in at £12.95 and pence for those. 0800 644 655. That's an amazing price. Have a little look at Seed Beads on the web. Um, give them a little bit mm. of a Google because that deal is value for money and they won't even stand up. So you know what? I'm going <laughs> to lie them down and I'll let Deb carry on. <laughs> right, so we've got, um, we've got a, a whole variety of different textures and shapes going on there now along that um, wire. And what I'm going to do is work it into this section here. So take the tail and just thread it through. So this forms the, um, the, s 
the section that goes around the neckline. Yep. On the um, if you're looking at it on the the right hand side there, so you can start. You can vary it and add in different um, different uh, shape spaces. You know, if you've got any the the the, um, the flowery type, then you could add those in, which would be really nice. Any other gemstones? What about anything? some amazing blue opals? I don't they think we've got a lot gorgeous. of these. Um, they are very, really very, nice. very, very beautiful. Please, as soon as you see the code, as soon as it's on that website, you can buy it. They are stunning. I've never seen these before. Look how beautiful. 75 carat sky blue opal, 8 by 5 to 14 by 8 on the massive drops there. Um, 11 centimetres round, but it is packed, as you can see, like sardines in a can. That is the most glorious blue, isn't it? Very, very divine indeed. Completely natural. Um, African blue opal. Beautiful, beautiful. Nine pounds and 95 pence. They would work so well with Atlantic Abalone Deb's kit. Mm. It is super duper easy to order. You're covered by a money back guarantee on everything. It's 30 days. Get it home. Give it a try. See what it matches within your stash. And you do have certificates of authenticity as well. Um, it's going to go perfectly with all the silver wire in the kit. 0800 644 655. And on jewelrymaker.com to have a look at all the specs. You can even use the tassels on the end, guys. Can you imagine if you did a top drill drop earring on a shepherd's hook and then just put the little tassels on the end? How beautiful would they be? They're glorious. They're that Pantone colour as well for 2016, that gorgeous serenity blue. I'm a bit in love with those. £9.95. We'll keep the details on the screen. Um, so well done to you for that. Apologies again for interrupting. There are a lot, they will oh. work really nicely with this kit though, so I, I can understand. Yeah. Look at that one in the middle. I know he's it? yummy, isn't he? Um, right, so what I've done is I've I've basically stitched the um, the second end of the wire into the the massive wire that we've got here. And what I'm gonna do with the, the end is just take my round nose pliers and just twist a very loose spiral that will then sit just on the edge there. And those and round nose pliers, um, even though you've got the stripy zebra ones, they yeah, do come in our basic, regular tool kit, so yeah. they're a basic tool, yeah. really easy to use. Okay, so once you've got that, what I did was I actually made a second one. Yep. And these then you can fit together. Sure. So you can adjust um, how they sit, which way round you want it. Um, we've got some more wrapped sections. And then here I've just got a basic figure of eight weave. Yeah. In, out, in, out. So what I will do is fix that in position there. Fabulous. And then... To do the, the sort of cage section over the top, all you need to do is get some more of your one millimetre wire. See if I can find the tail now, because I can't see it. It's brilliant. It disappears so <laughs> Yeah, so it kind of, it doesn't really but matter if you're not piece. technically amazing. You could still no. do this design. It's quite a good one to start with, isn't it? It is, and it's it's actually quite relaxing because you're not stressing about symmetry. Yeah, I always stress about yeah. symmetry and and making everything so neat and so perfect. Yeah. I wish I wish I could be neat and perfect about things, but I'm just not. You know, I wonder if it's I'm, my eyes or my brain. Does my brain align properly? It just doesn't work for me. I don't. But I don't worry mind that anymore. Because then, right. then you know it's handmade, don't you? It means so much more. Well, it, it just makes it a bit more um, individual. I mean, yeah. this one isn't going to be the same as the first one, but I like that fact. So I love that you did it on a train. That's brilliant, isn't it? You can jewellery <laughs> make everywhere. We should have a, a text in, actually. Where's the weirdest place that you jewellery made? Give us a text on 60777. Mm. Weirdest or strange? Maybe weirdest is, is a bit... Bizarre, yeah. but you know what Sitting I mean. On the toilet or something. Yeah, don't, don't do it. On the, don't know, we don't want to hear about that. But you know, <laughs> uh, have you been dragged along camping for the weekend in the Brecon Beacons, and you've been sat there jewelry making in your tent? Let us know. Please be interactive with us tonight. I have done macrame in a tent. Have you? Yeah. At a festival. Oh, why weren't you watching Pinned. the bands and having a cider? 
uh, I was probably listening. It was probably something like, you know, two o'clock in the morning or something. And I what a life sleep. you lead, Deb. Not anymore. <laughs> oh. Not anymore. What festival was it? Um, it would have been, actually, the Cambridge Folk Festival. I used to work at the Cambridge Folk Festival. Did you? I, don't, I put your wristband on one year. Oh. Wouldn't that be weird? And also that would be seriously In a former weird. life. If yeah. We'd, yeah. If we, anyway, sorry. That would. We it was a really nice festival, actually. Nice. It so, always is. It's a lovely venue. Yeah. Sit there with my macrame pinned to my jeans. <laughs> Love it. Pin. Um, we've got uh, on yeah. tomorrow's show. We've got Zena doing macrame tomorrow with lovely Mark. Oh, She's actually going to be the guest designer tomorrow. He's been teaching her a week, so a whole Happy. challenge weekend. Oh, yeah, taking it seriously. Yeah, she really, really is for sure. Now we've got twenty of these kits, Atlantic abalone and baskets. Please oh. check out your basket. Do you want it? You do want it. Twenty-one pounds ninety-five. You're saving nearly twenty pounds. Check it out, people, or give us a call. Have a chat to our lovely Jane and her team in the call centre, 0800 644 All right. So I've just cut off another length of the one millimetre wire. About a metre? Um, should we measure? Should we measure, just to make sure? Well, this is in inches. I think it's still a metre wall, though. I think it is, too. It's about ooh, 90 centimetres. centimetres perfect. <laughs> To be accurate. We should do a poll as well with the guys at home to see if they want centimetres or inches. Yeah. I can visualise inches much more. I don't know why. Even though I'm yeah. still past, I'm still metric, if that makes sense. Not imperial. Yes. I chop and change, depending on what the actual measurement is. Yeah, you're right. But we haven't got centimetres on this ruler. We need to, don't we? We do. So what I'm going to show is how I've done this cagey section over the top there. So these wires coming across the top. Um, so you could actually put loads and loads of beads mm -hmm. in behind there and then come Fab. over the top. Just as something uh, If you'd had bit more pearls, I was going to say, would you pop pearls in there? That would be nice. Yeah, that, that would be nice. Lovely, lovely. Really nice. So my one millimetre wire comes up the other side. Yep. So what I'm going to do to start with is thread it through and you can actually pop on um, some, some more of your blue gemstones or some of the purple quartzite as well, if you want to at this point. So I'll pull it through there. And if I just run my thumb down the edge, that takes out any kinks that I might yep. have gained as I was working it through there. I'm going to come up through that loop and then just smooth it out again. And then mm -hmm. we can start making a cage. So if, if I bring, so I've got it coming out probably around the centre point yeah. on the, the necklace. And don't worry if it's still moving about at, at this stage because it will become a bit more solid once you start working. Excellent. So we're going to bring the, the one millimetre wire back in and through the top section and just pull it down. I don't want to pull it completely flat though, so you want it standing a little proud yep. on the wire. Oh, there we go. So you can see, if I keep it at that point, just hold it with your thumb and finger. And then if you use your pliers, you can um, come in there and put a kink, a right angle kink into your wire. Okay. Okay, and then bring that tail back up through one of the gaps there and just feed it through. Make sure you don't get a kink in your wire. Okay, hold that up there. So what we're going to do is almost fix that in place. It's quite a dangerous place to stand, you know, when I'm doing this. What, me? Yeah. <laughs> I'm also so. not very awake at this point. <laughs> um, so yeah, if I get it in the yeah. eye, then it's probably my own fault. <laughs> My own doing is karma for some karma. No, I believe in karma, Dad. Oh, you do. must believe. No, I, that's I why I'm yeah. trying to be as nice as I possibly can to everybody, <laughs> <laughs> just in case. Well, uh, it's uh, it's a sensible thing to yeah. do. Yeah, treat as you want to be treated. Yeah, definitely. So I've got quite a lot of sort of um, kinks and messiness going on in my wire, and I want nice, even, um, nice, even 
sort of structures, if you like, bridges coming across. So you just need to carry on on this. Until it kind of, out, yeah, until it stops then, becoming articulated, the opposite of articulation. Yeah, and, and until you've got enough of your, your sort of cages, if you like, coming ah, over. Yeah. So you remember to just bring your wire back oh, through. Oh, got it, yeah. From the back to the front, and then um, that's it. Just pull it into position so it sits. Go back through and lock it in place. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm just laughing because the box is made of. It did. Oh, it's not doing it now. Apologies if you heard that noise. I think it was actually it you, was, Martha. It was just the <laughs> it was just the bus, I promise. <laughs> they do. Those those big white ones are the worst. <laughs> I moved one of those the other day and it was horrific. Oh, apologies. <laughs> apologies. Uh, we noise, do have fun here at That noise America. always makes people laugh though, doesn't it? It's just I don't like know why. <laughs> <laughs> it's childish, isn't it? It's Sorry, we are yeah, live and we is. do love to have as much fun as possible as we can at Jury Maker. Come and have fun with us. Come and join <laughs> us on a workshop. We'll have loads of fun. <laughs> Great. So I'm just going to pop another one through there. Yep. So these are, are building up and I actually, I've made that one a little bit too high, but you get the idea. So I need, if if um, I was doing it at home, I'd mm -hmm. need to then flatten that one down or chop it off and carry on. Okay. But I'll live with it. <laughs> That's all right. Now, if you start doing this and the um, these sort of cagey bits start getting a bit messy mm -hmm. and they're not as smooth as you want them, then I found a really good way to actually smooth them down. Right. If I put another one in there. So if I... This is a top tip. Yeah, if I mash that one up a bit so it's not quite <laughs> as smooth as I want. Yeah. Just use your... Um, these are quite long chain nose pliers, which is fab. Mm -hmm. But any of your pliers, really. Um, and I, I, I would use a chain nose rather than a round nose for this. So you've got the flat side so in the middle. Yeah, but you, on the top, yeah. you've got like a dome uh -huh, section. I see. So I've closed the pliers and I'm yep. using it as a mandrel. And what I'm going to do is just run that along on my wires and gently ease it back into shape. That's great. And that works very so effectively. Because we're working with the soft wire predominantly, mm -hmm. um, that that just eases the kink out and, and makes it nice and smooth again. Lovely stuff. We've got thousands, I'm going to say thousands of, of tools, but we've got 30,000 different products on the website, so you'll definitely be able wow. to find some suitable pliers for that. Go and have a little look on jewelrymaker.com. We're nearly okay. out of time, Deb. Yep. So if I just show you how I finished it off. So I, I brought it through to the bottom, and then if you just make a little loop, you can then hang a drop on there and just work the, um, the tail back in to the, the nesty type scribbly section. That's a lovely descriptive. Is that what you call it? <laughs> the scri scribbly, it is, scribbly it is nest scribble, isn't it? It's like... It's, yeah, um, that's lovely. It's, it's almost like your scribble pad when you're sitting there on the phone and you're not really Ooh, concentrating. Yeah, doodling away. Doodling. I always do flowers. Yeah. What do you do? I do flowers, dots, boxes, Ooh, dashes. Boxes. Yeah. Geometric. Geometric boxes, but yeah. It means a lot of things, doesn't it? If you it does. Doodles. Yeah, it does. So what you can do is then, however you want to finish it off, you mm -hmm. can um, make loops here. Yep. Or you can carry on round and make... Um, if you wanted to, a hook and an eye at the back. Gorgeous. So you could pop it on a chain. I'll just show you that actually, um, how Deb's finished it just on this, the finished one. So you wrapped around it with the point 0.4 um, or the point 0.6. Point 0.6. And then yeah, just made a simple six. clasp on the back there. Yeah, just a, a basic hook and eye. So it, it's really, you, you can use that as a base and structure and you can add more gemstones into it or different 
Could you add some Be Wild Pearls to it? That would be gorgeous. Ooh, should we have a lovely look at the Be Wild Pearls or your style buy could be up next? Just to think. Oh, you lucky people, please, as soon as you see the details, there they are on the screen, get it, get it, get it, get it, because they are glorious. We really, very rarely see these Be Wild Pearls, for one, in the size and shape that we've got here, and for two, in the amazing peacock colour that you've got. So, dyed peacock, freshwater cultured, top drilled as essential, I'll tell you about that in a minute. They are 14 by 6 to 20 by 9 mil, and each and every single one has that gorgeous iridescence. They're named after uh, Lake Biwa in Japan, where they started to um, basically produce these uh, pearls back in the 1920s. Uh, but the water pollution got so intense that they had to stop. Uh, and since then, uh, they have been um, culturing them, so to speak. So um, farming them in a, in a very um, uh, ethical way to create that size and shape of Biwa. So you'll identify a Biwa pearl. There'll be nothing else like it. You've got that beautiful flatness to it but also the long drop, which makes them brilliant for headwear, tiaras, um, particularly wedding jewellery and things like that. Even in cocktail rings, they look completely gorgeous. So they have been dyed. Let's show you exactly how many we're getting because they are stacked on the strand and it's a very long strand. Do you see how wonderfully articulated they are? That's the fact that you've got that top drill going through there and quite a healthy drill hole as well on pearls, which quite often need reaming. But look at the colours. It's all about that um, iridescence, isn't it? Layers and layers of luster giving you that beautiful colour and the peacock colour obviously referring to those beautiful blues and greens. They are divine indeed. We're going to do the lowest ever price we've seen on these peacock be wild pearls. The arrow is going down. Every single one of you will pay the lowest price. Oh, 800 644655 £12.95 pence. Just as a simple bracelet with a sterling silver clasp, that would take about half your strand to make an amazing bracelet like that. Look at that. It's gorgeous. It's bang on trend and fashion at the moment. Those fabulous colours are going to work with everything. If you've got some of your white uh, freshwater pearls, can you imagine the seed ones? You could pop in between each and every single one and that would look stunning. Because you have that top drill as well, you can do so much with them. Um, you can articulate them uh, differently to make a cuff. They would work superbly well with your bright gold brass cuff coming up later. Can you imagine just putting a strand through there? And like um, Deb suggested earlier, if you've got your Dremel, if you're lucky enough to have one of those, you can make some drill holes and just thread them in between. How opulent, how expensive looking and luxurious is that? And I ask you, how much would you pay for that in a little boutique mm. shop? It's yeah. incredible, isn't it? Because you've got that high uh, mirror uh, shine on that cuff as well, the colour just popped out, didn't they? £12.95. and pence. If you went for the kit today, the Atlantic Abalone, these would work so well with all that silver wire as well. Um, and if you even it, um, come up later with the French wire, it would look gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Well, and to everybody going for that, the French wire, just as a reminder, let me just put it against the French wire so you can see how well it works with both colours of uh, metals there. Sorry, I'll show it towards you so you can see everything. That is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It's so easy to order on Jewelry Maker 0800 644 655 or on the website jewelrymaker.com. Well done to everybody that went for those beautiful BWR pearls. But I keep talking about it and now it's time to see it. It's a brand new cuff. It's already in hammered for you, and for me, it's a standalone piece. Obviously, you could do um, make those drill holes in it, wrap wire around it, lots of different ideas. It's completely adjustable as well. It's huge. It's two inches wide, but let me show you and just take it off my wrist very quickly, guys, so I can show you how adjustable it is. Um, I've got quite chunky wrists, I think. But look, it's very malleable indeed because it is that brass. Um, you can use it um, however you want to, really. You could even probably take your metal shears. I know that um, lovely Carol had some brand new metal shears this morning at 8 a.m. And you could cut it down into two uh, smaller cuffs, which would be fabulous if you wanted uh, matching pieces on each wrist. I know that's quite fashionable now. But look at that hammered finished. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? It's very kind of boutique-y, I think. 
very uh, shishi look to it all over the high street at the moment. It's going to be an amazing price as well. You've never seen it before on its own. Eight pounds and ninety-five pence. Oh, you can't go wrong, can you, Deb? Wow. What I would mean, you do with it? What, how would you inspire us with this one? Um, I, again, just love it as it is. Yeah. Because I love that hammered finish on there. Um, I think stitching gemstones into it. Would yeah, be little gorgeous. seed ones. Garnets yeah. would be lovely with that gold, wouldn't they? Garnets mm. would, or something super sparkly, and maybe um, make a pattern on it. It, the cuffs, I think, work amazingly well with um, the leather as well because you can you could just um, glue a strip of leather down down the center. Oh yeah. And then you've got the two -tone. borders of the the gold. What glue would you use for that to glue onto brass? E six thousand. E six thousand available on our website along with thousands of other lines. Jewelrymaker.com. Well done to everybody that's gone for that brand new bangle, eight ninety five. It's lovely. It's just one of those nice little bottom drawer gifts. You know, if you've got mm. birthdays to buy for and you forget, it's yeah. a really lovely versatile present as well, isn't it? You could do some really nice piercing saw work on there as Ooh. well and cut out Lush. swirls or flowers or shapes or whatever you like. Wonderful. Nice. We've, we've got a last in stock, ninety five <gasps> sterling silver chain for you. Ooh. Rob is squeezing in the deals tonight. Well done to everybody. As soon as you see that code, you need to be ordering on 0800 644 It's 16 inches with a two inch extender there. It's only been seen once before, but it's a gorgeous, delicate little chain. Very, very high shine on that. Can you see how sparkly that is? Lovely, lovely. Let's get right in and let's see those links. They are, I'll show you both sides of it. So that universal size of 16 inches, obviously the two inch extender on there as well. Isn't that a stunner? Can you imagine it if you made a top drill pendant and actually I believe we are gonna do, show you how to do some top drill drops mm -hmm. in the eight o'clock hour. Just out of one of those Bewell pearls, how much would that command? Really super fashionable. It would look beautiful against the silver. As soon as you see that price point, it's going to fly out the door. So we do urge you to get on those phone lines. We're going to honour the launch price. That price is going down though, Rob. It's a silly, silly price of 5 95 for 95 sterling silver. <laughs> I was with my friend. I visited India, um, the Rajasthani region in November, and he bought a sterling silver chain off the markets there in India, and he paid 10 English pounds for it, which I guffawed at him and said, <laughs> Can't you just wait till I get home, jewelry maker, and I'll get you one of ours? But no, he couldn't no. wait. So five pound ninety-five <laughs> to me, that's wholesale price, isn't it? Please do remember that you can buy more than one, guys. You can check out ten if you want to. Let's see how long it is when we hold it out. Oh, I'm sorry, it's got a little bit of a kink in it. It will lie lovely and fluid against your skin. There we go. Hopefully, we can pick that up. £5.95 and that, uh, uh, well done Zena in Greater London you've gone for four, Lee in Cardiff you've gone for three, Sue in Hampshire you've gone for two as well. It's gorgeous isn't it? Do let us know what you're going to do with them. Give us a text on 60777. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Well that was an exciting, exhilarating first hour wasn't it Deb? It was good, there were some nice things in the first hour there. It though. really was. Remember, the French Wire is coming up at 10 to 8. Our star buys in the next hour, blue sapphires, guys, from Burma, natural ones, and a back-in-stock sterling silver chain as well. So go and put the kettle on, or uh, if you're having your tea, come and bring it back in front of the TV. I would love to be having tea with you. Let us know. Uh, we'll <laughs> see you after this. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Ruby is an incredibly popular gemstone here at Jewelry Maker. Its beautiful red tones are instantly recognisable as an incredibly precious gemstone. Ruby itself is a member of the Corundum family whose sister stone is going to be Sapphire. Ruby is the only member of this gemstone that has its own name. 
Now, when we look at ruby, we look for really beautiful, even tones, and these can run from rich reds, which are often referred to as pigeon blood ruby, right through to lighter, paler tones, almost going into the pink tones as well. Ruby is a birthstone for July, so it makes the perfect addition to your collection if you're looking for those unique presents. And it is the 40th wedding anniversary stone as well. Ruby itself is incredibly hard, being nine on the Mohs scale, making it perfect for all kinds of jewellery. And we know that Ruby itself is the everlasting symbol of love. Are you new to jewellery making? Not sure where to start? Then head over to our website and check out our Get Started page. Watch the welcome message from presenter Carol and find out all about Jewellery Maker. Watch one of our easy to follow tutorials where our guest designers will teach you the basics and give you the confidence to start making earrings, bracelets and necklaces. If you prefer to simply have a go, then check out our starter kits. They contain everything you need, including instructions, tools, gemstones and clasps, allowing you to create your very first jewellery pieces. You can either watch the video tutorial or follow the step-by-step -step instructions to give you plenty of inspiration. We also have an array of beginners workshops that you can attend here at our studios and join our experienced designers and get a taste for this fabulous hobby. We will guide you through the basics to get you started making your own beautiful jewellery. Everyone is welcome in the jewellery making family, so start your jewellery making journey today. We here at Jewellery Maker love to hear your feedback. So working in conjunction with FIFO, a global ratings and reviews provider, when you purchase a product from JM, you will receive an email asking you to rate our service and our products. This helps us to bring you excellent customer service and ensure we're bringing you value for money and high quality goods. Have your say with Jewellery Maker FIFO reviews. When you place your first order with Jewellery Maker, we'll send you a free DVD and booklet to help you get started. The booklet is jam-packed full of information on gemstones, tools, threading, materials and findings. There are step-by-step -step instructions on how to make bracelets, earrings and necklaces. And the DVD includes easy-to-follow video tutorials. So what are you waiting for? Start your jewellery making journey today. If you have a question or a query for Jewellery Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewellerymaker.com. Good evening, Jewellery Makers. My name's Martha. Pleased to have you for another three hours. We are live in the Warwickshire countryside. I'm being joined by one of my favourite people in the world. It's the gorgeous Deb Rudge. Good evening, Deb. Hello. How are you? I'm really well, thank Excellent. you. Excellent. Yeah, We've got really two well. hours of amazing products to show you, and then you've got another designer inspiration for us. What's it all about oh. later? Um, it's about big statement pieces. Lovely. That sounds good. Bead scoop included. Bead scoop included, guys. So do join, join us. Well, stay with us, actually. You know what? Because the French wire is coming up at 10 to 8. So one hour and 45 minutes. If you missed out on the deal that Hannah gave us last night. Oh, beautiful gold and silver French wire. There is loads and loads and loads and loads. We'll take you through all the details, but we do need to make sure you check out as soon as you can, as soon as you see those details. It's really easy to order anything on Jewelry Maker, 0800 644 655. Uh, that call centre is open 24 hours a day. It is a free phone number and there are jewellery professionals in there. So if you've got any questions, even if it's one in the morning, if you don't quite know uh, what the garnet Carol just showed you was on the repeat, you can ring them and ask them all about it and they've got all the same information that I've got. Uh, everything's covered by a 30-day money-back guarantee on our genuine gemstones, of which we sell everything basically a genuine gemstone if you do um, see it aside from um, obviously our tools and things like that 
uh, have authenticity certificates. So you can check those out as well. They're 25 pence per order. And there was one more thing I was going to tell you. 2.95 PMP per day, regardless of what you buy and how heavy it is, which is great. If you want premium delivery, you can get that in two to three working days for £4.95. Right, we've got loads and loads to show you. I'm going to start with one of my absolute favourites, inspiring my hair colour of choice at the moment. It's the beautiful pastel barrels. Look at that, 170 carats. They are huge. Normally we see little tiny barrels and they've been faceted, but these are glorious. So in the barrel family and the ones that we're seeing here now, morganites, guys, beautiful morganites. Uh, Goshenites, the white ones. A uh, little bit of emerald down the bottom, actually, I'll show you in, the mo in a moment. Aquarine are those soft blues. And there's one more, it's Heliodor, isn't it? Uh, hello, I think that one there might be a Heliodor. It could be a golden barrel, couldn't it? Does it have more gold or more yellow running through it? We'll have a good look at each and every single one on the strand. They're completely natural and they are beautiful. Let's hold it out so we can see all those gorgeous colours. They're fab, aren't they? Uh, we were talking earlier about the Pantone colours for 2016 being Rose Quartz and Serenity Blue. Well, you've got that soft pink and that beautiful serene blue on this strand, haven't you? They are stunning. Can you see how much is going on in there? They're just so lovely and the colours work so well together. I think as soon as you get this home, take it off our temporary strand that we provide all of our gemstones on, apart from when it's a scoop or in a tube, and sort out all those colours. I certainly would do. I've seen a gorgeous one. Can you see that pinky one? This should be priced, it's £34.95. We're going to take a whole £10 off. Look at that lovely golden one going on there. Beautiful. There are no rules tonight. The rule book has been thrown out. Rob, our lovely producer, has said, you know what, £10 off, £24.95. It's a Friday night. We like to have fun on a Friday night, don't we? These are glorious. Can you see the luster coming through on this one here? It's not just a block colour, is it? Natural and beautiful, lovely barrel. One of my absolute favourite gemstones because it offers so much, all that colour, but it works so well, doesn't it, in conjunction with each other. Let's look at this gorgeous golden one here. He is divine, isn't he? Just into some little studs, and in fact, we've got some amazing um, silver head pins coming up later. If you just popped one on one of our head pins, how easily could you bend that into a shepherd's hook and you would have a pair of earrings ready to go? Which is what I love about jewellery making. Uh, if you've got a stash at home and you've got a particular outfit that you've just bought and you're going out that evening, I literally just restrand things and make up as I go along and it's so wonderful. Well done to everybody going for that, £24.95. Oh, we've got some gorgeous angelite for you, Lex. Um, we don't see this very often, do we? The lovely blue of angelite. So it's a favourite amongst uh, crystal healers, angelite is. I don't know if you knew that. Um, it, has, it was discovered in Peru, actually quite a recent gemstone. 1987 they discovered it um, in this beautiful, delicious uh, pale blue colour. It's a version of anhydrite or celestial, which is obviously named after it. its an angelic appearance, celestial being the skies above us. Um, so absolutely beautiful. It's really difficult for us to be able to source really good quality like this and to be able to um, match them all up in perfect six mil rounds. You're getting 70 carats in total. Um, quite a soft gemstone in respect, and that's why you'll see it carved. Um, you might see an angelite angels. Um, I certainly know I've seen them, but it's a lovely, gorgeous, soft blue. A really wearable colour, isn't it? If you've got your white freshwater pearls, it would look, work perfectly as spaces in between those. Um, sometimes um, it can fluoresce under UV light as well. So um, it's a real unique gemstone. There's lots of gorgeous properties in there. So completely rare, completely natural. Angel like from, as I say, from Baru. 14.95, Rob. Do you not uh, equate uh, rarity with a high price point then? It's amazing, isn't it? Fourteen ninety-five. We would like to offer you uh, the most affordable gemstones that we can. We still share our buying team and our cutting house in Jaipur. Uh, Jaipur is famous in India for having the best um, craftsmanship uh, when it comes to gemstones with the Genuine Gemstone Company. So we've still got those amazing uh, deals going on, which is why we're able to bring you this incredibly rare gemstone at that amazing price. Give us a call on 0800 644 655. Have a little look on jewelrymaker.com. Have you got everything you need to make this into an amazing necklace? Can we have a little look on the neckline? 
I've still got a tan from my Australian holiday. I'm quite impressed with myself. <laughs> I don't know how I've done that. Look at that. Isn't that lovely? For summertime, I don't know if you had a beautiful spring day uh, where you were living today, but in um, Birminghamshire, it was gorgeous. Was it gorgeous mm. where you, you're a little bit up north, aren't yeah. you? Yeah. Shropshire. Oh, lovely. Staffordshire borders. But still, so it, it was feels really like spring, sunny doesn't it? And Yeah, had the doors open and... Yeah, it was nice. Lovely stuff. Beautiful, beautiful angel light for £14.95. But we've got some wire for you next. Oh, we've got some fiery red wire. Hot red, it's called, I believe. Hot red wire. This is our jewellery maker wire. Um, beautifully made, great quality. Um, we certainly ask our customers, and we have done for the past nearly six years, it's our birthday in May, what colours you want, what gauges you want to see. And this was something that came out of it. You said, we want hot red. So we're giving you 50 metres of the hot red uh, coloured copper wire. It's the 0.6 mil that you will have seen Deb using. So a really versatile wire to use. 50 metres, let's put that in context. Linford Christie can run half of that, can't he, in five seconds. I know I'm a bit out of date with my athletes, but that's how I visualise 50 metres. It's very, very long indeed, isn't it? And there's beautiful ruby reds. If you've got any garnets, indeed, if you're lucky enough to have rubies, that's going to work beautifully, isn't it? Uh, we've got lots of instructional DVDs on the web as well. If you love Alison Tarry, you want to make some structural pieces, it's going to work really well. £6.95. Are you telling me it's just, it's just over 10 pence a metre? That's incredible, isn't it? I would love to um, take it out and show you what a metre is, but um, when you do get your spool home, just make sure you're in a safe place and you're not looking at it too closely because when you take the spool off sometimes it's got a bit of tension in it and it will unravel everywhere you'll only do it once mm -hmm. um, it's like when you open your first bottle of sparkling wine and uh, that's how exciting it is gorgeous gorgeous red wire remember if you're completely new to wire work you can come and join us at ivy house and uh, we've got lots of wire working workshops it's quite hard to say that isn't it with glorious guest designers like alice and terry laura binding um, and Louise Jacobson does a great cocktail ring one as well. Six ninety-five, perfect for your wire. But we've got even more. Uh, sorry, what hour? Amatrine, Amatrine, lovely, lovely, big fat rondelles. I shouldn't say fat, really, should I? I should say chunky, but they are kind of fat and juicy and delicious. Lovely, lovely ametrine. So 130 carats of ametrine. These measure 6 by 3 to 9 by 5 on a 24 centimetre strand. Only discovered in one location in the world, in Bolivia. And we source our ametrine from the Anahi mine. Um, also known as Bolivianite because of that one source. Ametrine is the perfect, basically, um, Mother Nature turns amethyst into citrine as it's coming up from the ground. Um, so depending on how much heat it's been exposed to, is whether it's gorgeous amethyst or, or citrine. And here you can see we've kind of stopped it halfway through its process and you get those beautiful rich purple tones going into those gorgeous golden colours as well. Doesn't it look absolutely beautiful? It's becoming even more difficult to source um, as we go on. There's only one mine, as I say, and because of that fact, because it's a one location uh, gemstone, those, they're able to command huge prices for it. So we don't often have a lot of ametrine. We have quite a lot of nuggets, but nothing finished like this. It's really very beautiful indeed. So we're going to do an amazing price for you. Of course we are. £14.95. Isn't that just lovely? So warming to have those golden colours through there as well. It's super easy to order on 0800 644 655. And on jewellerymaker.com you can see all of today's products. What would you do, our Deb, with this amateur? Oh, I think some really long earrings mm. on chain, and um, probably a rose gold. That would be lovely, wouldn't chain. it? Chain, yeah. Just Maybe. to kind of harmonise the two colours. Yeah, Beautiful. yeah. Keep it all soft and feminine and quite gentle. Um, but it it actually works really nicely if you mix in some citrine and some amethyst as oh, well, yeah. and then you've got sort of the whole range of colour there, um, but that that's just a beautiful strand, isn't, isn't it? Isn't it? It, it kind it's kind of glowing. To it be is. It is. There's so really much light reflecting and bouncing off of it. 
You don't really think that about amethyst, do you? You never think, wow, it's sparkly, but this is really very beautiful indeed. 14.95. Love, love, love that. Well done to everybody going for that. Uh, but we've got loads more to show you. I'm sorry I don't have anything in my box 20. Bear with us one second. I'm just going to have a little look at what I've got. Remind me one more time, please. Okay. I think we're a box out, my love. This was number 16 on the citrine. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Ooh. A faceted round. I do apologise about those technicalities. We're it's behind the scenes. 40 carats of citrine faceted rounds. I love these. So we were just talking, weren't we, about ametrine being the happy medium between amethyst and citrine. Well... This is perfect, glorious sunshine in a gemstone, isn't it? So they are four mil and you're getting 40 carats, completely natural. And normally, um, a lot of citrine you see on the market will have been heat treated to bring out that bright sunshine yellow, but not this one. This has all happened naturally. Very, very gorgeous indeed. Um, so it's from Brazil, Brazilian citrine. It's yummy, yummy, yummy. You've got obviously a temporary strand running through there. Um, so you can see that it's got quite a transparency to it. It's picking up that orange thread. So imagine if you've got some beautiful wire work, or we were talking about rose gold before, it's going to take on any of those properties of those colours. Lovely little rounds. A real perfect size if you want to just pop one or two on some Eslon that you've um, used, maybe Kuma Hemode. They would look perfect. Aren't they fabulous? They're dazzling, aren't they? Really stunning. Number seven on the most scale, so really durable as well. The most scale is measured against diamonds being number 10 as the toughest gemstone on the planet. We're going all the way down to 6.95. What a lovely price that is. A really long strand as well. Shall I give it a bit of a measure? We'll have a real quick look at what it measures at. Apologies, Bruce, our lovely director. That's 40 centimetres on there. We do guarantee you 38 centimetres. Um, in, in case we say otherwise. So if you don't have those details, that's what you're working with. But with them being four mil, I would say that's 100, isn't it? If it's 40 centimetres long. Can anybody else work that out? It's definitely more than 10, isn't it? You've got to move definitely it Definitely more than 10. Yeah. Everybody's a little bit, everybody's a little <laughs> bit tired today. Apologies. Uh, but the Carol Vaudman is me says that you're getting at least 100 gemstones there. That would be perfect. These would be great channel sets. Remember, that Deb in the first design with the abalone um, did some channel setting with the smaller pearls. You could do that with these, couldn't you? Yes, you could. Yeah. Gorgeous. And and making a bracelet, they seem to me to be the right size mm. for a bracelet somehow. It's just screaming really out. Would. So channel set them um, with a, either a, a one millimeter or one point two five millimeter wire either side. Um, and usually zero point four to attach them. And that would be gorgeous. They're just glowing again. And they'd work so well with that amatrine that we had. Oh, yeah, they really would. Well done to everybody going for that. We've got diamonds for you next. Diamonds, diamonds, diamonds. Let's have a little look at those. Oh, my worst. They're the um, little cut diamonds as well. Apologies as I get it out. Oh, these are amazing. I'm just going to pull them on. Actually, I'll just take one in the little grabber for you so incredible to have diamonds on the channel uh, they are genuine diamonds black diamonds rose cut multi shaped rounds we are guaranteeing three carats which is a substantial amount I'm just going to get one in my little grabber so I can show you no, actually I think a little bit too delicate for that yes apologies let's just pop one on the back of my hand so you can see it how does that show up now, in this little bowl, obviously we guarantee the carrot weight, but I am getting in here 14. They are stunning. Look at that. Can you see how they've been faceted as wow. well? Very, very beautiful indeed. I want to be able to show you them a little better. Have we got a white pad, my lovely Emma camera lady? Let's pull them out onto a white pad so you can see them. And I'm just going to change my details so I can have a little look. So they have been heat treated. And the cut there is the rose cut, which really shows off all that beautiful sparkle. Let me see if I can grab it one more time. Can you? No, you can't really see that, can you? Because they are so delicate. But they would be perfect for setting into silver clay. Um, let's have a little look. Oh, no, I knew that would happen. 
Oops. I just poured them all over the table. There you go. You can see all yeah. the different sizes and shapes. Gorgeous. Let's see. I've just put them on the back of my hand, so you should be able to see them glinting away. Kind of glad I put some hand cream on in the break because that has allowed them to stay in position. <laughs> Aren't they beautiful? So, um, obviously, jewelry maker bought diamonds for the first time about two years ago. So we've been on there for around about four years, and it took us that long to be able to source diamonds. To be using it in your handmade jewelry is just mind blowing, isn't it? Really, you can have one of the big five. Um, in your collection today with these gorgeous black diamonds. That's yours should be priced on the screen. $89.95 and already people checking out at that amazing price. But Rob is going to drop that all the way down. He says he's going to do it really low. What a cheeky monkey he is. A £30 saving all the way down to $59.95 for guaranteed three carats of black diamonds. Look at the lustre and the sparkle. They are at absolutely beautiful colored diamonds are so rare so much so that for every 10,000 carats that are mined a mere one carat is this fancy color and, and in the black it's just absolutely glorious isn't it Deb how would you set these um we've some of them look big enough to actually fit into some of the um sterling silver settings that we have oh yes so maybe a, a ring point. or earrings um i know we've had them in all sorts of different sizes yeah um so i'd i'd probably have a look and um sort them out so that so that i could set some in the sterling silver settings if we haven't got one to fit and you've got maybe a, a diamond there that's a different size non-calibrated yeah then um, you can actually prong set. So wow. make your own little prong settings That's amazing. out of your wire. Gorgeous. £30 pounds off as well. Aren't they beautiful? They're so sparkly. And that's such a traditional cut as well. Yeah, rose, isn't it? Rose cut. So it's, it's really gorgeous. It's going to be perfect in vintage pieces. Very much, yeah. Or, um, Maybe in a, a sort of, um, you know, the traditional Victorian marcasite brooches and things. I was just thinking maybe, of that. Maybe go down that route with it and, and um, set them in a piece that looks like a, a marcasite piece. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful indeed. Now, lots of people with these in baskets. Please do remember to check out. It's not guaranteed yours if you've got it in a basket. Somebody on the phone lines can override you on 0800 655. So if you want these in your collection today, and I do advise you get them home, use that 30-day money-back guarantee, have a little look. Imagine elevating your jewellery to that high end, the most luxurious gemstone in the world. Three carats, rose cut as well. Nothing rough about them, is there? They are finished pieces. I'm going to very carefully put them back in here. I don't want them to go everywhere. Look at that. I got it right. We haven't lost any <laughs> diamonds, guys. Well done. Next up, we are going... Two, some gorgeous crimp colours. Lovely, okay. Um, Deb, for all of our new people at home, what is a crimp cover? Um, it hides the crimp tube once you've squashed it. So if you want a really professional finish on your necklace or bracelet and you're using beading thread, then you can use a crimp tube to crimp it down and hold it in place, just squash it in place, and then cover it up with this and once you close this down over the top of your crimp tube um, it just looks like a bead so it finishes everything off yeah. gives it a really professional um, finish and here we're getting 95 sterling silver as well so really stepping up your designs definitely. certainly if you've got any pearl strands you definitely yeah. want to be using these with them you're getting 100 pieces and they're three mil in total and one thing to remember with these is when you're using them um, don't be too heavy-handed and make sure you take it gently to close them down because especially if you're used to using the copper ones that yeah. are plated um, because these are a lot softer so sure. you don't want to squash it too much Absolutely so take it gently not. they are gorgeous aren't they really really lovely Beautiful. even one or two of those flanking and um, perhaps one of those bee pearls can you imagine Mm. That would, I mean, you can make things like this go such a long way, can't you? Because yeah. you just need that little bit of luxury. Yeah, and it really definitely. elevates the piece, doesn't it? Well, the, the silver chain that we had earlier on, you can just pop a couple of these on oh. along the chain and it just adds a detail along the chain, which is Absolutely perfect. Absolutely right. Um, we're going to do an amazing price for you. 
14 pounds and 95 so that they are what does that make them each it makes them 15 pence yeah 15, 15 pence yeah. for sterling silver you're getting 11 grams of sterling silver as well that's the average weight for you amanda in hampshire you've gone for it catherine in paul and lovely devon well done to you aretha in west yorkshire lots of you coming through for those so really really perfect Again, it's one of the things that we don't often have in stock. They come in and they fly out because we know that you love them. They are fabulous. You can use them with a... Oh, he went. Sorry, Emma. <laughs> I, I, I get it. I got Emma, our lovely camera lady. I've got another one, Emma. Don't worry about it. I've got 99 more. I've got 90, 99 crimp beads. Um, yeah. Emma could be busy. <laughs> So they are gorgeous, lovely luster to them as well. And they're going to go over, I was, what I was talking about before I got distracted by pinging them at our lovely Emma was, um, you can use a variety of things. So it's done. Oh, there it goes. Oh, I'm going to give up. I'm going to give up. Here we go. I've got it back. Apologies. You can put a variety of threads. Can we start again, please, guys? Uh, let's, uh, let's do another take. A variety of threading <laughs> materials. So I was going to say, your beading threads, um, your wires, your... Uh, monofilaments, your um, S-lons. Oh, they've all sold out and gone. Thanks for, thanks for that, lovely Rob. Cheers. <laughs> Loads more to show you, though. Ooh, I know this is one of Deb's favourite, because last time we were together, Deb, you were Elastic Queen. <laughs> so that sounds weird, doesn't it? <laughs> Deb, the Elastic it Queen. Does. Yeah, and super stretchy. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> so, gorgeous elastics. We'll tell you all about them. Let me just give you the details. 10 metres. Uh, they're 0.6 in their gauge and you're getting 10 colours. I will describe the colours to you. They are black, red, pink, lovely uh, see-through one, a chocolate brown, a purple, a sky blue, an orange, um, a fuchsia and a lovely zesty lime at the bottom. Elastics are great if you've got... Um, I don't know where we are with school holidays, but if you've got um, young kids, maybe you're a grandparent and you want to entertain the children, elastic and a big box, a big mm. scoop of beads like we've got coming up later on, and you can make easy bracelets in minutes, can't you? It's you really, can, really yeah. fab. Great for party yeah. bags and things like that. Uh, if you're completely new to jewellery maker, please go for this. If you've got any clear gemstones, the clear quartzes, the beautiful colours from the elastics will come through. So what did you do with our elastics last I time? I crocheted it. You did? So you can do that as well? Yeah. It, it, and when you crochet, so if you put your beads on first, yeah. and then crochet it up just with a simple um, chain, uh, then the, when, when you're wearing it, it's like the, the necklace sort of shivers a bit, and yeah. you get loads of movement. So if you've got faceted gemstones or, or plain gemstones even, the light just dances across it. And it's got a really nice um, finish to it because it's got a, a shine that is quite unique to the elastic, which is uh, quite nice with that translucent effect. Yeah, with it's the got colour. a lovely shimmer, hasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Really nice and soft as well. Beautiful. And that point six, um, Millimetre gauge is going to go through the majority of our, our gemstones here, and you can ream those gemstones as well if you don't have yeah. enough um, hold to go through. Does this mean five ninety five? So sixty pence are real. Where else would you find that? Go and have a little look round on the high street. Um, do a bit of a search, and if you do, let us know about our prices. We like to keep competitive. Uh, we want to give you the best deals that we can have available. I don't think you're going to be able to beat that price. Um, you're certainly not going to be able to beat my presenter's pick, which is coming up right after this. Beautiful Burmese sapphire, one of my favourites, A, because of the rarity of it and the uniqueness and the depth of colour, but secondly, it's my um, birthstone, it's September's birthstone, so something really, since kind of day one, since when you know about jewellery, uh, when you're a little girl, 
and you've identified what your birthstone is, you kind of fall in love right then and then, don't you? Look at that colour. These are absolutely out of this world. Blue is the favourite colour of 50% uh, of all people. Did you know that? So that's why people are drawn to blue sapphires. And you might have seen Princess Diana's engagement ring, um, now worn by um, Princess Catherine. Um, it's that beautiful blue sapphire, isn't it? These are Burmese and they are natural. Um, the price obviously reflects the quality of these. It's going to be absolutely out of this world. Please do go on a search engine and have a look at what makes Burmese uh, sapphire different to the regular sapphires out there. It is above and beyond. It's a real high quality. You've got that beautiful pleochroic nature to it as well. It's not just a Royal Navy, is it? Let's have a little look at how deep and intense those colours go. It's just divine. One of the most... Um, exemplary examples of Burmese sapphire I have seen. Let's give you through uh, those details. So two by one on the rondelles to six by three, 42 carats. It looks like so much more to me. They are massive, each and every single one of those. Very substantial. Let's have a little look at how that graduation works. The ones in the middle are huge. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Now, let's let you into a little fact. 95% of all sapphires are treated. This is not enhanced in any way. We can back that up with a certificate of authenticity as well. So it just goes to show, came out the ground looking like this, and then we rounded them uh, beautifully, polished them up, and uh, then graduated for you on a strand. They are divine. I went on a very famous crafting... Um, auction sale site earlier you'll know the one if you um, sell your jewelry online you've probably got a store on there the most affordable handmade burmese bracelet i found was just over a hundred pounds and it had probably about 10 um, gemstones on it if that a little bit smaller than these ones with a sterling silver chain on a bracelet and as i say 100 pounds that was commanding um, so incredibly um Incredibly sellable, definitely. A talking point for you if you do have a stall or if you do, as I say, have, a, have an auction site or a, a, or a website promoting your ideas. Now, that is the should-be price, 79 95 for 42 carats. There's some gorgeous colour going on here. Look at that. When you close your eyes and you think of a sapphire, that's the colour you want to see. It is more than worth the 79 95 price point. As I say, if you took... A quarter of that strand and put it on a little sterling silver bracelet you'd be commanding at least a hundred pounds i would say the price is going all the way down it's my presenters picks so we're allowed to do that all the way down to 59.95 wow in finished jewelry i had a look and i was looking at uh, burmese sapphires four figures for those absolutely stunning out of this world color everything you would want from a sapphire Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Imagine teaming it up with bright white pearls. Wouldn't that make the, pearl, uh, the colour pop beautifully? That is a steal of a deal. Please feel free to order on 0800 644 Get it home. Have a little look at it. You know, see what else it's going to go with. Gorgeous, gorgeous work. Deb, what would you do with this Burmese, Burmese sapphire? I'd like to make a ring because um, I think the colour of it is so good that I'd want to be looking at it. Yeah. Um, yeah, if it was around your neck, you couldn't yeah, do that, Yeah, you can't you? do it, no. <laughs> so I think a, a really simple ring, just maybe three or five going mm -hmm. across the finger um, with either gold wire or sterling silver wire because it's beautiful. And I would probably make myself a bracelet to go along with it um, and I think what would work really nicely is a ladder weave section um, just a tiny one only you know inch and a half yeah. probably and then chain going around the wrist oh. but again you, you'd be able to look at it and if you do the ladder weave it it opens it out and lets the light get oh, to the gemstone again beautiful if you do want to team up with your french wire that is coming up in oh. one hour and 15 minutes time look at the color how that color works there Isn't that would that be gorgeous? beautiful yeah Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Well done to everybody going for that Birmingham Sapphire. If we do have any left, we will recap for you. But we've got loads more to show you. Uh, some fabulous little agate tubes. I've never seen these before. What a lovely little display of colour. 
Oh, I've seen them in the fuchsia before, but never in this gorgeous sky blue. They are agate tubes. They're from Brazil. Tube doesn't sound very sexy, but they are <laughs> very, very... They'd be perfect for earrings, wouldn't they? Um, so they have been dyed, obviously, but you've still got the nature uh, of uh, agate going through those beautiful stripes that you see in a lot of agates. Um, 40 carats and that lovely fancy cut. How unique for us to have tubes. Let's look at all the different colours. It's a very long strand as well. They are fabulous. Do you see the stripes going through there? The natural stripes of agate. You get that real vibrant colour pop coming out of them. Beautiful banding in each and every single one. That's due to the crystal formation. It's similar actually to how uh, rings in a tree form. So it's really, really lovely. I would put three on head pins um, and drop them off as little earrings or perhaps as a little pendant. They would work beautifully well. So here comes your price point. Remember, everybody pays that lowest price, $5.95. For gorgeous agate tubes, beautiful, beautiful indeed. Well done to everybody ordering on 0800 644 655. Uh, you can get them home today for £2.95 delivery. That delivery is exceptional value for money. So we do encourage you um, to go for as much as you like. Stock up that stash today. Gorgeous, gorgeous agate tubes. I really like them, something a little bit different. We've got some garnet for you coming up next. Oh... This is a super long strand, and it's a really silly price. I remember the price from earlier. I think we're going to match the price of the agates. I hope that we are. Look at this. Mozambique garnet, then. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It should not be this price. So 25 carats of Mozambique garnet, graduated faceted rondelles. They measure two by one to four by two. I've got um, a ring that I got from my nana, which is the exact same color as this. And that ring was valued, oh, I think for about £400 about 10 years ago. I'll have to wear it one day so I can show you. It's exact same, I would say, quality as this. It's beautiful, beautiful. I cannot believe the price this is going to. Completely natural. £5.95. I've got to do a neckline. I can't work it out, I'm afraid. That makes no sense to me <laughs> at all. Garnet is so well known on the high street. Um, customers really respond to it. It's that beautiful colour. If you can't quite stretch to rubies, you've got the same sort of idea there. That's lovely, isn't beautiful, it, Deb? Beautiful, that. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. I've stitched these onto leather. Ooh, um, yeah. If it wasn't this strand, it was very similar. And um, if you stitch it onto a leather just using your wildfire and a beading needle, and then it just sparkles. Yeah, what colour leather would you go for? Do you know, I'd go possibly for a rich dark chocolate brown um, and you still get the pops of, of garnet colour coming through or, or a nice red or something. Yeah, absolutely. Again, it would go really just, well with that French wire. Oh, yeah. Look the, at the, gold. the gold just yeah. makes it... It always makes me think of... Um, I saw the other day on TV the um, other Berlin girl, you know. Oh, you, I saw that, yeah. You see all the Tudor yeah. jewellery and everything that she wore yeah. and garnet Gorgeous. was so prolific in, in Tudor it times, was, wasn't yeah. it? In yeah. really amazing pieces. That is beautiful. That French wire, guys. One hour and ten minutes till that French wire comes in. Can you remind me how many opportunities we've got on the French wire? Just over 200. So we really want to basically make sure that anybody that was disappointed last night that didn't get it, uh, that's why we've done it especially for you today. We're obviously really open to what you guys want and we want to be able to uh, give you as much as we can. So well done to everybody going for the garlic. 5.95, I would be buying probably three of those. Absolute madness. We've got some gorgeous tiger's eye coming up next. Yummy, yummy, yummy. In fact, it would match with the garnet really well. Now, uh, you were talking about um, ladder weave earlier, weren't you? Could mm. you ladder weave with these lovely hexagons, do you think? Oh, yes. Because they tessellate, yeah. don't they? I like that word, tessellate. I do. It's a nice word. And as well, I love this kind of size and shape, and I don't know if the gentleman in the room, uh, that being Rob, kind of quite manly, aren't they, in that kind of geometric shape? You could certainly they make are. some men's jewellery out of that. Yeah, you could make men's rings out of those. Oh, that would Again, be lovely. Again, that would be really nice. Gorgeous, gorgeous, And it's gorgeous, a traditional gorgeous. gemstone for gents, so... Absolutely. His cufflinks yeah. would be amazing, yeah, I'm immediately thinking. Would. So 150 carats of yellow tiger's eye hexagons. They're 10 mil. Completely natural as well. Um, but, oh, gosh, I love that. There's nothing like tiger's eye, is there? Really, really formidable colours coming through. And the shiller that you get off of them is really, really beautiful. Unique and glorious. Beautifully polished. It's 
would work really well if you got any of the wooden beads uh, earlier in the week. Mm. £6.95 for African Tiger's Eye at 150 carats. Imagine how many cufflinks you're getting or how many earrings you're going to be able to make out of that. These really are stash builders, aren't they? We want you to be able to have as much uh, inspiration in your craft room as possible. And certainly these are inspiring me. Very rare for us to see a hexagon as well. That's lovely. Look at all the lovely, yummy kind of caramel, creme caramel colours coming out of there. They are beautiful indeed. Again, I'm sorry I keep banging on about it, but look at the bright gold of the French wire each side of those. Wow. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Well done to everybody going for that. We've got loads more to show you. Oh, these are sounding a bit like Johnny Vegas there, didn't I? Oh, they are lovely, 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 lovely. We've got so much blue coming out of these. I'm really hoping that you can see them. I'm going to keep them in my hand so I don't block any of the light. These are Labradorite cabochons. Now, for the first three years that we were on air, we're nearly six now. In fact, um, look at that. It is the customer's favourite gemstone. It is beautiful and unique. 195 carats of plain oval cabochons. There's nothing plain about them. They measure 25 by 15 to 30 by 20. Now, we guarantee the carat weight, but these are perfect. Let me just pop it on my ring finger to be prong set into a ring, aren't they? Oh, Look yeah. how lovely that is. Can you see all the blues? Let's show you all the different shapes and sizes. I'll load them up on the back of my hand because hopefully that skin tone will be able to see the golds, the greens and the blues and the peaches in our Labradorite. They are wonderful. So brilliant if you do wire wrap your cabochons. Uh, but if you're completely new, they're a great size um, to be able to give it a try if you want to try prong setting. Wow, they're otherworldly, aren't they? Completely gorgeous. Not enhanced in any way. Madagascan Labradorite, which is... Um, some of the best that we can find, absolutely. That beautiful Labrador Essence, twelve ninety five. Wow, 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 wow! It's a complete steal. These are yummy, 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 aren't they? They are very, very. There's something ethereal about them and otherworldly. Really wonderful. Do you love Labradorite, Deb? Oh, it's one of my favourites. Yeah, yeah, it is, isn't it? You can't help but. I mean, it's just so different in every light. It is. It it is magical. And it's one of those gemstones that you can just look at for hours mm. and keep looking and seeing different colours that are coming off it. And yeah, I've got um, a Labradorite ring that I love to wear because it's it's actually quite calming. Yeah. I think I know what you mean. Beautiful. It's very difficult for us to um, go go on go on about myth and legend, <laughs> but uh, give you an idea. But please feel free to read up yourself about. And the healing properties of gemstones if you choose to believe that or not they are gorgeous now it's my favorite next my genuine favorite it's the sea blue cow suddenly coming up oh deb wait until you see this guys oh. at home guys at home oh, oh yeah everything about this is amazing sea oh. blue cow suddenly perfect top drill drops I would make pendants out of each and every single one. I uh, put them on sterling silver um, necklaces and sell them individually, either on a stall or on a or on auction site or that website I was talking about earlier. Easily twenty pounds oh, for each, because yeah. they are just. I've never seen anything like them. They're so beautiful. You're getting two hundred and forty-five carats, and sea blue is the perfect description of that chalcedony. There, elongated, graduated. Um, Faceted drops, there's a lot of descriptions there, aren't they? They graduated because <laughs> they go 15 by 5 at the small end to 36 by 7 on an absolutely stacked strand. I adore, adore, adore them. They do look like fairy wands, lovely customer. Do you know what? We were just talking about myth and legend, weren't we? And something about Chalcedony that I feel I need mm. to have it on me is because it stimulates creativity. Or it's said to. Oh, it's lush, isn't it? I just think I for hair them. pieces as well, I need them too. <laughs> Rob, is there enough for me and Deb to buy them? We've got 30 opportunities. They've got oh. that beautiful silky luster. There's your should be price. What are you playing at, Rob? Oh, you've got that beautiful translucency through to the opaque colour as well. Everybody pays the lower price. 19.95. Oh, let's pop them on the back of the hand. Oh, wow, 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 wow. 
I'm just I'm just mesmerized by them. They are just for me. They are perfect, perfect, perfect. Uh, wrapping the French wire around them, putting them on these um, amazing head pins, the little star head pins. All you'd need to do is thread that head pin through and then twist it round and you've got your pendant made. You could literally, if you're thinking about um, profit from your jewellery making, you could probably make a pendant every two to three minutes and get it all nice and neat. Yeah. So if you're making 30 pendants an hour for an hour's work, imagine how much you can command back off that. I mean, obviously <laughs> all of these prices are subject to weight or selling and subject to your craftsmanship as well. But my word, I, this, oh, I've got to get this. Yeah. It's lush, the, isn't it? They are such an elegant shape. Yeah. And they're like, they glow mm. from within, don't they? Yeah. I know we say ethereal yeah. a lot, but think about what that word means. Oh, I'm going to give them a count. Deb, tell me all about chalcedony as a, a gemstone for you, and I'll give them a count so it's not boring. For well, I, I just adore the look of it and the feel of it as well because they feel very different. They, they feel quite waxy, I think, the surface of the gemstone. Not that it's sticky or anything, but it just has a, a, a really satin sort of feel to it, I think. Um, but you just look at them, and they are like little droplets of tropical yeah. ocean or like just sort of magical water yeah that would, that would cleanse you like the like the fountain of youth yes. encapsulated Ooh, in a nice. gemstone <laughs> i was thinking that earlier i was looking, looking at myself i know we shouldn't be vain but you know when you think oh i'm looking old i need uh, a bit of the fountain of youth chalcedony to to make me feel a little better i measured <laughs> um, i measured i counted 32 which makes them, Deb, 62 <gasps> pence each. Maybe, do you want to split a strand? Maybe we might buy a strand Ooh, together. Yeah. That'd be good. Then we got change for 10 pounds. Oh, yeah. apparently we'll have a job. Because look if at all of you guys going for them. Oh, Pippa in Wiltshire. Oh, I really like them. Georgia in London. William and Anne in Somerset. Evelyn on the gorgeous Scottish borders. Wow, wow, wow. I just cannot tell you how impressed you're going to be with these when you get them home. Oh. Mm, I know Lucy used to kiss the gemstones and I thought she was mad, but I see where she's coming from <laughs> with these. Well done. Oh, uh, we've got loads more to show you. Apologies, I missed what was coming next. Oh, it's a star buy for you next. Uh, Sterling Silver. Oh, I did promise you another sterling silver chain, didn't I? And this is a gorgeous cut of chain. Um, the links are big enough, I think, to be able to put your charms through or, or, or any of your top drill drops, particularly if you've got 0.25 wire. Now, a lot of our sterling silver finished chains don't have that um, capability, but you can see, can't you, there? I would say that's at least one mil in there, which is perfect. And because of that fact, this is one of our most popular. It's been out of stock for nearly a month. Um, there is a finished a Rolo chain, it's uh, two millimetres actually, so the outer diameter on every single one of those little links is two mil. So if you've got, uh, you, you get so much in there, which is why I think it's perfect, what I would do is cut it down into two bracelets and you've got your charm bracelets uh, as your background. So it's 40 centimetres in its length and then it's got an extender on it as well. Here's the extender obviously, that allows it to go up to 45 centimetres also on there, you can see that sterling silver tag as well. Shall I just move it around for you so you can have a little look? That it says 925 TGGC, which stands for the Genuine Gemstone Company. Obviously, we always still buy all of our products from our gemstones and our precious metal ones anyway. Look at this lovely bolt ring clasp as well. Really easy to secure. Um, I feel for you guys. I live on my own and sometimes it's very difficult for me to be able to do up necklaces and, and things like that. But bolt ring clasps has the spring lock so um, it's nice and easy to manipulate you're not fiddling about there's nothing more annoying is there and waiting to get to work and have somebody do up your dress uh, or your necklaces um, so uh, what I urge you to do guys because it is uh, back in stock today is to multi buy we do not limit you on the amount you can buy if you want to go for 10 of these if you want to go for a hundred of these it's going to be a wholesale price to be honest should be nine pounds and 95 pence 
I cannot believe you're going to take three pounds off today, so virtually a third off the price. It's sterling silver. Sterling silver commands a certain price, six pounds ninety-five. Please get on the phone lines, 0800 644 655. As I say, not many of the chains that we offer have that two mil loop on there, so at least a one mil in the centre diameter. Pop on your jump rings, pop on your finished drops. Do you remember I was just talking about those calcedony drops? You'll be able to wire wrap one of those in about two minutes, immediately put it onto your chain and you are, um, you're away. It's, it's one of those things that is, um, if you are making, not just for friends and family, but making to sell, that's what jewellery maker is kind of all about, isn't it? You can certainly mm. get away and be making profit straight away. Now look, I've got a head pin coming up later in one of our style buys. Do you mind if I just have a little try at putting it through? Can you find out, my lovely Rob, what size head pins these are? Let's see if it'll just go through there. Uh, what do you love about this Rolo chain, Deb, while I'm doing that, just so I can do it with a it's without a camera on me? It's one of my favourite links because it's so smooth looking, um, but it's super, super strong. Yeah. So, you know, it's a lot stronger than it looks, which is fantastic because it means that it can carry um, a really decent size pendant so those labradorite that we had yes would fit on there perfectly um i just i just love it as a link and it makes a really cute little charm bracelet as well yeah um, it's gorgeous isn't it yeah just really nice I obviously it's a necklace so it's make a charm necklace but oh that'd be lovely yeah. i want to be completely honest with you the head pin won't go through so i need to find something a little bit smaller than that and i believe the gauge on that head pin um, was that's probably a Point six ish, so it's quite yeah, thick. So, so uh, a point, point four, four would be perfect. Yes, yeah. absolutely amazing. And everybody's got point four in their stash, haven't they? A lot of our kits have point four wire in. The last kit actually, um, Atlantic Abalone had it in, so that would be perfect. So just to prove to you guys at home that you can use, it's not just a chain, it's lovely to be a finished chain. And of course, you can make your pendants that just go over the chain, but if you wanted to wrap and link into them, that would be amazing. Over half the stock gone now. So many multi buyers. Clever people, Jean in Cardiff, Georgie in Renfrewshire. You've gone for four. Linda in Cardiff, you've gone for four. Um, we've got Kathleen in Essex going for two. Evelyn on those Scottish borders uh, going for three as well. Amazing value for money. Um, just to prove as well that it will make two bracelets look with ease. That's it, round my wrist twice. As I said earlier, larger wrist for a lady. <laughs> um, I've been doing a lot of working out recently, so maybe that I've, maybe I've built muscle onto my <laughs> wrist. Not so delicate anymore, but yes, two bracelets out of that, uh, which is absolutely amazing. And then obviously you'd use a spare bolt ring clasp, or maybe you want to make a little S hook out of it. It's gorgeous, it's lustrous, 95 sterling silver. Um, it's never really going to go down in price, is it? It's a precious metal, so you've got something there that's going to last a lifetime. And as I said, if you had joined me earlier and I he you heard me talking about... Um, India and um, my friend buying a standing silver chain out there, he spent 10 English pounds on a chain. Um, so when you think about that, that's where the silver is sourced from. Uh, 6.95, that's incredible value for money. Well done to everybody going for that. Uh, we'll leave it at the bottom of the screen if we've got any left. We've got, ooh, these would be perfect. And these would work on that chain really, really well. These are hanging connectors. Um, I love, love, love these. Look at those. Loads of texture. So silver plated copper hanging connectors. The outer diameter, that's what OD stands for, is approximately 47 by 7. So 7 mil is the outer diameter there. And then inside it's 5 mil. Basically means that you can put lots and lots of different threading materials through there. Uh, Debbie was talking about leather earlier. So think about all the textures uh, that you want to use in your jewellery making. Uh, maybe um, you only just started jewellery making and you want to start thinking about different materials. Oh, I've got a great idea about all the French wire, which I'm going to do as soon as I ask Debbie. But wow. you're getting five of these. Apologies, I've only got four in my box. A as well, a really big jump ring as well at the top. But let's have a little idea about the French wire going through it. Because you were talking earlier about how we would yeah. strengthen French wire. Yeah, you'd need to put either beading thread through or some um, wire through yep. to support it because it's not strong enough to actually support itself or anything else um, because it's it's obviously like a little spring so it will pull out shape but um, if you put some beading thread through 
then that will give it enough um, of a core, if you like, to be able to support the spring. So then you can start really doing different things with it and, and creating shapes with it. Oh. That's so pretty, isn't it? Isn't it? It's really lovely. It's yeah, very, very really simple. Works. But the fluidity behind it is gorgeous. Yeah. Now, the price point is coming in. That French wire is coming up in one hour's time. In one hour's time, you'll know that you've got that French wire. Seven ninety-five. So just over a pound a piece for those. You are getting five of them. And so many different mediums you can use, you know. Think outside the box with things like that. Have a look at the 30,000 products that we've got on our website. And just feast. Just think, oh, I'm going to try and find something that's five mil gauge. Try something new. Uh, that's the way that you kind of push your creativity, really, isn't it? Do feel free to join us on the text messages. We love your interaction. 60777, just make sure you start it with JM Studio. If you've got any questions for Deb, oh, we've got one lovely Sharon Louise. Good Hiya. evening, Martha, Deb, Rob and crew. Oh, good evening to you. Rob is our lovely producer tonight. We've also got Emma on cameras, uh, Maggie on floor, and the lovely, infamous Bruce <laughs> directing on our Friday night. You are infamous, Bruce. <laughs> You're infamous to me, because we never really get to see you, and we like that. We only ever hear about what you do, and you do it very well. Seven ninety-five <laughs> for five of those connectors. Oh, they are lovely, 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 aren't they? So we're moving on. We've got loads more for you. Ah, oh, I was hoping you were going to do this, Rob. Go on. First of all, um, the buyers are amazing. For me, this is a Gems of Distinction strand times four. Look at the length of it. It's huge and it is double stacked. So you're getting four, I would say, four strands of Peridot here for one price. 120 carats. They're graduated fasted Peridot drops. They measure five by three to seven by five. It's a, it's a massive, right, can we just have a little look? Let's have a little look. It should be that, shouldn't it, to be honest, as a Gems of Distinction strand. And you'd be really pleased with that. You've got loads on there. I really need to give these a count later. But no, we're giving you four times as much. That's nearly half a metre of Peridot. That's incredible, isn't it? It's, I love Peridot because it's completely natural. Um, so it gives you that kind of faith in Mother Nature again that this can be created and encapsulated in this beautiful gemstone. Um, so it is from Africa. They are, as I say, faceted drops. So if you did want to imagine with a 0.25 wire wrapping all of these little drops onto that chain that you've just gone for on your star by, it would be beautiful. Look at the strong brilliance coming out of each and every single one and that pleochroism. That means all the different colours you can see in that lime zesty green. Now that's the should be price on screen, £50 and 95 pence but Rob likes to set records he is in the jewelry maker book of records as the <laughs> lowest price guarantee and he is going down to 29.95 look at the size of the cuff that you could make out of this and then have some left can you imagine have you got like garden parties coming up if you're lucky enough to go to like lovely big posh sporting events like Wimbledon or Cheltenham and, and, you, and you've got a, a peridot cuff around your hand Let's have a little look at what that would look like. I've, l I've got rid of my other cuff, but imagine this necklace there is on that. Isn't that beautiful? Look at it. Gorgeous. Well, what you could do is put holes along the bottom of that necklace and collar off. and hang them off. Wow. Love, love, love. If you've got any of those um, looped rings that we sell, you know, the oh, rings with the yeah. little loops on yeah. as a little cluster ring. Let's have a little look at what that would look like. If you've got any ideas, do um, feel free to join us. Look how stacked and gorgeous it is. I cannot tell you what amazing value for money you've got there. You've got basically four strands of Peridot for £7.50 each. Love, 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 love. What a wonderful uh, hour. Now, the next hour, it's all about the French wire, 10 to 8, but we've got so many more. We've got bead scoops coming up for you as well. Uh, we've got Deb staying with us, so um, do stay tuned, and we'll see you after this break. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com.
Ruby is an incredibly popular gemstone here at Jewelry Maker. Its beautiful red tones are instantly recognisable as an incredibly precious gemstone. Ruby itself is a member of the Corundum family whose sister stone is going to be Sapphire. Ruby is the only member of this gemstone that has its own name. Now, when we look at ruby, we look for really beautiful, even tones, and these can run from rich reds, which are often referred to as pigeon blood ruby, right through to lighter, paler tones, almost going into the pink tones as well. Ruby is a birthstone for July, so it makes the perfect addition to your collection if you're looking for those unique presents. And it is the 40th wedding anniversary stone as well. Ruby itself is incredibly hard, being nine on the Mohs scale, making it perfect for all kinds of jewellery and we know that Ruby itself is the everlasting symbol of love. Are you new to jewellery making? Not sure where to start? Then head over to our website and check out our Get Started page. Watch the welcome message from presenter Carol and find out all about Jewellery Maker. Watch one of our easy to follow tutorials where our guest designers will teach you the basics and give you the confidence to start making earrings, bracelets and necklaces. If you prefer to simply have a go, then check out our starter kits. They contain everything you need including instructions, tools, gemstones and clasps allowing you to create your very first jewellery pieces. You can either watch the video tutorial or follow the step-by-step -step instructions to give you plenty of inspiration. We also have an array of beginners workshops that you can attend here at our studios and join our experienced designers and get a taste for this fabulous hobby. We will guide you through the basics to get you started making your own beautiful jewellery. Everyone is welcome in the jewellery making family so start your jewellery making journey today. Join guest designer Sarah Elvin for the introduction to bead looming DVD. Sarah will guide you through many techniques including adding beads, pattern creations, beading with chips, adding beads to warp thread as well as how to set up your bead loom. To get your hands on a copy, contact our call centre. Get creative with Jewellery Maker. When you place your first order with Jewellery Maker, we'll send you a free DVD and booklet to help you get started. The booklet is jam-packed full of information on gemstones, tools, threading, materials and findings. There are step-by-step -step instructions on how to make bracelets, earrings and necklaces. And the DVD includes easy-to-follow video tutorials. So what are you waiting for? Start your jewellery making journey today. Spinel is a historically important gemstone. It is often located in the same gravel beds as things like corundum, so your rubies and sapphires. Because it comes in the same colours, blues and reds, it's often mistaken as a sapphire. Now, this isn't to the detriment of spinel itself. It has its own important qualities such as great RI, so it's very, very reflective, and great dispersion as well. So it shows a lot of fire as the light hits the stone. From um, a historical point of view, um, one of the main important spinels actually sits in the crown of jewels and this was for a long time believed to be a ruby but recent genealogical testing has found the Prince's Ruby is actually a spinel. Good evening jewellery makers, my name is Martha Harrison, I am a GIA AJP which means I'm a, a 
accredited jewellery professional by the Gemological Institute of America. It sounds fancy, it just means that I kind of know what I'm talking about. So if you've got any questions, give us a text, JM Studio 60777. Um, we are live tonight from uh, the beautiful rolling hills of Warwickshire. We actually only moved in in September and it's coming into springtime now, so it's becoming even more beautiful where we work, which is a delight. Um, you can buy anything you've seen on today's shows, along with the 30,000 products on the website on 0800 644 Every single thing is covered by a 30-day money-back guarantee. And you get it all delivered, regardless of what you buy or how much of it you buy, for £2.95, which I think, I'm going to put my name down on it, is probably the best postage in packaging in the business as we speak. So, uh, feel free to give us a call. We've got loads coming up in the cell. We've got an amazing Ethiopian opal. Look at the size of this strand. It's incredible, it's natural, it's beautiful rounds. The pin fire that is coming off this is amazing. A gorgeous Ethiopian opal coming up for you in about sort of 20 minutes time perhaps. But the hero of this entire show, and in fact this entire week, if you were watching last night with the lovely Hannah, our amazing sales manager Scott put together a French wire deal. Now I'm also a sales manager in my day job. I'm not going to let Scott have all the glory. So today me and Rob put uh, together a French wire deal for you, um, which is incredible. You've been waiting for it all night long. It is coming up in 45 minutes time. Everybody wants the French wire. It's only ever been seen in kits before. Deb's going to talk us through all the different things you can do with it, but it's gorgeous and you're getting loads and loads. So I'm excited for you. What I need you to do is as soon as you see the codes, you need to check this out. Remember, buy more than one. Don't miss out like you did last night. We've also got a beautiful bead scoop for you in the monochrome, but we've put some um, sterling silver, sorry, not sterling silver, silver plated star head pins with them as well, which I've just popped some on there. Aren't they gorgeous? So you can make instant earrings with your bead scoop as soon as you get uh, them home. They're coming in at half past six today. Sorry, we're in the seven o'clock hour now, aren't we? I'm thinking it's six o'clock. Um, it's not, guys, so don't worry about that. The Archers is on right now. It's seven minutes past seven. Loads to show you. I should introduce our fabulous guest. She's my absolute favourite. It's Deb Rudge. Hello, Deb Rudge. Hello. Am I your absolute favourite too? Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> you say that to all the presenters, don't you? Well, you've got to. <laughs> you do. You've got a kit coming up and a, and a get started hour for us at eight. So what are you going to yeah. show us then? Oh, we've got some fantastic colours again in the, the kit. Yep. Um, it's a bead scoop, isn't it, in the kit? A bead scoop. Lovely. And there's tons and tons of wire. So we'll be looking at some techniques around um, wrapping a top drilled drop lovely my one of my favorite things to do because it's instant jewelry so it's really yeah, quick nice and, easy and easy to make it looks amazing as well yeah. i do remember with every order you get a copy of the hub the hub uh, comes out every month and it's really about being in our jewelry maker gang you get to know about the trends um you get to know what's coming up what special shows are on what special workshops are on so that's the spring issue of the hub also if you're completely brand new to jewelry maker we welcome you in Join us, we're an amazing family. You do get, on your first order, a Get Started DVD and a Get Started booklet, which shows you really um, essential things like looking through the toolkit, um, what findings mean, what threading materials mean, how to make bracelets, necklaces as well, as well as all of our information on uh, our social networking. Please join us on Facebook. That is gorgeous. So, loads to show you. There's French wire in every single box because I think I've showed it with everything. Let me just pop <laughs> these in a little dish for you. We've got some pure white gold. <gasps> now, about three weeks ago, we launched our precious metals. Thank Emma for the big bowl, otherwise they would have gone everywhere. Now, let's see if I can hold these for you. These are pure and opulent and gorgeous. Nine carat white gold. They are the last in stock. They're round spacer beads. What? Oh, oh. oh no. Maggie will have to find it for me. Uh -oh. We will find it and pick it up for you. Don't worry. They are three mils. I'm going to hold my hand just like that. So if it drops, I will catch it. Ten pieces in each pack. Three mil with a very generous um, drill hole on there. Oh, you see what I just did? They're very difficult to hold tight. There we go. The lustre and the opulence of white gold, guaranteed 
gorgeous, 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 precious metals. They went crazy when we first launched them. Now we were always talking about, especially when you use your high-end gemstones, your tanzanites, your pearls, your diamonds, you should always use the most opulent finding you can. And until, as I say, three weeks ago, we didn't have any pure gold uh, on the channel. And now we've got the white gold, the rose gold, and the yellow gold. I think they've all sold out apart from these ones, £19.95 for genuine white gold. 10 pieces in every pack, so that's 10 3 mil beads. You can see them all there. Isn't that glorious? Really, really beautiful. Flying out the doors for that 0800 644 655. Remember, you got your money back guarantee. Have a little look. Uh, have a little shop around. We welcome you to. What can you find in white gold for under £20? Amazing, they are beautiful, beautiful indeed. They are fiddly, sorry, they're, they're quite difficult to hold. Gorgeous, what would you do with these, Deb? Do you know, I'm, I'm feeling inclined to be making an Eslon uh, macrame bracelet Ooh. with just maybe three of these at the front. Yeah, wouldn't that be That'd lovely? That'd be really, really nice. And it's like case. everything you see in boutique shops. Yeah. Beautiful. But they just pop in one of those in the center of a pearl necklace would look amazing um, or um, or as earrings and just keep it really simple um, just with the the gold bead on an earring gorgeous oh they are lovely well done to everybody going for those and thank you to lovely maggie for picking up the one on the floor i promise we haven't lost it well found uh, well <laughs> found indeed uh, lots more to show you Ooh, this enamel chain. Love this. Haven't seen this before. Only seen it in kits. Apologies, it's still in the bag. I do apologise. Look at the colour on this. Oh, me and Deb really love vintage stuff. Mm. And to me, this enamel is perfect, perfect, perfect. We always talk about spectacle chains, don't we? Wouldn't that be a lovely spectacle chain? It's one metre um, in the green brass gold plated train. That doesn't make any sense. So that you've got the brass chain there, which is obviously that lovely gold mm. colour, and the green doesn't refer to the brass, it refers to the enamel drum. Uh, it's on a 1.5 mil chain, the 1.5 relates to these little loops here, and then the drum is 4x2, but it's a gorgeous kind of um, Japanese-y green, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's got that fabulous yeah. jade kind of quality to it, hasn't it? Well, like, they um, are lush. Like deco enamel work, that yes. sort of green. Yeah, really, really lovely. An entire one metre for you. As I say, never been seen on its own before. I really, really dig this. Really gorgeous and vintage. Beautiful, beautiful. 8 95 wow. Let's show you how much we've got on there. Those um, uh, little enamel drums are about every centimetre or so. That is huge, isn't it? Look at it. Really, really pretty. Oh, I'm just thinking, I'm still in love. I'm still thinking about that sea green cousin. Yeah, I was as well. That would be perfect, <laughs> wouldn't it, on just a little train here. Let's show you as well around the neckline. If you wanted to double it up, you could make a really nice two-tier necklace. That's all you'd need, wouldn't you? Sometimes mm. I think it's best to go understated. Yeah. And I've got plenty left there. Oh, that's really nice. £8.95. It's not costume jewellery, is it? It's so much more, really... Not when it's... Go oh, it is gold-plated on top of brass. I'm sorry I didn't draw your attention to that earlier, guys. And as well, if you're thinking about festival time, we were talking about the Cambridge Folk Festival earlier. Mm. Excuse my old lady wrinkles, but that looks pretty <laughs> good, doesn't it? <laughs> what do you reckon? Old lady wrinkles. They are all oh, they're massive. Oh, no. <laughs> sorry, Maggie, I'll look in that camera. Eee! Beautiful, beautiful <laughs> work. Oh, it's all about the vanity tonight, isn't it? That's lovely. Again, teamed up, um, maybe you want to do four. Um, if you pop it on a, a jump ring at the end, that would make a lovely bracelet as well. Well done. We're going super speedy tonight. I'm going to show you as much as we can. If there's anything you do want to see, give us a text, 60777. Ooh. Maybe you got the lab cabs earlier. Now, in that same style of the, as the Amatrine rondelles we showed you earlier, look at this beautiful strand of Alba uh, not amylite, labradorite. 100 carats, they graduated fasted rondelles. There's some serious colour going on here, guys. 6 by 3 to 8 by 4 on a 21 centimetre strand. Every single one I can see blue coming through. And when you get it home in your natural daylight, or maybe you've got um, a special crafting light in your um, 
in a special crafting light in your craft room a lot of people have daylight bulbs yep. so they can see everything perfectly yeah. imagine the colors that you're going to get coming out of there they are beautiful i believe it's going to be an insane prize it's completely natural if you don't know about labradorite um, labradorite refers to where it was first discovered in canada in labrador but it's all about the labradorescence that metallic light shimmer and it's all about that price point 9.95 that is amazing Feel free to give us a call. This is not going to hang around for very long. 0800 644 655 or on jewelrymaker.com. Amazing quality, isn't it? Let's have a little look at what it would look like just re-stranded around the neckline. As I say, really quick makes. Take it off that uh, temporary strand, put it on your threading material, crimp beads on the end and a little clasp and you would do super well. You know what? He's going down. He's going to take the PMP off for you today. It's not just for new viewers. Oh no, but we do welcome you in be a great strand to buy if you've never bought off jewelry maker before it's for everybody 6.95 for genuine gemstones my friends and uh, maybe you're using glass or um, plastic or crystals in your jewelry making at the moment uh, you know hopefully you just joined us on jewelry making you've seen these amazing same kind of price points as crystal and glass but genuine gemstones that look like this yeah. Yeah. They're incredible aren't they it how is. do we it's do it it's amazing absolutely it amazing we should have done amazing bingo. How many times we've both said amazing tonight? Oh yeah, it's incredible <laughs> value for that money. I've got a bad word tonight. <laughs> <laughs> but do you see that shiller that's coming out of them every time that you move? So if you put it on quite an articulated strand or something quite loose, look at all the colours you get coming out of that. I adore it. You cannot go wrong. Remember, with a French wire, thirty-five minutes till our French wire. Look at how the gold makes that labradorite pop. Oh, that's nice. Oh, you know what? We're going to go from Labradorite, one of your favourites, to Tanzanite next. Oh, yummy, 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 yummy. Yep, this is Tanzanite. It's huge. 35 carats of Tanzanite. Graduated fasted rondelles from 2x1 to 6x3. Tanzanite, guys, if you've never heard of it, one location gemstone. Probably will be de uh, depleted in our lifetimes because they've been mining it for quite a while now. It's from the Zoocyte family. Uh, Tiffany's actually that famous jeweler from America launched a gemstone in 1969. It is particularly unique because it is pleochroic. What does that mean? It means that there's different colours coming out of those blues from every single angle. So you've got lilacs and lavenders and violets. And it's that real deep saturation of colour that you want on a gorgeous um, gemstone strand. We were talking to Steve Bennett, who um, still helps us source our gemstones here at Jewelry Maker, and he says that they're now being mined at under, um, sorry, over 800 meters down. So we are really exhausting this Tanzanite. Incredible! It should be 27 pounds and 95 pence, but we're going. I don't understand, Rob. Did you not just hear what I was talking about to the customers at home? about how unique it is and how rare it is. And it's 19.95, he's taken some money off you. He wants you to get it home and I want you to get it home too. To have a look at it, to test out our quality. Do download that certificate of authenticity as well. It's 25 pence and a few Tanzanites on, an, on a pearl necklace or on a sterling silver chain like earlier or matching them up with the Biwa pearls. Look at that, how fabulous would that be? It's all about being unique and being creative in your gem, um, jewelry making. And gemstones like this, they kind of, they give you more than the inspiration. They are the inspiration, they, aren't yeah, they? Definitely, absolutely true. They, I know this may be controversial, Oof. but I would use those as bases in between that Labradorite strand. Oh yes, or, or what about the, the Burmese, Burmese sapphire? Burmese sapphire, absolutely perfect. Wow, yeah. so you've got Tanzanite's actually been elevated into the big five now. So the big five being diamonds, rubies, emeralds, sapphires, and then your Tanzanite. Look at those two wow. blues side by side. That is lovely, isn't it? Really, really beautiful. And the two of those would be under eighty pounds with just your one PMP of two ninety five. Get it home, give it a try. What do you want to make with it? We'd love to hear about it. It's absolutely stunning, isn't it? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Well done to everybody going for it. Got loads more to show you. Some lovely peach moonstone next. Ooh, it's a yummy peach as well. Real apricot colour to it. Uh, still with the fabulous um, moonstone shiller. And I'll tell you all about that. You can see in each and every single one of these moonstones, it's like we've captured the moon in a gemstone. We've encapsulated it. It's why it's got that very magical feel to it. 30 carats of peach moonstone, completely natural. 
means they're being a member of that Feldspar family. Very, very gorgeous and obviously named after the Schiller of the Moon and that iridescence that's coming out of there. It is Norwegian Moonstone and um, quite frankly, I believe that's one of the best um, locations for Moonstones because you do get the optical properties in a lot of the gemstones, certainly on this strand. It's gorgeous. You know, um, Eleanor was talking the other day about having an essential pair of nude shoes if you are a lady mm -hmm. in your wardrobe. If you have a nude necklace like this, it's going to go with absolutely every outfit. £5.95. We have to honour that last price. You see there, I've put it around my wrist twice. Can you imagine it with just a big clasp? Wouldn't that be lovely and elegant? It's perfect, isn't it? It's going to go with absolutely everything. I love, love, love it. It's been set in jewellery for hundreds and that, in fact, thousands of years. And if you do go, if you're lucky enough to live near London, uh, and you go to the V&A Museum, they've got loads of Roman jewellery in there with examples of moonstone like this. So a real heritage to this stone, um, really inspiring. And as I say, just a lovely colour. It's going to go with everything, isn't it? Really do adore it. It would certainly go with the French wire, wouldn't it? Let's choose the silver as well. So you think um, silver or gold, Deb, for this moonstone? What do you reckon? Um, I quite like, actually, I was going to say the gold, but I quite like the silver because it's picking up the highlights and the, um, the, sh the shillid that you're getting across the surface. If you look at the, the um, yeah, it's silver. Silver, for sure. There's a decision. What do you think at home, guys? Give us a <laughs> Took text. Took me a while, didn't it? Honestly. 60777. Give us a text. Now, Rob had a good idea. Rob said, why don't you just twist it together? Ah. And then do it. And then in, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it because it's very fiddly no. in the studio. It's, it's so fluid, you'd need to put wire inside through it. Uh, point 0.4 or 0.6, thread the wire through, and then twist it. And then Lovely. it would hold the twist. But that would work. Oh, yeah. yummy, yummy, yummy. Well done to everybody going for the Moonstone. So many 5.95 price points tonight. What can you buy for 5.95? Amazing. We've got loads more to show you, though. We've got some smoky quartz pears coming up for you. Oh, yum. These are these are really delightful. We don't see a lot of smoky quartz anymore. I remember last year at Jury Make, we had um, smoky quartz on every day, but I haven't seen smoky quartz for ages and ages, and these are beautiful. And if you do join us at 8 o'clock tonight, we'll be able to show you how you wrap these gorgeously. So, 120 carats of smoky quartz, graduated faceted pears from 11 by 8 on the smallest, so perfect for earrings, going all the way up to 16 by 11 on an 18 centimetre strand. They have been smoked. It's Brazilian quartz, which is uh, world renowned for being beautiful clarity of quartz. Let's just pick out this big, gorgeous big fat one here. I need to think of a better word than fat, plump. sorry. Plump, plump, <laughs> plump. Look at this plump one here. <laughs> He's gorgeous, isn't he? Look at the way the facets, um, you don't often think of smoky quartz as sparkly, do you? But look at that got some great um, red carpet sparkle coming in there. That is glorious indeed. Remember, it's really easy to order on 0800 644 655. If you're brand new to us, come and join us. Give us a try. What have you got to lose? 30-day money-back guarantee, and all of you get started, and then you're in the family, and you can join us every single day we are live, even Christmas Day from 8 o'clock in the morning until 9 o'clock at night. That price is going down. Everybody pays that lowest price, 7 95 I genuinely believe this was a 1995 strand, Rob. And, and uh, I've been working here quite a while, so I don't know what you're doing with these prices. It's amazing, isn't it? Lovely, lovely kind of um, cognac-y colours coming through as well. It's a really warm chocolate to it because it does have that transparency as well. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Of course, as well, you can see on this temporary strand that we've given you little spacer beads. I often think that little things like that, don't throw them away. You can always use those little mirrored beads uh, for something else as well. So you're getting loads and loads coming through. Um, lots of Sandras tonight. This is the Sandra strand. <coughs> Sandra in Cambridgeshire. I wonder where you're in Cambridgeshire, Sandra. That's where I'm from. And I love it and I miss it. Sarah in Worcestershire, you're just up the road. You could come to a workshop. Uh, we've got a great beginner's workshop with the legendary Linda Brumwell, um, which basically means <laughs> if you've never jewelry made before, oh, it's a great day. And actually, everybody that comes to work at Jewelry Maker goes on that course, so we all know what we're talking about. Even, even lovely Rob's on that course. Did you enjoy yourself, Rob? Of course you did, of course. 
I will find out when the next one's coming up. We have one a month of those, so they're brilliant. Lots more to show you, though. Yes, yes, yes. We've got some sterling silver for you. So, you remember we talking earlier about... Um, what was I talking about? About the moonstone and putting a little clasp on it. This is a lovely decorative clasp. Oh, 95, sterling silver, high polish. You can see that high polish on there, can't you? On the S hook, 14 by 6 with the jump ring, and the jump ring is 4 mil and a obviously a, um, a 95 sterling silver. That is gorgeous, isn't it? Quite nautical, Deb. Yeah, it is. It's a bit rope-like, isn't it? Yeah. Serpenty as well, like a sea serpent. Or Absolutely. Look, this monster. Could be, couldn't it? It's not a I don't think it exists. idea, is it's it? Where's not, my but brain gone? <laughs> but uh, nautical jewellery and nautical themes in jewellery are always really, really popular, aren't they? So that would work really beautifully. In fact, with the blues of the Tanzanite, I think that silver would really Ooh, pop it out yeah. nicely. So if you did, were lucky enough to get that under £20 Tanzanite that we just did, if you missed it, it's on the website, so have a little look. And um, you could team it up with this. It's just lovely. And again, it's, it's got Gorgeous. a plumpness to it, hasn't it? Look at how yeah. thick that banding is there. Oh yeah, it's, it's a really solid clasp, which is nice, because you know it's not going to be moving. And Because you tend to use your sterling silver with things that are, are a bit more high end, mm -hmm. you know that's going to be a reliable, safe clasp to use. It's gorgeous, really, yeah. really beautiful. I haven't seen it, it before. I think it was only, remember it being pretty new into the warehouse about a week ago. Um, so I'm amazed we've got any stock left. There's the should be price, £14 and 95 pence but that price is going down remember everybody play uh, pays that lowest price regardless of when you check out because we charge your credit card at midnight 6.90 that's more than half price and it's brand new that's amazing really really gorgeous and so simple to incorporate in your designs and i always think when you've got a real high-end clasp on it doesn't matter if your necklace swings all the way around does it because uh, what they're seeing there is 95 sterling silver so like me if you're just somebody um all i do um at the moment because i haven't got much time at the moment but when i do have is restrand things like pearls because i just love pearls regardless of what they are all you need to do is restrand and pop that clasp on and let me show you what it would look like with the bur pearls i think you'll agree that you're going to get like a at least a kind of 50 pound boutique look mm from a strand of pearls that were 12.95 and a clasp that was 6.95 a finished um, example of that with obviously your beading thread through it i'm going to say you can double your price easily even if you're selling on a craft fair they are beautiful 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 6.95 for that gorgeous stunning silver clasp well done to anne in county durham collector in greater london uh sheena in washington you've gone for three we've got a star buy coming up for you next <laughs> Oh, now it was the talk of the town um, a week ago, wasn't it, Rob? I think when we bought our bead scoops back in stock. It takes us a long time. We launched them on the morning show about a week and a half ago with our lovely L. They are called Lucky Dip um, Gemstone Scoops because basically it's all manner. We can guarantee the colours, and this colour range is black and white, so it's kind of monochromes. Uh, but we basically put different shapes, different sizes, and obviously lots of different gemstones. So if you've lost your mojo, uh, if you've lost your mojo, then you are going to be great with this bead scoop because it just inspires you. Look at some of the sizes that we've got here. They are huge, and the different cuts as well. Uh, we've got some shell, we've got some agates, um, we've got some quartzites. Um, there's actually some lovely obsidians in here as well. But not only are we giving you a bead scoop, we're giving you the silver-plated copper star headpins as well. well. Look at these. You're getting 100 in total. They're like little fireworks that have gone off. They are beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So all you'd need to do, like I have done here, I've just taken an agate. Uh, I believe it's an agate. Popped it on. And all you'd need to do is um, bend your wire around to make a shepherd's hook. And you've got perfect earrings. So as I say, really inspiring. Um, I want to show you as much as I can out of the scoop. Do you have a white board, please, lovely Maggie, so I can pull them out and show everybody as they are black and white. I think they'll get lost on this board. Um, what You had a bead scoop, didn't you, in your kit, uh, Deb? What do you love about bead scoops? I, d I do love the fact that it's you're not quite sure 
what you're going to have. Yeah. Um, and so that makes you think a bit differently when you tip it out onto your, your board or your tray. Um, and then you start sorting through. Your, your brain starts going and, and you just come up with so many different ideas that you might not if you stuck to the, the sort of gemstones that you normally go for. So, um, I mean, they're just, they are really exciting. Yeah. Because it's like having a, a present. It is, isn't it? And sometimes we get stuck in a, not stuck in a rut, but like I really need to move on from pearls now. I'm going to move on to calcedony because I just know I'm going to get a fantastic result. But sometimes it's good to challenge yourself, isn't it? It is, yeah. I mean, as guest designers, we challenge you all the time with the kits that we send you out, don't we? So yes, that kind of keeps you on your, keep, keeps you on your, <laughs> your toes in kind of um, in the way that you're always evolving your jewellery. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're always... Um, looking at different things you can do. Um, so it's nice to get a bead scoop that, that then pushes you and makes you think differently or put together combinations of gemstone that you might not normally think of putting together. So um, that's, that's what I like about them is the unexpected quality yeah. that you get with them. And to have these head pins as well. Um, oh, how, yeah. Do you use a lot of head pins in your jewellery making? I actually use loads of them. Yeah. Because I, I like doing um, things that have got movement and articulation in. And with a head pin, you can get that because you can either hang pieces off mm -hmm. other pieces, you can make rosary links with them, um, you know, by cutting them up and using them as effectively as wire. Yeah. Um, but also you can wrap them around and make them into springs and different oh, types oh of Oh yes, just like movement. little fireworks yeah. going off. Yeah. Perfect. That price is going all the way down. It's gonna be a star buy price. A star buy is something that we are really behind. Five ninety five for the scoop and the head pins. You're getting a hundred of those head pins and the fifty mil on them relates to how long they are. And Deb was just saying, you can certainly cut them down and use yeah. the rest of the length on there. Uh, there are 0.6 in their diameter, I believe. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. 595. That seems to be the price tonight, doesn't it? That's absolutely <laughs> incredible. Uh, because those head pins are plated copper, copper's really easy to use, isn't it? It is, yeah. Yeah, it's. I like copper because it has a little bit more resistance to it. Um, not that it's hard to work, but it just holds shapes really, really well. Wow. So I, I love that. that that you can put a piece of metal into a shape and it just stays there. It's, it's, it's clever. It is clever. <laughs> clever this, stuff. Is, this is one of my favourite ones here. We've got like What's a crackled effect on the quartz. Oh yeah. yeah. Beautiful. And here's a lovely centre drill drop. Really, really busy. Well done to Jane in Wiltshire, Vanessa in Gloucestershire, collector in Merseyside. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. We are live. I'm going to give you an 18 minute warning, Claxon. Have we got a klaxon, Bruce? <laughs> klaxon. A French wire klaxon. Would it, would it have a French accent to it? <laughs> oh. No, says Bruce. But we'll find, well, I'll, make, I'll come no. up with some sort of French wire klaxon noise for you in a minute and uh, we'll see where we're going. £5.95 <laughs> for those. Look at this really big one as well. Oh, caught it. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. This could be almost... Um, you don't have to just make them into jewellery. This could be... Um, a pulley for your uh, bathroom light, can it? Yeah. How oh, opulent would that be? Or a button be? for a bag. Or a what, sorry? Button for a bag. Oh yeah, really nice, like a toggle button. Yeah, yeah. That'd be lovely. And also we've got some centre drilled ones as well in here. Obviously we can't guarantee what you get, but it's a good old lucky dip, isn't it? So you could, draw, um, you could put some gemstones in the middle here. They'd be fabulous, like funky... Um, Earrings, 60s earrings, wouldn't they? Lovely, oh, lovely, yeah. lovely. Well done to everybody that went for our style buy. Um, I'm going to hand that to lovely Maggie to hopefully tidy this up. Maggie's our lovely camera lady tonight. Um, <laughs> I think that you'll hear a noise Shave now of it going everywhere. Off, Thank yeah. you, Maggie. <laughs> You're a if you take that one out and that one out as well, that'd be great. Cheers. Are you going to be okay? Were you a waitress in a former life? Never. Never. Oh, oh she's going <laughs> to... Bye, it's you. like some cruel game, it is, isn't, isn't it? it? I'm really yeah. sorry, Maggie. Mm. <laughs> We've got some pink amethyst coming up for you next. Oh, oh. I love this strand. 
I really, well really, done. really love this strand. This is gorgeous. So 100 carats of pink amethyst, graduated faceted rondelles. They measure four by two to eight by four. They are divine. Look at the cutting on those. And remember, all of our gemstones are hand cut. Can you imagine to get all of the facets on tiny little rondelles from four by two? Um, how difficult is that? How much time does that take to get them beautifully uniformed? And then they colour grade them all and match them on a beautiful strand like this. It is exceptional. They have been slightly heated to bring out that gorgeous, delicate pink colour. But I don't know if the crocuses are coming up in your garden at the moment, but that to me is like a crocus purple. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let's have a little look what it looks like against skin tone. It's a really substantial strand. They are chunky indeed. And look at that. The fasting really brings out that, as I say, the colour and the depth of it. Uh, and obviously amethyst is February's birthstone as well. Um, so if you do make a birthstone jewellery, which I know a lot of people uh, do now, um, they would make perfect earrings, wouldn't they? Can you imagine? Really, really beautiful. Obviously amethyst comes in lots of different shades. If you went for the smooth rondelles earlier, of the ametrine they would match up perfectly wouldn't they very very gorgeous there's your should be price 17.95 it's a beautiful beautiful strand rob well done for finding this there's something really feminine really really very stunning about it it is 11 pounds 95 we've just taken six pounds off that strand for you tonight. Well done for tuning in. Remember, you can order on 0800 644 655. Go to jewelrymaker.com. If you press the Watch Live TV button, all the products from today um, are listed under there. So if you joined us this morning with Carol, maybe before you went to work, uh, or maybe uh, this afternoon with lovely Zena. Wow, wow, wow. You can also see what's coming up in the week as well. Tomorrow starts our challenge weekend. And there's so much excitement coming up for you there. So well done to everybody going for that gorgeous pink amethyst. Have we got time to have a little look around the neckline? Let's have a little look around the neckline then and see. It kind of goes again with my pink hair. Um, I want to do a poll, actually, Deb, because I'm thinking about silver hair next. What do we think of silver oh. hair? Might do that for Sunday. That Washes does out pretty quickly. Does it? Yeah. Everybody do said, it? I asked Laura Binding that, and she it's was like, mm, silver? Oh, it's I don't know. It's quite daring. Okay, I'm going to do it then. I, yeah. You double dare me. Yeah, I dare you to do it. Go gorgeous, on. gorgeous pink amethyst. Beautiful. Now, another klaxon for the French wire. It's 13 minutes now. 13 minutes until the French wire comes on. Well done to everybody going for that pen. beautiful pink amethyst. We've got loads more, though, to show you. Ooh. I've shown you this strand before. This is amazing, and just you wait until you see the price. In fact, please check it out now, and I will guarantee you an amazing price. 30 carats of ruby, emerald, and sapphire. Look at the colours. They are so beautiful. You're getting far, uh, three of the big five on one strand. Um, so we like to call it a taster strand, don't we? Uh, because really, you're getting to taste three of those massive, well-known gemstones. Maybe you can't quite stretch to a strand of each getting so much on there, aren't you? So the ruby is obviously those beautiful reds, uh, the emerald, those gorgeous greens, and then the sapphire, all the fancy colours. So you're getting the yellow sapphire, a little bit of orange sapphire as well in there, which is called Pad Paracha. That is that's very orange, actually, next to those four rubies. Do you see it there in the middle? Three by one, they measure these rondelles, up to five by two millimetres. And it's a 14 centimetre strand. But as I say, if, you, if your crafting budget, your jewellery making budget, only goes a little way each month. This is a perfect strand for you to buy, isn't it? You absolutely cannot go wrong. You make an amazing tennis bracelet with this. In comes your price. It's going all the way down. This must be the last of stock now because I did bring this to you the other week. 12 95 My word. Let me show you those paparaccia oranges in the middle. Uh, if you've got time or if you're on the internet right now, go and have a little look at what paparaccia sapphire commands. That beautiful um, sunset um, yellow there. That is gorgeous, isn't it? Yummy, yummy, yummy. Wow, wow, wow. Get your certificate of authenticity as well. All you'd need is about an inch of each colour on a necklace, just like that, on a sterling, maybe with that Rolo chain earlier. And that would look lovely, wouldn't it? Wow, I am blown away by that. 
So, so busy, Joe in Greater London, June in Aberdeenshire. Thank you for joining us. Collector in Yorkshire, you've gone for two, it's no wonder. Janet in mm -hmm. County Durham, uh, Sheila in Washington. Sheila, is that the Washington and Tyne and Weir or the Washington in the United States of America? Because we ship to you in the United States as well as Australia, Denmark, France, Germany and many other places. Have a little look at our delivery on our jewelrymaker.com uh, website. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Another warning for you, 10 minutes. <laughs> 10 minutes till the French Wire. We've got loads more to show you though. Oh yeah. I've been saying oh yeah to everything, haven't I? It's just so, I don't want to sound like um, a sycophant, but I love working here at Joy Maker because you get to play with such beautiful gemstones and these are glorious ammonites. Um, I, we don't often have ammonites on. They are perfect to um, wire wrap into gorgeous pendants and in fact they're just magical to kind of have inspiring you perhaps um, on your dressing table do you know what I mean because there's just so much going on there let's have a little look at where this product comes from 250 carats of fossil ammonite spiral cabochons can you just change my details for me lovely Rob lovely so these are completely natural and they're from Morocco so you might have heard of our amylite now the amylite is sourced from the other side of the um, gemstone you can see in fact on this one there's loads can you see all the gorgeous greens and reds and that kind of rainbow shiller beautiful look at what's going on there but really each and every one tells a story doesn't it these are thousands of years old completely organic uh, natural as well so there we go I do apologize I'm just trying to make sure you guys can see all the colors and the beauty that's going on there they are ethically um, sourced obviously the patterns are always going to be different it's like it's like a um, it's like a fingerprint actually it's called mathematically it's called a fractal quite interested in fractals myself um, so you can see beautiful things going on in the shapes they're just wondrous to have around as I say if you don't want to use them in your jewelry they're very inspiring 24.95 for those um, 24.95 but that price is going down I'm just gonna hold out one to make sure that you can see there you go you can see all the colors 19.95 we do uh, guarantee the carat weight and then this one I've got four uh, for you available for 250 carats that's a great size though isn't it for a pendant maybe you want to put it with um, leather that would look really nice again it's quite uh, manly if you wanted to make uh, some jewelry for men it'd be perfect Deb what would you do with these I've um, made a necklace and prong set them yeah um, using antique bronze wire oh yeah and it's just quite earthy works brilliantly with them because you want the star of your, your piece, the design, to be these rather than what you're doing around them, I think. Um, so the antique bronze wire just works really nicely it's with lovely, them. It's lovely, isn't it? Complements them well. Fabulous. So. Uh, please feel free again to have a look at competitive pricing on Amalite um, because they are very difficult to source and quite expensive in other places. So we've got loads more to show you. The other Labradorites sold out. Uh, no, I believe that we've done this one already. Oh, okay. So if you did miss the earlier plain rondelles that sold out very, very quickly, we've got a similar one for you here. 104 carats of Labradorite graduated plain rondelles. They measure 5 by 2 to 9 by 4 on an 18 centimetre strand. Look at that blue. So that's the Labradorescence, that metallic light shimmer. And that is amazing. Now, I don't know if you bought Labradorite a few years ago after um, Off Jewelry Maker, but in the last year and a half, we've managed to source the most amazing Labradorite. This one's actually from Africa. The previous one was Madagascan, wasn't it? This is natural, natural, natural. Those rondelles, they measure 5 by 2 to 9 by 4. Well, we've got to match the same price, really, haven't we? All the way down with that two pound ninety five PMP a day, six ninety five. I don't think the other one was six ninety five, was it? <laughs> wow, wow, wow! I think I thought it was an eight ninety five, but I won't say anything now. It's too late. He's pressed the button. <laughs> Once you press the button in the computer, it sets the price across the website as well. There's nothing we can do about it. Um, so well done to you guys for getting that. That's an incredible six minute warning to our French wire. 
Lovely, lovely. <laughs> a wooga is the name. I believe that's a painted uh, Craig Charles forward slash Red Dwarf uh, ism, if you people watch TV in the 90s, which most of our young crew here today didn't. But I know Maggie did. Uh, I know Deb did. Yeah, yeah totally. <laughs> it's true, isn't it? Um, so well done to Vilma in Greater London, Sheila in Washington. Sheila, we need to know if you're in glamorous Washington in, in America or even more glamorous Washington in Tyne and Weir. Please let us know where you're from. Uh, 60777 on the text message. Loads of you got this in baskets. Guys, I can't guarantee that you're going to get it because the phones override the baskets. We don't want to scare you, but just press check out. You can check out as many times. If you want to check out 200 times a day, you can do that. You're still going to pay that one delivery charge of 295 Oh eight hundred six triple four six double five. We've got loads more to show you. We had those rose cut diamonds earlier. Now we've got some black diamond nuggets, and they are gorgeous. Now they come in this fabulous packaging. Look how opulent, and rich that is. Wow, 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 wow. So let's get them out. They are quite secure. So apologise if I pull them out. Now it says black diamonds, but they've got a beautiful silver luster to them in my opinion. They're lush, aren't they? So, 11 carats of black diamond, graduated rough nuggets. They measure two by one uh, to four by one on a 13 centimeter strand. I saw a guest designer um, just take maybe four or five of these, rosary link in between with sterling silver mm -hmm. on a necklace and that was it and it was incredible. You know when you look yeah. at something and you're like, if that was in a shop right now, I'd spend 40 quid on that and I wouldn't even yeah. think about it. Beautiful, beautiful diamonds. Obviously, they are um, nuggets, so they haven't been faceted. They've been faceted by nature, so to speak. They are slightly graduating on that strand. Let me hold that strand out for you so you can see the little graduations on there. But just, um, Deb's just shot something across the studio. Sorry. Yeah? What was it, Deb? It was wire. Apologies. I thought I so had right, it. Me, me and Maggie have both still Sorry, got our eyes. Sorry, Maggie. Apologies for interrupting your diamonds there. And what I was going to say was... Um, this is the only single <laughs> element gemstone in existence. Did you know that? It's pure carbon in diamonds and they are completely glorious. I was going to talk to you about channel setting. You can channel yes, set these, can you? Yes, you can. Yeah. The um, 0.25 wire goes through and they wrap onto frames really nicely. And it works brilliantly. So channel setting would work as well. Yeah, channel set ring would Ooh, be gorgeous. Let's see it? what it would look like in a ring. Is that all right? So if I can just have a little look round. Oh yeah, that'd be lush, wouldn't it? Mm. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So, a price point for your black diamonds, 11 carats. It's, uh, wow. 24.95. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Do let us know what you're doing with them. Do, do join in on the Wall of Fame every week on the morning show. You could potentially win 100 pounds and 50 pounds if you're runner up, credited to your account if you share your designs with us. And that's what um, Jewelry Maker is all about. Please pop your designs on Facebook. We love to see what kind of things you're making and what you're doing with these incredible gemstone strands. So um, we hope to inspire you, but please chuck the inspiration back in some sort of mm. Mexican wave of jewelry making. Well done, <laughs> Sheila's in for these. Hello, Sheila in Washington. I am in Washington in America. Oh, <gasps> Sheila, what time is it in Washington? What's the weather like? Is it really exotic and wonderful? I've never been to Washington. No, I've been I to haven't. New York and Chicago yep. and Philadelphia, but never Washington. No, I've not been to Washington. Let us know what it's all about, Sheila. Now, it's French wire clacks and sound <laughs> off. Please, please, as soon as you see the code, check out, check out, check out. And don't just buy one. It's coming up next, it's our star by. One of the biggest selling products this year happened yesterday, sold out in a heartbeat. It was a French wire uh, bundle that we made for you on the Late Show with the lovely Hannah. Uh, myself and Rob came on to shift today and we wanted to do the same for you. We knew so many people missed out and it, that's not what we like to do at Jewelry Maker. We want everybody to be able to have an opportunity to get a brilliant deal. So well done for joining us tonight if you missed out last night. This is the French wire bonanza. 
you're getting two of the 12 inch gold and silver plated French wires, uh, so two packs, so it's 60 pieces I believe in total, uh, 30 of each. I'll tell you what, I'll take you through them all individually. So 12 inches of gold plated French wire in the 0 0.9 and you're getting 30 pieces. 12 inches of silver plated French wire in the 0 0.7 and you're getting 40 pieces. And then you're getting two lots. Oh, okay. So your specs on your TV might be a little bit... Um, oh, they're fine. They're fine on the website. So just to remind you, so 60 of the 12 inch gold plated in the 0 0.9 and 80 of the 12 inch silver plated in 0.7. Apologies that I wasn't looking at you guys, um, but that is everything you could wish for. Deb, uh, for everybody that's new, what on earth is French wire? Well, traditionally, you would use it to protect your pearls from um, being rubbed and yep. against each other or a clasp. So you cut it into small sections and use tiny, tiny little pieces of it just between um, the pearl and the clasp uh, sure. at an end of the necklace for example and it's so flexible that it covers your beading threads goes through your clasp and comes back wow. and covers it and, and is is beautiful high-end finish on your pearls um, but there are so many other ways you can use it in, in a contemporary design by putting um, your wire or your beading threads through. I mean, you could tie knots into it. You could prop a macrame with it. I've not wow. tried that though, but I think that would look amazing. It's so tactile and smooth. It is smooth and, it's, and it's glossy. Really, and yeah, glossy is mm. the word, isn't it? So you were with me a few weeks ago um, at the Day at the Races weekend. You made some flowers out of it. How did you do that? Uh, yes, I made flowers. Um, with the bag charm kit. Oh yeah. So what I did was I, I popped um, some some wire through mm -hmm. the centre and then used that to basically support the um, the French wire. So it's it just provides the the core so that the spring because it's basically a really fine wire wrapped and wrapped and wrapped into a spring. So you need to provide something inside to support it and stop it being crushed. Yes, because it is incredibly um, delicate. I like wonder if we can tube. see down, down the end of that tube. And then what Put I will do, um, it doesn't have any memory. So once you stretch it out, mm, that's uh, it. you're pretty much done. So I'm going to stretch this one out. I hope I don't get told off for that. Uh, but you can see all of the little coils. But if you use it in fascinators, it's really light. Yeah, so you can put delicate. it onto hair combs, fascinators. I actually glued some feathers inside some of the uh, French wire that I used. And I, I um, put it over the top of memory wire as well, which fitted down perfectly. I'm not sure which size I had, but it fitted really nicely. So you can cover, if you've only got, say, um, a stainless steel and you wanted a gold coloured yeah. memory wire necklace you could pop this on and um, you'd end up with a really nice looking That's perfect. necklace so base. You can see how it transforms just from pulling it out there you get so much more as well I reckon your 12 inch length you yeah. could easily pull it out Triple, triple? Yeah, quad. easily. Yeah. Should I give it a go, actually? Well, that should be priced on the screen. £27.80. So just to remind you, in total, 60 pieces of the gold and then, f uh, and then 80 of the, ooh, of the silver. Let's see how long we can stretch it out for. It's going to go a long, 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 long way. Oh, yes, let's see, Maggie. Lovely Maggie on camera. There's a bit at the end there as well, Maggie. Can you pull it right from the end? Yeah. So this is one 12 inch strand <laughs> and it is it's going like Rapunzel, out. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. I, wow, oh, look at that. Is that about three metres? So easily 12 inches into at least, I'm going to say, if you bring it back to me now, Maggie, let's have a little look at what it looks like coiled up. Wow, 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 thank you. Look at all of that. So a little tiny bit goes a, a long way and then look at how beautiful and delicate that is. 
like you were saying sprays out of um yeah out of necklaces and wow so you could thank you, you could attach that onto a hair comb or um, a headband yeah and then have some pearls coming out on gold wire 1995 i believe Ooh. that beats the deal from last night 19 pounds 95 obviously it was a different deal that we had available but maybe you can quite stretch to last night's price point remember i just want to tell you again the 12 inches makes up to about three meters look at all of this isn't that incredible? I'm going to wind it around my uh, arm so you can see how many we've got going on there. Uh, hundreds of you going for this deal. I'm so pleased. And I'm, you know what? This is me and Rob doing our job properly, isn't it? Making sure that all you guys that sadly were disappointed and missed out last night managed to tune in and get it tonight. Well done to every single one of you. Colin in Cumbria, um, Collector in Yorkshire, Julie in Greater Manchester, Jill in Yorkshire, Swether in Greater London. You join us quite a lot. Uh, Margaret in Lanarkshire, Jenny in Cheshire. You've gone for two. More of you should be multi-buying. This is incredible value for money. Do you reckon you can crochet with this, Deb, when it's like this? Yeah. Beautiful. Yep. You could crochet it, you could knit it. Um, yeah. Could quite, you wrap, quite could you net with it when it was like this, do you think? I guess so, yeah. You could catch I a cabochon. So. But it's still got that texture, so it's it's like um, crinkled wire. It's beautiful, which is quite isn't nice. it? Absolutely yeah. amazing. £19.95. And as well, you can see there, there's the diameter, isn't it? Uh, that it was originally and if you just left those little bits out that adds another feature to it doesn't yeah it? it does yeah gorgeous 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 Wendy in Cambridgeshire well done every single one of you that is incredible value for money I'm really really chuffed that we managed to get this in today beautiful 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 indeed so 12 inches we reckon goes into I feel like I'm a knitter <laughs> a crocheter we reckon goes into about three meters so Rob can I do, do a challenge for you you tell me how many inches I've got in total, and then we'll make it into the three meters. So, <laughs> 80, 80 times twelve, because we're getting eighty. Oh no, we're getting more than eighty, aren't we? Yeah. In terms of the total, how many inches are we getting? Okay. So times that by the twelve inches, and then let's see how many in total we've got. One thousand six hundred and eighty inches. Wow, wow, wow. And because it is so malleable, this is terrible what I've just done, but I just want to show you how easy it is just to, even if you were just to make it into a little bow, this is awful, but you know what I mean? Into a little hair comb that looked like a little bow like that. How pretty is that? And if you put a little gemstone, let's imagine we get one of our opals. Hopefully we'll have time for this opal a little bit later on. But look at that. There's a little ad hoc little brooch it would be beautiful wouldn't it um just ad libbing for you but we love to try and give you as much inspiration as we can 19.95 do we have any opportunities left lovely rob those people do need to check out lots and lots of you in baskets wow 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 if you have any of this left we will certainly uh remind you as well um any other ideas for us deb any more, more inspiration well stitching it onto your leather your fabric stitching it into your lace just tracing around the, some of the patterns on your lace and and um, sewing it on with thread it you can glue it as well it glues onto um, your fabric which is uh, is quite cool if you're not into actually um, sewing anything wrapping but around uh, cuffs and things yeah you could do yeah Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Now, we've got a get started hour for you in the next hour, and we have got so much wire in your kit. I know. Uh, it's going to go with the beautifully yeah. with the gold French wire. So um, what are you going to show us at the top of the next hour? Um, we're going to look at how different ways to wrap drops, so ba a basic technique and how it can give you different effects. Lovely, lovely stuff. Uh, well done to everybody going for the French wire. Um, remember, if we have stock of it left still, it will say on the website... I uh, don't think it's quite sold out yet, so well done to everybody taking that opportunity. In the silver, in the gold, it's gorgeous. I haven't seen uh, anything like it before. As I say, it's previously, before this week, uh, always uh, been in kits. Uh, so we've got some lovely texts for us. Thank you for joining us. Hello, Margaret in Fife. Evening, JM. The French wire stretched would make dragonfly wings. Margot, I was just thinking about that, how you could put a body. I don't think I've got anything to show you a body. We've got some lovely rubies coming up later on. Can you imagine? 
making the body out of ruby oh. rounds. And it kind of is like a dragonfly, isn't it? Yeah. Make another set of wings. Oh, lovely guest designer Claire. Hey, lovelies. Carol in Bristol. Claire made chicks. It was amazing for Easter. That would be fabulous, wouldn't oh, it? Oh, yeah. Just limitless what you can do. And if you've never tried French wire before, what, what a bundle to go for. Yeah. Amazing, isn't it? Absolutely yeah, gorgeous. Now, really if good. you are watching us live, we're with you for another hour. But if you're watching the overnight repeats and it's 7 o'clock in the morning, Eleanor is going to be joining you at 8 a.m. And we will see you really soon. But do stay tuned uh, for what's coming up next. When you place your first order with Jewelry Maker, we'll send you a free DVD and booklet to help you get started. The booklet is jam-packed full of information on gemstones, tools, threading, materials and findings. There are step-by-step -step instructions on how to make bracelets, earrings and necklaces. And the DVD includes easy-to-follow video tutorials. So what are you waiting for? Start your jewelry making journey today. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. two easy ways you can purchase from Jewelry Maker. You can watch our show on Sky, Virgin, Freeview and Freesat and call our free phone number where you'll be put through to our friendly help team who can place your order. Alternatively, you can go to our website and click to register. Once you've filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking on the Watch Live Show button on the home page. You can also use our quick search tool and narrow down your results. Once you have found an item that you like, simply click on the Add to Basket button and you can continue shopping or check out right away. Don't forget you can add as many items to your basket per day for only one P&P. Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Moonstone is an orthoclase feldspar. It has a white body colour and often shows brilliant blue flashes of light. These flashes are caused by alternate layers of albite and orthoclase within the stone structure. As the light hits these different layers, it reflects back, giving us a really interesting adular essence. Romans believed that this gemstone was formed directly by moonlight, and we can see that in the surface luster of this gemstone. It really is reminiscent of moonbeams. Moonstone reached its height of popularity during the Art Nouveau period. Famous jewellers such as René Lalique used Moonstone in many of his pieces. Join guest designer Gemma Crow as she brings you a fascinating DVD that teaches you how to create all of your important findings that are essential to everybody's collection. Gemma will take you through step by step to create all of your finishing touches that bring your pieces to life. Essential for all jewellery makers. To get your hands on a copy of this fantastic DVD, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Get creative with Jewellery Maker. Good, uh, good, good evening, good welcome, <laughs> and evening. Good welcome and evening to Jewelry Maker. We're we're on Jewelry Maker, Deb. We're live on we TV. Are. 
Thank you so much for joining us. My name is Martha. I am a jewelry maker presenter. This is the lovely Deb Rudge. She is an inspirational teacher and designer, and you're going to inspire us with amazing designer inspiration tonight. Hope if so. you've never watched us before, we're going to take you through some amazing demos. I just want to tell you how to order everything on our channel. So we've got a free phone number for you, and it's open 24 hours a day. That's 0800 644 655. You can see it at the bottom of the screen there. We've also got a massive website, which is the best uh, jewelry making store you could ever imagine going to. It's jewelrymaker.com, and we've got over 30,000 products on there for you to peruse. We've got over 50 instructional DVDs as well and they start at £4.95 so if you don't know anything about a medium or a technique uh, go for one of those you can fill your basket for £2.95 a day or you can go for our premium delivery that's £4.95 and it takes two to three working days uh, for you to be able to receive your order and remember everything is covered by a 30-day money-back guarantee uh, and uh, with our genuine gemstones that we sell, which is the majority of gemstones that we show you, in fact, they're all genuine, uh, we cover them with a certificate of authenticity. You can buy those for 25 pence uh, and you can check them out. If you're brand new and you're not quite ready to buy, but you do want to join us and watch us, you can uh, give us a call and get our Get Started DVD as, as well as our booklet, and it will start you on your jewellery making uh, journey. But we do want to welcome you in, uh, and please do feel free to join us from 8 a.m. in the morning until 9 o'clock at night. Also, every month we do um, make a lovely hub magazine for you, which show, talks to you about trends, all the workshops that we have coming up on Jewelry Maker as well, because we are um, um, in Warwickshire in a beautiful house called Ivy House in the middle of the countryside. We, were one, were, ugh, we run workshops. I've had a chewy <laughs> in the break, so I've been chewing a chewy and now my tongue's all Your tied. Too tired, uh, we run uh, workshops virtually every day um, in all different mediums from wires, akuma, hemo to macrame. So come along and join us on one of those amazing days. So Deb, we've got a lovely kit and it's a real beginner's kit, but it's got so yeah. much wire in it. It doesn't matter where you are on your journey. Um, because you can use this, these scoops and this wire and these cabochons in any situation. Yeah. Uh, this is Pretty in Pink with Deb Rudge. You're getting 275 carats of these gorgeous agate slices. They have been dyed, but you can see that beautiful banding through each and every single one. We guarantee you the carat weight. And in this sample here, you are getting four gorgeous individual standalone pendants for sure. But really what I want to show you as well is this beautiful lucky dip bead scoop so lots of different sizes of gemstone i can see amethysts in there shell rose quartz there's some gorgeous corals going on as well and um, so that huge bead scoop for you to give you some inspiration and then lots and lots and lots of wire we're giving you all the important gauges of wire this is our gold colored wire at jewelry maker you're getting 10 meters of your point four and uh, we'll talk you through what all these gauges mean 10 metres of your point 0.6, 10 metres of your point 0.8, and then 10 of the 1, I've gone in the wrong order really, and 10 <laughs> of the point five, uh, point 0.25 as well. So basically, they are the five most popular gauges and all the gauges that you would ever need on your wire working. 10 metres as well goes a long, long way. So you're going to be able to make uh, rings and pendants and your own findings, again, which we'll talk you through. Now, here's some of the inspiration that Debbie has made with this kit. Debbie, talk us through what, we, what you've made. Um, I've actually gone predominantly for necklaces or neckline yep. pieces. Um, the big slabs are absolutely fantastic. So looking at um, how to use them in different ways and what additional sort of treatments you can do with them. So trying to um, keep it quite simple, but still make a, a, a bit of a statement piece out of them. So I didn't want to put all of them into one great big necklace, which I have done before and looks amazing. I almost wanted to challenge myself and look at different ways of using each of the slabs. But with the bead scoop, um, it's really nice to be able to sort through and find a whole sort of amount of the same gemstone. So I, I did that so that I could then make up a necklace with a lot of the, um, the same size and colour of uh, gemstone on in the end there. But 
at, uh, I can't remember which one I start. Oh, I started with the, the slab in the, the centre with all of the wire wrapped around it because I just love the contrast of the pink and the gold. I, I just really wanted to um, use that. Make that colour pop, yeah. really. Yeah. Fabulous. Well, we, we, so we're learning how to make um, the necklace that's just by me. And obviously yeah. we do have all the other components of the jewellery making. And as I say, if you are brand new, those components are called findings. And we'll take you through all of those separately in a moment. But for this kit with the wire, so you're getting 50 metres of wire, the cabochons and the bead scoop as well. The combined price is 35.15. Now, where do we get that combined price from? Basically, mm -hmm. that's all the individual components, what they are on the website. So we've put them all together in a special kit for you. So not only do we inspire you with the pieces that the guest designers make and hopefully teach you as well, but we give you an amazing value deal. So you'll see those arrows going all the way down and it doesn't matter when you check out, you are going to pay that lowest price. So 0800 655 we're going to £17.95. Wow. 50 metres of wire, those beautiful agate cabochons and that lucky um, dip gemstones as well and those lovely subtle pinks and purples. That's incredible value for money, That's isn't it, Deb? That's an amazing price for that much wire. Absolutely. Oh, you know, never mind the, the gemstones. Look at all the wire you've got. And I've still got wire left. So I could I could have made more. But love that. That's an amazing price. So not just for beginners, and if you are oh, if you are new, thank thank you so much for joining us. But um, you can take this wire anywhere, can't you? Intermediate, advanced. Yes. You can do a lot with this. Yeah, I mean the kit as a kit is fantastic because you can really push it mm -hmm. and do something um, very complex and you know with hours and hours of work in, in one piece. Wow. Or you can do lots of simple um, pieces and, and, you know, as a beginner or as an advanced, it's, it's just a brilliant adaptable kit. Well, we're going to show you how to make this piece um, tonight, uh, which is a real standout piece. All you need to do, wear it with is a very, very simple white T-shirt and jeans, mm. and that would look incredible, wouldn't it? It's beautiful. So we've got rosary links in between. And then some lovely top drilled wrapped drops. So you're going to show us how yeah, to do that. How to do the drops because um, I think uh, we've looked at the rosary linking recently. Yeah. So I don't want to sort of go over something that that we've done recently. Lovely. So Before we start, Deb, if you yep. don't mind, um, you've got that kit now, seventeen pounds ninety-five. We'll leave that at the bottom of the screen. But you're going to talk us through um, what's in this kit, Deb, because okay. there's lots of components I here. And if you're brand new to jewelry making, and certainly I was on day one of, uh, of when I came to work at Jewelry Maker, I was like, "What on earth is all <laughs> of this?" So take us through what what are findings? Okay, findings is a collective term. Yep. For the mechanics, really. The things that hold your jewellery together, connect things, um, and, and really provide the, the structure as well. Sure. So, um, going through what we've got in this pack, we've got everything from your earring shepherd hooks, yep. which are... And this is all gold plated onto copper. Yep. Copper's really malleable, isn't it? Really easy to use. It is. So... That's a um, shepherd's hook. Yep, you're getting two pairs of those. And, and they've got the additional detail in here, which is just decorative. Really lovely. Um, and your open loop on the bottom, so you can open it up to attach your earring. So if you were making a pair of earrings, you'd probably then need head pins, which are basically straight pieces of metal wire with a decorative finish on the end. So we've got two lots here, one which have just simple balls on the yep. end, and then the ones with the stars on the end here as a decorative feature. So I think they're probably about five centimetres in length, they which are, is really nice. They are um, 50 metres, yes, and the featherweight ones, which are obviously yep. the smaller diameter as 70 metres. You're getting 15 of each of those. So featherweights work through your... Um, your finer your drill holes. So yes, so your got, pearls. If you've got um, your gemstones with a smaller drill hole, if you use these ones, they'll go through. They're about 
a 0.3 millimeter um, diameter wire. So lovely. They fit through everything. Then we've then. got some clasps, haven't we? We've got a whole range of, of different clasps. Yeah, we've got two toggle clasps and um, a connector which is fantastic. Lots of metal in this as well. So it's just got a slit in one side and um, a, little a slot in the other. A slit and a slot. A slit and a slot. I don't perfect. know if that's the actual. So they then just um, fit perfectly, fit don't they? Nice together. and flush. And it's a really nice Well, fitting. it's a feature as well as a clasp, it isn't is, it? It is, yeah. You're then getting a metre so of chain. We've got the, the metre of chain and it's a curb link, so it's a nice strong chain. And then we've got um, some decorative uh, spacer Spaces. beads. Yep, ten of those. So a six mil in their diameter. I'm holding it in the wrong hand. That's all there right. There we go. So we've got super fantastic little floral spacer beads. Gives it a Bollywood there. touch, doesn't it? I always it think it does. Yeah, it does. And then we've got some more mechanics. Yep. Rather than decorative features, so we've got crimp tubes, and these will. Um, close down and hold any beading thread or um, even wires actually so all you do is squash them with your pliers and it holds everything in place and then what you would do is then cover the crimp tube with a crimp cover which is like a little um, a little bead that opens, whoops, I'm throwing more things on the floor now for Maggie to pick up. <laughs> so we've got a little, um, I can't pick it up in my fingers so you can see, but that's the spacer. Lovely, that uh, goes over the top. Sorry, the crimp cover that covers up the crimp tubes. So you're getting 20 of the crimp tubes, they're two mil, and then the covers that go over the top of those... I believe you're getting oh, 15 of those as well. Okay. Perfect. And so whizzing through then, yep, earrings as well. Oh, sorry, your jump rings. We've, yep, we've got jump rings. What do jump rings do? Um, so these connect things up together. So you can attach things together. And then we've got some decorative earring findings there. And then these ribbon ends. Ribbon cord fab. ends. So if you're... Um, using ribbons in your jewellery, so or threads or anything like that, then you just pop them into the channel here and close that up over the top with your pliers and then everything gets trapped inside and it holds it all. It's also got an extender chain and a uh, hook fastening so that you can then fix that in any, any point along the chain. So um, and then, not only that in this kit, but it's beading essentials with Deborah. So we've got the essential threading pack, so to speak, haven't we? Yep. So in the gold colour, I'll just read you out what we've got and then I'll let you explain. So you're getting 80 metres of monofilament, which is 0.25, 6 metres of clear elastic, which is 0.8, and then 50 of the gold coloured beading thread, which is 0.38. And that, we're talking about the gauges there. Um, yeah. So what do you do with each of these? So with your monofilament, that's a super fine, it's almost like um, a fishing line, but it's really, really fine and clear. So it disappears into a design and you can barely see it. So it disappears completely. You can get all, most of your um, gemstones on here because it's really fine. And that's, that's one of its real um, benefits. And then you've got your beading thread, so um, that's actually a core of stainless steel yep. inside a coated um, finish. So that's how we get then the colour. And then you've got your elastic, so that's for making your stretchy bracelets, or you can do other techniques with it, and crochet, um, crochet, knit it, all sorts of things, so it's quite useful thing to have. So that's then your basic threading packs and, and all of these come in different colours that are available on the Lovely. website as well. So it's all the way down to 9.95 so basically you can buy the findings pack and the 
and the kit for under £30 today. So let's start with our demo. Brilliant. Where are we going to start? Okay, so on the bottom of that necklace, yep. um, all I did for the necklace itself was to create lots of um, rosary linked beads Lovely. and connect them all together. So that's the section here along the bottom and then mm -hmm. we hang lots of um, different shapes of gemstone off the bottom. So if I show you how to actually get the loop so that you can then attach everything. Yep. So beginning with um, a length of the 0 0.6 wire, yep. it's about 50 centimetres in length. Okay. And I've got a, looks like a rose quartz drop. Certainly is a rose quartz, yeah, gorgeous. So I'm going to pop my wire through the drill hole and I've got probably um, just over an inch, inch and a half there sticking out and all I'm going to do is push that up so it runs along the side of the gemstone and then on the other side bring the long tail up so they both then cross over at the top. And then using my round nose pliers as a, um, a former, what I'm going to do is take, whoops, take both my lengths of wire and pop my pliers in like this. So I'm holding the wire in my plier. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring both of the wires down. So now my tails, if you like, or on the wire, are running down. And then the long length of wire that I've got, I'm going to just start wrapping that around everything else. Lovely. So that will trap this tiny little tail that we've got here inside my wire wrapping. So if I hold that in the pliers, and then just start wrapping the wire around and around. So once you've got two or three wraps going around, you can take your pliers out, hold it in your fingers, and then just hold the gemstone. And what I'm going to do is where the wire is going through my gemstone, I'm going to hold it steady there so that it stops moving around. Okay, so then start wrapping down along the triangle, try and keep it steady, and it will move, but you can make sure that you put it back into position every time it, it yeah. comes out of position, and wrap. Now I'm, I find the easiest way to do it is to hold my wire still. Yeah and wrap using the gemstone. So twist the gemstone around. And then when you get to this point, you need to make sure that your, um, your wrapped um, section yeah. is actually in line with your gemstone because you don't want it to be falling down or mm -hmm. coming up because that would look scruffy. We don't like that, do so we? We want them nice and uniform. We do, although sometimes I like to do it scruffy but I usually use um, a thinner wire so what I'm going to do is now go back to rolling the gemstone and holding the wire in position so I will roll this down until it's reached the point where the wires are going through the drill hole in the I gemstone covered. and that will cover it all up it's absolutely beautiful. It looks incredible already. And the opulence of that gold wire. Yeah, it's lovely, It makes it? such a difference, doesn't it? It already looks luxurious. You've got that genuine gemstone. Yep. And in this bead scoop, um, uh, Deb's just used a, a rose quartz 
Um, so absolutely beautiful natural rose quartz and that gorgeous wrap on top of there just makes it look perfect, doesn't it? And you can, you're sort of shimmying it up there. So if you've yep. missed a little section, it's so malleable that you can correct yourself, which is great, yeah. isn't it? I mean, if you want to, you can undo it. And try again. Smooth it out slightly and then come back if it's Wonderful. not in line. So I've come all the way down and you can see that the point where the wire goes through the gemstone has been covered. Yep. And then what I'll do is I'll bring the wire, if I bring it that way, diagonally yes. and back up to the top. So it's just a little feature sure. coming across and then wrap all the way by nice rolling. Secure. Yeah, by rolling. So remind me again, you used about again. half a metre, did you, on this? Yeah, something like that, about Perfect. half a metre. And then the way I finish it off is I take the, the tail yep. of the wire and I just pop that through the loop. So if you pull that and then you can pull it down, use your round nose pliers again. Sure. And just pop it the loop back onto your pliers and push and that will make sure that the wire is then pushed right down into the V point yeah. of your loop. And then you can just take your snips and just trim off at that point. So then the the wires are all hidden inside the loop. That's so neat. And it makes it nice and neat and tidy and it's not going to scratch you. And that's so glorious. I mean, obviously in Deb's designs, um, she's done quite a few of these to make yeah. a real feature. But just that as a standalone pendant or, or yes. earrings on your shepherd's hooks. Is there any chance we can just fit it onto one of these shepherd's hooks for shepherd's me? Hook. Yeah. Just so we can see, and that's one of the feature shepherd's hooks. Yeah. I mean, you are getting three pairs in total, um, and they're all decorative, they're gorgeous. Or if you wanted to put it onto your chain, it would be super easy to do that with one of the jump rings as well. It would. Um, so how, do you need a jump so ring as well? Um, I was just going to pop it on, okay. but I'll, I'll use a jump yeah, ring. Yeah, let's see, that's all fine. of our jump rings are saw cut yeah. as well. What does that mean, Deb? It means that instead of using snips, which have, um, they've got one flat side yep. on them and one uh, angled side sure. coming down, if you like, this is the blade. So it's coming down here. So we've got one, one side is flat, mm -hmm. one side is angled. So when you cut your wire, you'll end up with a cut that isn't completely parallel. So if I snip that, I don't know if you'll be able to come in close, but you might be able to see. It's not flush, is it, so it's to It's not completely flat and flush. Whereas if I used a saw and cut across straight, mm -hmm. then if I open it up, move it, both sides are going to come back nice and even. So they've all been professionally flat. saw cut. And f in fact, that's, I would say, 99% yep. of the jump rings that we sell on Jewelry Maker are like that. And if you want to learn more about um, jump rings and what they make, essentially, they're an element for chain mail, aren't they? Yep. Um, chain mail. Have a little look at our chain mail DVDs on the website, jewelrymaker.com. Remember, it's really easy to give us a give us a call 0800 644 655 we're open 24 hours a day it's an English call centre it's only a mile away and lots of people in that call centre are specific GIA qualified so basically the Gemological Institute of America they know about the gemstones um, mm -hmm. so ask them any questions you like so we're going to open this right. uh, jump ring so I've got two flat nose pliers essentially chain nose pliers which come down to a point yep um, and I've taken my jump ring and just popped it into one set of pliers with the cut at the very top. And then what I'm going to do is hold the other set of pliers straight up, pop the other side of the jump ring in the pliers, and then give it a twist. So rotate the jump ring open and don't pull it open. Sure. If you rotate it open, then it puts less strain on your metal. So you open it like a stable door, we always yeah. say. Yeah. So then I'm going to take my shepherd's hook mm -hmm. and pop that on one side and then take the earring that we've just made, pop that on and then... Close the stable door? Just, <laughs> yep. Reverse the action and bring 
bring them back. Now if you've got, like I have here, a slight, I think, where is it, there, I don't know if you can come in that a close. A slight gap. There's a little tiny gap. Yep. So what I need to do is close that up. So what I'm going to do, if I twist the jump ring so that the gap's at the top and take my pliers, I can just pinch down on the jump ring and that will close it up. So if I hold it flat, it's easier to do. So I just need to pinch that and give it a little tiny squeeze, hardly anything, and then that's closed it Lovely. up. Lovely. And the finished earring looks so beautiful, doesn't it? You've then Hand got... Handmade, rose quartz on gold-plated copper, a pair of those earrings easily selling for £20, perhaps? Uh, yeah, 15 Probably. Gorgeous, really, yeah. really stunning. So remember, you can buy uh, the kits after the hour, uh, £17.95, that item code at the top there. Um, if you just call the call centre and say, I'd like to buy what's on screen, they'll be able to find that for you. So don't worry too much about that item code. Remember, everything covered by a 30-day money-back guarantee. Come and join us. We're a big old lovely family. We have a right laugh, don't we? We do. When we love it and we kind of inspire each other, bounce off each other with ideas and, and we do welcome you mm. in. We want you to um, show us what you've designed. Join in on our Facebook page as well. We've got a Twitter account, a Facebook page and an Instagram. So you can have a little look at the links to all of those on the jewellerymaker.com website. Thank you so much, Deb. You're welcome. We've got loads more to show you though. I'm going to walk and uh, walk and talk again. I don't want to always you. feel, thank you very much, always feel like I should do a silly walk. We've got a star by coming up in 10 minutes time. It's going to be a massive stash booster look at all of these i thought one of the tubes had opened then i'll lay them out for you and then i'm gonna <laughs> pop on my chair so i'm a little sit down aren't they gorgeous look at all the colors that you're getting they are they're all, all quartzes four tubes six mil beads look at all the colors and the inspiration great big drill holes on them as well yummy 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 aren't they fab well done to everybody that went for our kit as well. Mary in Shropshire, Collector in Greater London, Alison in Shropshire, Derek in Greater London as well. So we've got loads more to show you. Thanks so much for joining us. Apologies while I pop that in there so I can see everything. We are going to this lovely tassel necklace, which I believe is the last in stock. And there's so much you can do with it. It's obviously a standalone piece if you want it to be. Um, but if not, you can do lots of things with it. And I'll ask Deb all about that shortly. This is a silver plated brass tassel necklace with chain and clasp the 13 centimeters refers to the uh, length here but look how fluid and beautiful that is Deb have you got some ideas yeah. for what we could do with this well I've used one of these that was in a kit recently yes and took it apart so you can open up the uh, the loops on the end where all of the, the um, sort of fan shape is suspended if you open that up there's wire running through and then you can um, you can re-thread it and pop beads in between. So if you pop gemstones in between, it spaces it out, which is really nice. You can um, put patinas on it, so change the colour using Lovely. a patina um, and just using a brush to, to dab the colour on. Or you can colour it again with alcohol inks Absolutely. as well which, You're getting, which uh, is really nice it's brass so it's really easy yeah. to kind of work things in with it 60 it grams of the brass there silver plate on top a lovely long extended chain on it as well it's glorious isn't it it's very very expensive looking so we're going to give you a price on this one eight pounds and 95 pence i would be multi-buying for sure on that it's a, it's incredible if you've just got a really simple dress i know there's quite a lot of color going on in mine but how um how amazing would that be just with a little black dress it would really jazz yeah. it up wouldn't it gorgeous 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 and deb was talking about maybe putting uh, some gemstones in between maybe you want to team it up with something like rubies and you could wire up them at the top that would be really lovely indeed eight pounds 95 for that one um but next i'll just take this off if no one minds we've got some amazing ethiopian opal well done to everybody that got for those now opal like you've never seen before it is glorious and for all the new viewers at home I'm going to do a little trick um, opal is quite hard for us to show in the studio we've got lots of white quite clinical lights and opal is its best obviously in daylight so I'm just going to shield it from the lights just so you can see the beautiful pin fire that's coming out of here so this is a completely natural Ethiopian opal let's see 
if we can get some of those colours coming out. Can you see the play of colour? Gorgeous colours of blue and green and pinks as well and reds. Isn't that divine? 35 carats then. They're playing rounds from 2 mil to 5 mil on a 41 centimetre strand. This is from uh, the mine that's in the Wello province in Ethiopia. Um, the Genuine Gemstone Company, who we still buy our gemstones from, um, buys direct from the mines, which is why we've got such amazing prices. Now this mine is um, getting smaller and smaller. You can see in the pictures here that we're showing you, that's the crevice that the miners have to go into to be able to source this beautiful and unique opal, like no other in the world. That vein in the mine is only one to two metres wide and it provides us with an opal that has such a flash and a play of colour that you can see here. Hopefully, look at the colour and the glory in that. That is your should be price on screen. What we like to do at Jewelry Maker is we like to give you a saving on everything that we can, um, which is amazing really, isn't it? 59.95 does not sound like much at all for a beautiful strand of Ethiopian opal, 41 centimetres. Everybody can buy, it's not an introductory offer, it's not if you've been with us for a year, 39.95. So if you're brand new to us tonight, this is really one to test us out. Um, get it home, get it valued, get it appraised. Uh, maybe you don't even want to re-strand it straight away. Take it to your jeweler, see what he thinks of the quality and see if he believes if he can even believe you sourced it for 39.95 these are like wholesale prices look at the colors coming out of there beautiful beautiful natural opal 0800 655 you've got it for 30 days you won't need 30 days to be convinced as soon as you get it out of your package delivered to your door for 295 you're going to be blown away it's not even going to take you 30 seconds i don't think there's some beautiful things going on here i just want to draw uh, our lovely uh, director's attention to these let's see if we can see those colors going on do you see that every single one has a play of color really really beautiful and the Ethiopian opal you can see the rarer colors so the lilacs and the greens coming out of there the peaches and the pinks and um, they're obviously the rarest ones we can find those little spheres um, obviously refracting all of the light and giving you those beautiful flashes of color what a gorgeous strand would look amazing with freshwater pearls would look incredible just to re-strand it something really unique and a talking point for you and um, that's what we want people to ask you when you're wearing your jewelry there's nothing nicer is there than you know when someone says to you where did you yeah. get that and then you can say well you know what i made it myself so you immediately feel incredible but i got it from jewelry maker they, they absolutely provide you with genuine gemstones beautiful work we've got a star buy coming up for you next and let me just tell you a star buy we don't have many a day and it's the best products we can put together at great value so if you've never bought from us before maybe this star buy is for you Oh, a carnival of colour for you now. This is your spring stash. You're getting four tubes of 210 carats of genuine gemstones. They're multicolour quartz blame rounds and they're six mil in diameter. Um, you obviously get all the storage with them as well, which is amazing. But let's pour out all of this beautiful rainbow of colour. Look at those. You've got the blues. You've got the... Oh, I'm just going to give it a bit of a shake. Oh, there we go. That's probably the best way to do it. So look at the blues. You've got the purples. You've got the pinks. All the candy colours that you can think of, these are gorgeous. They have been hand cut for you, hand finished and polished. And then we've put them all together. We've made sure that the drill hole on each and every single one is enough for you be to be able to get a plethora of threading materials through there. You've got some lovely cherry reds, some really beautiful zesty greens, lemons and oranges. And if you're completely new to jewellery making, this is a really great bead to start. A six mil bead is... is Deb, it's a real um, kind of like, uh, you can't really go wrong with a six mil bead, can you? No, it's not too big, it's not too small. Um, it's just right. Just right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, porridge. Yes. <laughs> um, so, I mean, these are brilliant because you can really concentrate on trying different techniques mm -hmm. and, um, you know, things like the beaded bead or the ladder weave and all of these techniques that are in the, I think they're in the Get Started Yes, indeed they are, yeah. So, 
it's really nice then to, to not have to think about different shapes and sizes, but to be able to just um, use these and try out Absolutely. all sorts of different... Absolutely, and still have some beautiful jewellery at the end oh of it yeah, as well, because of that definitely. great colour. Um, so you're getting 210 carats in each and every single tube, so that means in total uh, that's 840 carats of genuine gemstones. This should be priced, so if you bought them all separately, £27.80, but oh no, it's a star buy for a reason. Our lovely producer Rob has put the show together tonight and he wants to give you the best prices that he can. It's going all the way down to £14.95, so that works out. £3.50 a tube, £3.50 for 200 car 210 carats of genuine gemstones in that lovely rainbow of colour. You can't help but smile, can you, with all those colours? Um, you can certainly sort them all out when you get them home, uh, put all the colours into order. Maybe you want to graduate those colours beautifully. But well done to everybody joining us tonight. Thank you so much uh, for watching. Susan in Swansea, Angela in Hampshire, Collector in Lincolnshire, Margaret in the West Midlands. Remember, if you do have any text messages for us, if you want to see something in particular, or maybe you missed um, something Deb did earlier, do give us a text to JM Studio. It's 60777, and normal network charges ap apply. If you are watching us online, though, you can send a free message. All you need to do is um, click uh, Watch Live TV, and then if you register as a customer, you'll be able to send us a message to the studio, and that's in real time. So we like to um, basically respond as quickly as we can to any of the questions that you have, or any of the praise that you have for us for these amazing deals tonight. £14.95, that is a glorious star buy. It would work with all manner of colours, wouldn't it? Maybe you've got your gold wire from that previous kit, or maybe you went for the first kit and you've got the silver wire. Um, certainly you could work with just your basic beading threads as well. Well done to everybody going for that. That is a steal of a deal and the true definition of a star buy. So well done to everybody going for that tonight. But we've got loads more to show you. We have got some beautiful citrine. Uh, bear with me one second here. It comes gorgeous. Now, uh, these are referred to as nuggets. Uh, just a just a genuine ter a genuine term a general term uh, for a cut of gemstone that has been uh, not faceted but polished and tumbled to bring out that beautiful shine. These are natural citrines, 290 carats. They measure seven by eight mil, so that refers to the smallest size of the gemstone, going up to 18 by 10. They are like uh, sunshine, aren't they? If you've gone for any of our amber, can you imagine how beautiful it would be to team up with those? Very, very gorgeous indeed, and that strand is stacked. Now, they are center drilled, um, so you couldn't wrap them like the way that uh, Debbie showed us, but you can simply restrand them, and they would be absolutely beautiful. I know that a lot of you at home make twist necklaces with our nugget strands um, using wire. It would be beautiful to pop it through and maybe put a big chunky clasp on and have an instant bracelet. That is a gorgeous strand of citrine from Brazil, November's birthstone, £5.95. I don't want you to doubt that we are selling you glass or crystal. This is a genuine gemstone, um, and you can download your certificate of authenticity as well. And to have that beautiful, natural, glowing colour, there's something about kind of gold, sunshiny colours, isn't there, that always make you smile. I don't know if the sun's come out where you are tonight, uh, tonight, today indeed, <laughs> someone would be out at night, Martha, that's not how it works. Um, this is kind of one for springtime, isn't it, Deb? What do you think to this beautiful strand? Oh, it is, it's gorgeous. Um, and we had the ametrine earlier, so yeah. it would work with that. Um, but I love the irregularity of yeah, these. Yeah, absolutely. And the um, colour difference as well, that kind of colour graduation as well, from yeah. kind of deep, beautiful, like, um, this is going to sound like a silly thing to say, but you know, like a really gorgeous glass of like Chardonnay. Mm. It's got yeah. lovely kind of white wine colours to it, hasn't it? Hello, Karen in Worcestershire. JM Studio. Hi, ladies. Loving the starter hour. Great for a refresher as well as newbies. Thank you so much, Karen. That's great to have that feedback. It's good sometimes to remember the basics and mend bad <laughs> habits. I would agree with you. It's been two years since I went on Linda's um, uh, introduction to jewellery workshop and my uh, top drilled um, drops that I wrap have got a bit messy. So sometimes yeah. you just have to think, and you've actually refreshed me as well. Good. Uh, yes, that is good. Thank That's you, good. Karen. We've got loads more to show you. Excellent. Okie-cokie. 
Oh, we've got lots of bundles for you next. Now, what is a bundle? You might hear presenters going on about that all the time. A bundle is basically what our producers have put together. They think it's a good combination of colours or of gemstones, and it saves you again on a deal. So we've got some beautiful strands here, and actually, we've got some lovely budding beaders that work with us. Uh, I've seen lovely Sue and lovely Anne today, and they um, basically put together finished designs for us. So here's the design, I'll just, uh, sorry, here's the details, I'll just quickly take you through. You're getting your coral rounds, your quartz uh, faceted 5 mils, and then your plain 10 mils, and then your rose quartz flowers as well. So our gorgeous Anne has taken inspiration and made three beautiful pieces out of this bundle right here. Obviously she had a lot more left over as well, but do you see how she's wire wrapped around the rose quartz flowers? Aren't they gorgeous? And kind of immediately when you probably look at those colours, you think, oh, I don't know whether the blues and the pinks work well. Well, if it's good enough for Pantone, it's good enough for us. And 2016 is the year of rose quartz and serenity blue. And that's basically what Rob has done here. So blushing brides, these are beautiful um, little bracelets. And as I say, this statement uh, necklace is absolutely glorious. So thank you to Anne for making that. To have really lovely coral rounds as well. We don't see mm. coral very often, do we, Deb? We don't. Um they have such an amazing texture to them that you can see um, when, you, when you're up close and personal that it's, it's really pretty, delicate. Yeah. And Anne's just used them as little tiny spaces just yeah, to accent and really pop that blue. It's gorgeous, isn't it? £18.80 is the price you should be paying if you were to buy them all separately. But we're going all the way down to just £3 per genuine gemstone strand. Get it home, use that 30 day money back guarantee. £11 and 95 pence. The coral is natural. The blue quartz has obviously been dyed and I believe the rose quartz is natural as well. So gorgeous. 80 carats in your rose quartz flowers, 75 carats on your 5 mil faceted rounds, 265 carats on your 10 mils and then 41 carats on that natural coral. Lovely beautiful colours, saving you an amazing amount, over a third off the price there. £11.95. I do apologise, I've shown this bracelet around the wrong way. Look at that <laughs> lovely little spacer there. The workmanship that goes into Beautiful. cutting those rose quartzes as well, they're gorgeous, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. But those colours just work, don't they, together? And, and um, again, that's maybe a colour combination that you wouldn't necessarily think of, but with the Pantone colours, then, yeah, it works brilliantly. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. We've got loads more to show you, and I actually need two hands to get this next bundle out, so I do apologise. Have a last little look at what Anne has made for you, and I'll get all of this out. I've never seen so much jasper. It's going to take me a while. Bear with me one second. <laughs> all of the jasper in the world, I believe. I do lovely, love lovely, jasper. Lovely. I do I too, because you can gorgeous. see so much in it, can't you? Yeah. We'll just politely move Anne's um, budding beader samples out of the way. Lovely stuff. Oh, I'm making a right mess now. Apologies, everybody <laughs> at home. So, Jasper, gorgeous natural uh, gemstone. Everything in this bundle is natural, and you've got some fabulous colours. So, again, you heard me earlier talking about nuggets. As I say, they are a gemstone that hasn't been faceted and hasn't really been cut. It's kind of in its natural form. We've just polished it and tumbled it to make sure it's all beautiful and smooth against the skin. Then you have got uh, your four mil rounds as well. Um, so your four mil rounds are 30 carats. Your um, nuggets are 270 carats. And then you've got some incredible cabochons. Now the cabochons, we guarantee 625 carats and they come in lots of different shapes. Uh, these originally have only been on once and were launched at 1995. So look at the beautiful colours and themes that are going through there. You've got lots of different shapes as well, a square, kind of like a squoval, isn't it? A square oval, um, then some more ovals, a lovely square and um, two drops. What is a cabochon, Deb, for people that don't know and haven't seen them before? Okay, it's a, a gemstone that usually has a flat back and a domed and polished front and sometimes they're faceted yep. on the front surface and sometimes they're not they're just smooth polished beautiful so you would be able to wire wrap these yep is essentially what people do with cabochons but sometimes you can glue wire them wrap, as well you can glue them you can open up the ribbon cord ends and glue that on the back so that it then suspends so it, it's all hidden and all you see is, is the gemstone Yep. You can use macrame, 
you can glue it onto foundation um, backing fabric. Yep. And then, yeah, stitch around or the the um, bullion wire actually would be really nice to, to yeah. combine with your soutache and just stitch it in or glue it in around those. It'd be glorious, wouldn't it? it would. So, our combined price, apologies, I have to cough. <coughs> so sorry. Tw £26.85 uh, is our combined price, but we are going to give you the price of the cabs, but the two strands for free as well. All the way down, everybody pays that lowest price, 19 95 I urge you to get on the phone lines. Give us a try, get it home. It's 0800 644 655. I do want to prove to you as well there uh, that these are all front and back. So they're as beautiful on the front, or as beautiful on the back as they are on the front, so to speak. So there's some really fabulous designs going on. If you've ever flown over a desert in a plane, um, they look like you're looking at a desert from the sky, yeah, don't they? It's gorgeous. The, the really, tiger's really eye that we had earlier would work really nicely with yes, that bundle. Yes, absolutely right. If you missed out on any mm. of our products today, you can see every single product that we've had uh, from 8 o'clock this morning under the Watch Live TV button as well. Well done to Lee in Cardiff, a collector in Northumberland, Barbara in California. We don't just ship to England and Wales and Scotland and Northern Ireland. We ship everywhere that we can even think of. Australia, America, Denmark, France, Germany. Just have a little look on our delivery page on jewelrymaker.com. Remember, if you are in the UK, you can have premium delivery for £4.95 within two to three working days. Lots of beautiful ideas uh, with those. Well done, everybody going for those. We've got loads more to show you, though. Lovely, we got some precious metal next, some genuine white gold, which is gorgeous. Now, earlier on, we showed you the little round beads. Can I just have a little dish, please, my lovely friends on cameras, just so I can show everybody uh, exactly what we've got here. I'm going to pull them out onto the pad, hopefully not lose any of them, because <laughs> they are incredibly precious. In fact, I'm so sorry, Maggie, don't worry, my love, because I think I can get them in my little pincers. Now, you were talking earlier, Deb, about crimp beads, weren't you? Yes. So this is a crimp tube, two by two mil, ten pieces of nine carat gold in the pack. Here we go, hopefully you can see that. What does a crimp tube do for, for everybody at home? <laughs> Apart from jumping out Apart from tweezers. jumping out everywhere. <laughs> um, if you use your beading thread and you thread up a necklace or a bracelet and then you push the beading thread through the crimp tube into your clasp and then back in the opposite direction into yep. your crimp and then give it a squeeze and that will hold the beading thread in position and stop it um, obviously then losing its class for um, the beads so it, it, it's a mechanic to hold together your beading thread I have never seen a nine carat white gold version um, no. do you think that that would be as malleable as the silver you have to be quite gentle with yeah. it yeah yeah, yeah. I've not actually um, tried these, so I don't know for certain, but I'm sure they're going to be they're gorgeous, absolute they? delight to use. So if you went for your opals or your pearls, anything really high end, yeah. and you want to create a gorgeous finish, these are the crimp tubes for you. It's the last of stock, though. £14.95, so £1.50 each, but that is pure 9 carat white gold. It's absolutely glorious. Um, do stock up and do check out our prices. Feel free to uh, have a little search engine try and see if you can match those prices and give us the feedback if you find anything elsewhere. We do want to know because we want to be as competitive as we can and we want to provide what we can for you because, you know, we've had a lot of people, we've been here nearly six years now, it's our sixth birthday in May and we need to respond to the market. We want to be your one-stop shop for jewellery making. So do join us on 0800 644 655 or on the website. Angela in Hampshire, you are a savvy lady. You've gone for two of these. Well done. Still delivered for that £2.95 a day. Deborah in Lancashire and Lynn in Kent. Um, we've only had Precious Metals on Jewelry Maker now. They launched in February, uh, really late in February, actually. Um, mm. So it's a real coup for us to have them. Well done to everybody going for those. Let me just pop them all back in here to make sure that I don't lose any. Uh, we do not want those going up the vacuum cleaner tomorrow morning, do we? Can you imagine, <laughs> that's Debs? true. No. The lovely stuff. So I've got loads more to show you, and uh, we're still live until 9 o'clock, so do you get your text messages into us. We have got gorgeous enamel chain, and I know that Deb loves this. Oh. Uh, we've got this beautiful pink. Um, so it is enamel uh, brass wheat chain, 
and it is a stunning color isn't it that's summer right there you're getting a meter in total um, and it's six millimeters on the links now I was working with the lovely guest designer Linda Brumwell um, the other day and she actually took all these links apart uh, which would be the sort of thing I'd do <laughs> yeah absolutely um, yeah. so it's a lovely kind of color and enamel's really come back into fashion hasn't it yeah well it is a fantastic way to get color into your jewelry isn't yeah. it um, and that vintage look as well yeah so you know it's um it's really nicely made this chain which is something that i think is really important mm -hmm. is is the actual um way something's put together and it's been thought about and designed really nicely so i think if um just simple bracelets or necklaces work fantastically because it's got all the detail and interest in there, yeah, hasn't it? Yeah, really has. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. We're going all the way down. Everybody pays that lower price. It's going to go all the way down to £12.95. Oh, you do get a whole metre. Apologies, our sample here is a little bit bunched up. Uh, but it does, it does uh, sit very beautifully against the skin. And you are, you can see, getting that whole metre there. We've got it in another colour as well. Are we going to do that one next? Lovely, Rob. Gorgeous. We've got it in a beautiful, like, magenta. So let's Ooh. put them side by side so you can see. Yeah, like a gorgeous amethyst colour, isn't it? They'd work brilliantly with this kit that we did. Yes, they really would with the, the Lucky Dip Gemstone. Yeah. Because you can take the links out as well, um, you can alternate them between the purple and the fuchsia, which is fabulous. So here come your details for the purple one one meter of the enamel brass wheat chain again it's six millimeters and that six millimeters refers to what it is across ways so you can make perfect little chokers couldn't you um even quite delicate mm. um watch straps i think if you maybe got some of our mother of pearl watch faces 12.95 to match that previous price so beautiful to get a meter of chain as well and as i say to have enamel it harks back to um some really beautiful antique jewellery for me, and Namal does. I really yes, love it. Yeah. It's quite unique, isn't it? Don't see a lot it of it. And also, um, watches and, um, you know, watch faces quite yeah. often were enamelled. They're beautiful, aren't nice. they? nice. And they make very, very sweet little rings as well, and you wouldn't need to make yeah. too many. And because it's got that articulation to it, you don't need to think about a clasp. You could just pop it over your finger and it'd be beautiful. Yeah, just join it up. Love that idea. Well done to everybody going for that. We're going to squeeze a few more products in before we say goodnight to you. Uh, so. Oh, Debbie, Debbie you are going to love this. Apologies Ooh, for that. look at that. Another bundle for you. Um, so lots of different colours. I'm immediately going to bring out this strand. Let's wait for your details to come up. As soon as those <laughs> details come on screen, remember you can purchase. These are gorgeous colours, Rob. Some of my favourites, the greens, aren't they? So you're getting a four-strand collection here. We've called it Woodland Lake. It's blue adventure nuggets. Blue adventure quite rare for us to have that. Wow. Uh, and then green, and then so it's all adventuring. You can see the different colours that we've got there. Huge, big um, slab nuggets here. So let's take you through. On the blue adventuring, you're getting 290 carats, completely natural. On the medium nuggets, which are these ones here, 380 carats, 250 carats on the darker green, and then 80 carats on the beautifully faceted leaf beads. They're all completely natural. They're divine in their colouring. Should be £17.80. So we're going to go out on a high tonight. It's Friday night. Thank you so much for joining us. We're going to go all the way down to £9.95. Immediately I take the two, the dark green and the light green, give them a twist pop them around my neck let's have a quick go at that you could do that with wire really easily big toggle clasp on there and look at the huge look that you're getting it's gorgeous isn't it i love green it's so flattering yeah, isn't it green it is i love green what would you do with this bundle um i'd probably pop in some of the ametrine oh yeah and Lush. then um just layer it up lots and lots of layers because it looks so good when you took it out and put it on the desk yeah there, all together it just looked gorgeous all mixed up together and you can but see that these um, nuggets are top drilled so we could do yeah. the exact same thing couldn't we that yeah. you just shown us yeah. earlier in the hour fabulous texture in there and and color so and as well these little delicate together. leaves you, you're really into your arts and crafts aren't you uh, yeah be perfect yeah perfect absolutely perfect lovely you're getting exactly 1000 carats for under £10.
That's a that's a penny a carrot, isn't it? <laughs> Absolutely amazing. A wonderful stash builder. I'm going to take it. I'm going to bring this over to you, Deb, and let's have a little Ooh, look. Have a close Remember look. the French wire? I think it's still available. So have a little look on the website. Ooh, Deb. I, don't, I haven't seen. See we the don't blue. get much blue no. adventuring. Do you have, to have a little look at that, I my love. Ooh. Wow, that's really nice. There's really intense blues in there. They're beautiful, aren't they? It's kind of yeah. like a little bit of a soda light, but a softer soda light. That's what I thought light. it was when you picked it up, but it hasn't got the the white sort of marbling in there. So it's... Oh, yeah. Gorgeous, but gorgeous, like gorgeous. Thank you so much for joining us, Deb. Do you know when you're back on our screens? Um, soon. 23rd. 23rd, okay. We are back live tomorrow at 8am. Um, you can watch all the repeats overnight. Our 18. French wire is still available. FWGC94, £19.95. and pence. Lots of you have got that in baskets. It's such a versatile wire. It's beautiful as well. Uh, do join us again live at 8am on Saturday morning. It's Challenge Weekend. Ellen is going to be joining you then. And I'll see you on Sunday night. Thanks, Deb. Thanks, Martha. <laughs>